Hey, I'm Cable East Time. We're going to be playing You Will Die Here Tonight. Ooh, promises, promises game. I've been disappointed before. <laughs> Apparently, this is like a zombie <laughs> game, I think, that takes a lot of oh. inspiration from Resident Evil time. I'm going to use the gamepad, oh. even though it didn't recommend it to me, because I feel like it's going to be more of a gamepad game. <laughs> but if I recall correctly from the store page time, not only does it take inspiration from that, but also dying is like a part of it, as the name would imply. Oh, like, what if you are the zombie? Well, I think it's more like you play a character and if they die, they're in there as another zombie, but like you can help the next character get further along by completing things or something like that. Oh, I see. It kind of so reminded like... me of, do you remember Zombie U, the game Zombie U that released on the Wii U? Um, not, I don't think so. Well, the gimmick for that was you played as a survivor that had like uh, some handler over some like hand, some headset or something. But if you died in that, your character would get back up as a zombie wearing your backpack with all of your gear, and then you would take control of a different survivor that could kill that zombie and get that stuff back in a literal corpse run. <laughs> um, I didn't like it in that game because they just kind of treated that new character like they were always there and never acknowledged that the first one died, but I think this one handles it better, maybe. I, I haven't read the store page in like a month, so we'll see. Let's yeah, find out. Hopefully. Time. Die. Well, there's the Resident Evil inspiration. Hear that? <laughs> yeah. That's coming right through. Look at this Resident <laughs> Evil game! Yeah, that's a Resident Evil character, all right. Uh, Dr. Catherine Olsen, you don't look like a doctor. You look like a security <laughs> force, perhaps some kind of special <laughs> police unit member. Yeah, yeah, you don't look like a doctor at all. Gloomy little building. I'll never get used to this. It's my first day at Ares headquarters. I should report to the captain in his office. Speak with Captain Charles mm. Xavier. He's in here in the janitor's closet, I think, right? Yeah. This isn't the janitor's closet. <laughs> this is... Oh, the janitor's closet is really swanky, actually. Look at the star's vest she's wearing. <laughs> yeah. Look at this. Uh, the, uh, Specialist Mike Kelly. Yeah, I'm Mike. I do cyber ellipses. Fill in the blank. <laughs> oh my god, you're a very open guy whose name I already have forgotten. The desk of Lieutenant Eric Downs, trophies for marksmanship and eligible bachelorship are displayed prominently. A silver medal for karate has been hidden poorly behind them. He, he has a trophy for eligible bachelorship? Hey, leave my secondary desk alone. That's my cyber <laughs> karate diplomat. <laughs> Diplomacy, you're not supposed to see. Desk. This is Red Herb. <laughs> yeah. The desk of Lieutenant Ashley Kowalski. What appears to be a rare plant sits next to the keyboard. Mm. What are you? Why are you getting my business, Mike Kelly? Aren't you typing <laughs> something up? What are you rifling around her desk for? Her diary? I didn't pick up her diary. Ellipses? Daggers <laughs> shooting out of her eyes? Yet. She doesn't even keep it there. <laughs> How do you know where her diary mm. is, a specialist Mike Kelly? <laughs> Judo chop, she says, hitting him in the neck and he just flops <laughs> over. He just immediately passes out. <laughs> what are you doing messing with that water cooler, he says, getting all pissed off. Uh, this probably isn't like the places you worked before. People don't stand around a water cooler and chit-chat. We're kind of hardcore. I was getting some water like you use a water cooler for. We're hardcore here. That's not water, that's vodka. <laughs> I was getting some vodka like you get like you use a vodka cooler for. Well, in that case, carry on. I'm busy writing my article about cyberspace. <laughs> Sergeant Javier Rodriguez. Look at him leaning on his desk like he's a goddamn <laughs> Wesker or something. Yeah. Look at how cool he is. Hola, Dr. Olsen. I know your rank is informal, but I've given you the desk closest to the Capitan. Oh. Thank you, Sargant. I know you've been his right hand for a long time. Have a look at the memo on your desk before you head in. It may be underneath the cupcake Lieutenant Kowalski baked for you. He's got... A pair of brass knuckles just kind of sitting on his desk there, it looks like. Well, that's how you know he's a tough, cool guy that punches people in the face. <laughs> and when you're ready, the captain is waiting. Or a weak old man who can't fight with his bare knuckles anymore. What a loser. Everybody <laughs> laugh. Point and laugh at Knuckles over here. Haha, <laughs> he needs a weapon to fist fight people. Shut up, Knuckles. You don't see any weapons on my desk. I just kill things with my <laughs> dagger eyes, my glares. Mmm. I've acquired cupcake with a delicious blue frosting. That looks like a photograph of a cupcake. <laughs> yeah, that's how you know it's real. <laughs> that's how they prove that the cupcake was on her desk. They took a picture of it. 
You acquire the welcome to Ares note. I was going to probably be a lot of notes to read. This game was yeah, if it's a... advertised as being pretty short, or at least like, uh, I think six hours, but if it's in the style of Resident Evil, I will probably do a bad job of getting through it. <laughs> uh, mode with the best of... Oh, th- made with the best of intentions. <laughs> a bit dry. <laughs> mode. Mode. Various notes collected by Ares members. Can I please read one? Dr. Olsen, it is with great pride that we welcome you to the ranks of Ares Division. As the first civilian to be added to the team, we know that your contributions and research in the field of advanced biological weapons will be invaluable. Like, really invaluable, it turns out, actually. (laughs) We are a long way from academia, but the nature of your work, of our work, requires continuous evolution to new threats. As you know, okay, well, this whole next paragraph shouldn't exist, but fine. (laughs) <laughs> As you know, says the maid, Ares takes an on assignments that regular police departments lack the resources to handle. I'm told that you've undergone additional and classified training to ensure your readiness for field work, but please proceed with extreme caution. Prioritizing your safety at the expense of anybody else on the team is now one of my standing orders. <laughs> okay. Hey, hey, uh, <laughs> y- you see one of your teammates in danger? He's about to get munched by zombies. Just ignore him. All of his screams for help. Just, 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 uh, tune those out. I just look at his, the door to his office and over the f- top and it just says every man for himself. <laughs> <laughs> I would appreciate you not putting me in a position where I have no choice but to follow it. Good hunting, Captain Vincent Charles. <laughs> wow, it's good to know that I can't rely on any of you. Thank you, Captain. <laughs> I'm not even going to talk to you. I'm going to go wander this way and see if I can find more cupcakes. <laughs> Briefing room. Whoa, that was a lot of that was a lot of things. Luck, look. Oh. Oh, you can. Oh, that's I can't believe I can even manage this that well. This is a wide ass <laughs> keyhole. <laughs> yeah, it is. Okay, it's safe. The specialist, whatever the hell your name was, it's safe in here. I checked. It, you can't even do that with modern keyholes, I don't think. No, we just go <laughs> off of old, like, big, thick-ass iron keys with the two little teeth on them <laughs> here at the station. That's just how we work. The table is covered in documents, including full blueprints for Breckenridge Hall. Is that where we are? Or is it this next assignment? No, Breckenridge is right next to fucking Ham Palace. Get with it. <laughs> Ever see that in Blade 2 where they had like a broth named fucking Ham Palace? That was funny. <laughs> That's a random thing that just popped in my head. A board with details about the upcoming mission. The suspect is believed to have fled to Breckenridge Hall, an abandoned estate to the wilderness of upstate New York. Oh my god. So, so like a Resident Evil mansion. Oh man. It sounds like quite the mansion. The slide projector waits patiently. A soft fan is heard and a beam of light cuts through the dusty air. Watch the mission briefing. Sure. I suppose. I'd like to know what my mission is. Sure. It's just a bunch of slides from the captain's most recent vacation. <laughs> An initial slide displays the Ares division insignia as well as the date. Yeah, we're in the 96. We're in 96, kid. Yeah. I was just a little baby. <laughs> the target is prominently displayed with a last known photograph. It appears to be some form of employee identification. The name is Jeffrey Monroe, in case I don't mention that. He is the suspect, it turns out. The crime is detailed. A merciless familicide perpetrated by the target with no known motive. The victims were Sandra, Elliot, and Jeremy Monroe. Oh, that's unfortunate. They're wanted for murder. An actual baby. Well, you could say that. He looks like a weird alien, like, corpse creature from here, but that's fine. (laughs) He does look like a weird alien. (laughs) An intelligence report details the area to which the target is believed to have fled. Breckenridge Hall, an abandoned mansion in upstate New York. Speculation is offered that the target may have stolen a classified substance from his employer, a major pharmaceutical company. Oh my god, it's Paracel! Oh, he got the T-virus. Unfortunate. Whether an exposure to it may be responsible for his sudden psychosis is left unsaid, but the connection of private interests to this mission is made clear. If possible, the sample is to be recovered intact. Big Pharma wants their super drug back. I just noticed the, like, glimmery shimmy sham on the table of a note that I can pick up. Oops. (laughs) The presence of this potentially dangerous sample is the reason that you, Dr. Cat... Wait, this briefing was made just for me? No one's here to show it to me. 
<laughs> Dr. Catherine Olsen have been assigned to Ares and placed provisionally in command. I'm in command. Oh, I just showed up. Wait, they just... And I'm a civilian. They, they just put us on this team and we're in command of it? Hello? I'm like a first day on the job civilian and they put me in command of this group? <laughs> what? Doesn't I should just be here as like a specialist advisor or something. Yeah. The final <laughs> note informs that I shouldn't even go there. I should just talk to people over radios. The final note informs the team to rendezvous on the rooftop helipad at 0400. Now get out of here, skedaddle. It's lunchtime, says the final slide. Ares mission briefing. Is this the same no, information just I just read? read the same thing. It's the same. Yeah. Yanorama, I hate reruns. Know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Let's see here. I guess I'll just go home. The elevator doors are shut. That oh no. yes, you have to press you have to press a button to open them, <laughs> you dumb idiot. They won't open. They won't budge. Level O2 directory for Ares headquarters. Offices west, training range north, laboratory south. Hmm. Hmm. Fascinating. Check out that laboratory. Do you have any T virus I can huff real quick on my way? <laughs> Hello, not Joe Valentine, and also not <laughs> what's her name, Rebecca Chambers, I think. It's like a melding <laughs> of those two characters, I think. <laughs> Lieutenant Ashley Kowalski, Dr. Olson, nice to finally have you here. We still need to use this room as an infirmary, but I've set most of it up for your experiments. Why don't you go say hello to Henry the Rat? Why... why is... Uh, why are you using the laboratory as an infirmary? Why does your special forces, like, headquarters building not just have its own infirmary? <laughs> they're, they're trying really hard to process the question you just asked him. <laughs> they just kind of shoved a hospital <laughs> bed in the corner. <laughs> no, it's an infirmary. Look, we're not allowed to get more than one person hurt at a time. In our <laughs> every man for himself policy group. I don't know, okay, we'll figure it I out. Guess I guess they expect most of them just to die because they <laughs> expect them to come back because no one's going to help abandoned. each other. Yet. <laughs> Hello, Henry. Hello, Henry. I'm going to briefly inspect you for... <gasps> Ow! Henry! That bite nearly broke my skin and my heart. What a jerk. The specimen you procured is dangerous. It attacked me immediately. Henry! That's impossible! He only bites things that are pure evil. <laughs> hmm. Hmm. Every member of the team has handled him without incident, even Mike. Wait, he didn't smell <laughs> compassion on you, did he? Because that also sets him off. So he gets set off by evil and compassion? <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure he'll get... <laughs> I'm sure he'll get used to you. Maybe he's hungry. Take this first aid kit and feed it to him. You acquire the first aid kit. I need to use this entire first aid kit for this uh, rat bite that didn't break the skin. <laughs> Just pop it open. There's a sandwich in there. <laughs> Owen, go see the captain after you get patched up. He wants to talk to you about how I miss you. Mm. I gotta dab some alcohol on that and wrap it up tight in a bandage. <laughs> what the hell? Cupcake. Where the hell? Oh, uh, wait, uh, wide open healing menu. Oh. What the? It, a rat bit me and suddenly I'm dying? <laughs> Fine, I'll use it. I'm in red. Well, no, I was already red. I wouldn't have used it if I'd known that. Uh, you had Wait, half how a do heart. I know when I'm hurt then? I assume you have three hits because you've got a full heart, half a heart, and then. Oh, is it half a heart? I thought I was going by color because usually in Resident Evil, when it's red, that means you're about to die. Yeah, your heart was like half. Well, it was a rat. <laughs> It's a really strong rat. He's very powerful. I just walk up and like jab him in the head with one of these bullets and he's like, Ugh! he just falls over. <laughs> <laughs> what the f- he, he acts like you shot him with me. <laughs> I'm really good at jabbing people with bullets is all she says. <laughs> Look around, aim, fire with left, fire with right. Reload, raise melee weapon is a different button. That's kind of weird. I would rather just equip a melee weapon, but I guess we're going ahead and- Whoa. <laughs> Do a combo on him. Oh, loud noises scare me. 
I give him the suplex. I'm gonna give him a German suplex real quick. Right, come. <laughs> whoa, he's too wide. I can't get him. Whoa, buddy. Oh, whoa, trigger discipline. <laughs> like, Shit. Whoa, never sneak up on someone with a gun in their hand, Doc. Say it's first. I automatically spin around with it in the firing range. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Welcome to Aries. Shooting people is an important part of our job. Every man for himself. <laughs> <laughs> Grab a pistol from that storage box and we'll see if you remember anything from basic training. I don't. I thought it was a civilian. I think that they they like gave you a little bit of training for this mission, I guess. Sorry, Doc, you're not allowed in there. Where am I getting the gun then? Neither am I. Not anymore. I'm in command of this mission. Excuse me. Well, I'm in command of the mission, but not the headquarters. That's the Capitan. Yes. Don't forget, dog, if you run out of ammo, you can always find more in those storage boxes, and I like to leave them all over the place. You leave boxes of live ammunition sitting in random locations throughout your mission zones? Don't worry, we have tons. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, oh my god. I'm back in shotgun. Uh, okay, so... Okay, so that because it's mid-range, this because it's close range, and that because it's... Oh, baby! <laughs> <laughs> well, no, this is mid. They're both mid range. Whatever. I have my guns Whatever. now. Bang! It won't let me shoot. It won't let me. It won't let me shoot. Bang! Bang. Reload bang, bang, bang. first. Yeah, it's bang. not fun when I'm putting it. Where you? Wait, hold on. How are you Okay. Okay. Whatever. <laughs> Great work, Doc. Step in front of that paper guy and we'll get started. It's what he gets for, like, whipping around and putting the gun directly in your face. That's correct, the thing you just said. What the f- what the f- What? Oh, okay. The number one rule of guns is to point them at somebody. Give it a shot, okay? Just <laughs> to point them at somebody. Take aim with left trigger and fire with right trigger. The- Dang. The shards will hit with more moreness if you aim them. <laughs> but it wastes time. I hate it. This guy seems very well trained. Oh god, now I'm aiming with the right stick. That's weird. I mean, I guess it's normal, but it feels weird that I'm switching from moving with the left and being top down to aiming with the right trigger. Or the right it stick. It is kind of weird. Bang! I'm gonna get you right here in your third heart. Right in the shoulder. Get out of here. <laughs> Why are these red dots? What's that about? I guess to disarm people? I don't know. The, the shoulder hearts, a very important uh, piece of human anatomy. I don't understand this fantasy d police station where they have, like, disarming as part of their training. That never <laughs> happens. What? <laughs> bang, 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 no, no, bang, bang. No, no, it means disarming them as in shooting their arm off. Press X to reload, and don't forget that shooting at people makes them upset, so they'll keep coming at you while you do. Are you stupid? <laughs> Are you just a stupid person? <laughs> why why do they allow you to have guns, sir? <laughs> I don't like that you're a part of this force. Can I can I question who gets to come along <laughs> on this trip with me? I don't know if I want to go on vacation with this guy. <laughs> Those paper targets are horrible wrestlers, so I'll replace them. Press A to break my grab. What? what? Gladly, I don't believe you've read my file, Lieutenant. I'm judo trained! <laughs> yeah. Put up your guard with Bang. left and Bang! <laughs> yeah, I was gonna do the same thing. <laughs> Put up your guard, left LB, and hit me, right trigger, as not hard as you can. I'm gonna hit you as hard as I can. Uh. This is weird. <laughs> You're pretty quick, Doc. Think fast. The more times you let a target grab you, the more cardio it takes to break the hold. And cardio <laughs> is for losers. <laughs> no. <laughs> 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 Finally, don't forget my cool rhyme. If you got no gun, you should probably run. Pretend you're out of bullets and try escaping. B right now. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> what a weird combat system. I look forward to forgetting how to do all of that the first time I get into a fight. <laughs> wow. For a doctor, you're pretty good at killing things. I really hope they don't let him go on missions. I'm not that kind of, there's no way he's not going. He's going to be like the guy who shows up and he's going to be like wandering around outside the police station turned into a zombie, you know what I mean? <laughs> I'm not that kind of doctor. That's what I just said. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> I never want to talk to you again. <laughs> hey, 
Make sure you put any heavy weaponry back before you leave the range, Doc. They put me in charge of that warning because I kept doing it. Okay. You, you know, sometimes you just, like, put a bazooka in your pocket and forget about it. Sometimes you just walk out with a bazooka in your pants and they're like, whoa, <laughs> this is very inappropriate. <laughs> Not even impressive, it's just grotesque. Go back home. <laughs> just go home early. <laughs> <laughs> just get just go just get out of here and we don't want to see you anymore i hate looking at your face you're fired by the way but then i kept <laughs> showing up and they wouldn't say anything about it so i guess i still work here <laughs> they kept paying me oh you're fucked I mean, he's got he's got a chessboard in, in his office so you know he's smart <laughs> whichever side of this board that you care the most about you're screwed captain <laughs> Whoa! Oh my God! A chessboard. There appears to be a game in progress. Been stuck on my next move for ages. Whoever I'm playing against on the other end of that hundred hours free thing is one hell of a strategy. What? The, what the hell are you talking I about? Don't have any idea what he means. What? This is like an app on his computer. He's just playing against somebody. <laughs> my remote is just sending him the moves. <laughs> I guess. A liquor cabinet is stocked with a variety of spirits from around the world, likely collected during foreign operations. So they stole. So they're stolen then. Uh, no. It, when he's supposed to be overseeing the operation, he just leaves and buys local liquor. Is what happens. <laughs> I'm sure you've got. You guys have got it. Uh, there's a liquor <laughs> store like like two doors down. So. <laughs> I will take this key. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> Touch that key again and I'll put you through this window, Colonel. You must be out of your god goddamn mind. <laughs> I'm a colonel? I thought I was a civilian. I thought, yeah, what? I'm a doctor. Good to see you again, Catherine, the colonel of the civilian. Your full name. <laughs> I'm told the rest of your training went well and that anything else about your work here is on a need-to-know basis. Dr. Colonel Civilian Catherine, yeah. Yeah, get it right. I appreciate your taking the initiative to check in with the rest of the team. Humility and leadership goes a long way here. Being a civilian who automatically comes in as a senior officer has caused a bit of friction, but the people here are professionals. Are they? Even if you outrank me, he says with a growly mean face. I want us to understand <laughs> each other. This is still my unit. Without me in charge, people start dying, and we're okay with that because every man for himself. <laughs> so when I tell you to do something, you do it. And if I tell you to just stay there and die, you do it. <laughs> that said, this one should be quick and clean. Ready to start the mission? I'm really good at telling people to just stand there and die. I do it all the time. Well, I think I've done everything, so yeah, let's start this mission. You won't let me take the armory key, so... I'll probably come back here at some point. Probably. The game probably ends at the headquarters. Whoa! FM... Whoa! <laughs> it's not quite an FMV. I was going to say FMV, but it's very clearly not FMV. This was made in a yeah. computer. <laughs> it kind of looks similar, though, all the way. It threw me off for like a half schmegan, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What a mansion! Bang! You guys are pointing at each other's backs. Wow, you guys just <laughs> look forward to someone dying. Oh my god, it's a ghost! Bang, 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 Maybe it's six lives to do it all, and then, like, the character I started as is the final one that, like, finishes it. Yeah, something like that, I guess. My head feels like it's going to explode. Oh, disappointed it didn't. Oh, well, Captain. Sergeant. Eric, whatever your rank was, I forget. <laughs> hey, he doesn't actually have a rank. He's just Eric. They just bring him along. He's like the local hick that stockpiled guns are like, he'd probably be useful in a survival situation. <laughs> this is Lieutenant Kowalski. Does anyone copy? Ares Command, do you read me? This was not the plan. Uh, I survived, and that usually doesn't happen. I've got to find the team, and Moreau could be hiding anywhere. Weird. What a man to that lamp. I hate it. It lit it up right before we were knocked out. Just go over there and bat it off the table like a cat. Is this a save? 
probably it's safe. It's red like a save thing would be in a Resident That's Evil. <laughs> you will die here tonight. Anything you find might help the others escape. Anything you find might help the others escape. <laughs> Something is clipped to the back of the note. Wow. <laughs> Those who do not learn from history are doomed to repeat it. It's a photo of Ares vision. <laughs> Why is this image that was drawn look photoshopped? It, it looks weird, yeah. <laughs> it's because the background is all blurred out. It just looks weird. And the foreground. <laughs> like, the ground is blurry, too. It's strange. <laughs> Those who do not learn from history... <laughs> so Monroe knows who we are. And if he knows I'm a medic, he probably split me off from the others intentionally. Whoa! Dang. Stay back, Lamp! That <laughs> shot could have been fatal. I have to get over there. How did those doors open? No, no, it's haunted. Oh, scary ghost mansion. What about it? <laughs> Can we just leave? Oh, uh, maybe I'll try in a second. The suit bears a massive hammer, oh baby. A pair of immovable gauntlets holds it firmly in place. Oh. Okay, bye. It looks a little big uh, for you to use anyway. Okay, goodbye. An imposing entryway. An unseen force prevents the door from opening. Oh, uh, you... This door shouldn't be here. We blew it up. It doesn't make sense. Mm -hmm. Whoa! Stay back, door! <laughs> Go into shooting mode. I'm not allowed to. It's like, no. It wouldn't let me go into shooting mode to <laughs> kill the door. The Sarge trained us to watch out for traps, but I have to risk it. Someone needs my help. Oh, I have control again. Okay. <laughs> oh, we have this nice, lovely spread on the table. We have on offer uh, tea, disgusting wine, meat, <laughs> meat, meat, <laughs> meat, and meat with a side of ball and some kind of fruit, maybe? Grapefruit, maybe, perhaps. This all just looks like meat to me. I'm <laughs> assuming this different like stuff, meat. but it all just looks like meat. <laughs> hmm. Oh, if only I knew how to read these old clocks. <laughs> An imposing grandfather clock. The hour stands at 12 a.m. Like, on the dot? Oh, I guess if it's standing, it's probably broken, stupid clock. Haha, <laughs> you're dumb. The fire casts an ominous but reassuring glow. How is it... Both ominous and reassuring, what? Because it's spooky, but also is comfy wumpy. <laughs> the porcelain within appears fragile and priceless. Hello? A locked door. The large keyhole can be peered through easily. Hello? Hmm. Okay. Goodbye. Nothing in there. Not me. Hello? Well, here we go. Whoops. Uh-oh. Somebody slipped and fell. Heck, I was too late. Wait, is that... Is that his diary? I would love to know his secrets. Well, he's dead. Womp, womp, womp. It's Monroe. What a dweeb. Okay, mission accomplished. I'm out of here. Every man for himself, <laughs> she says, screaming and running to the nearest window and jumping out. <laughs> Just diving right <laughs> through. <laughs> Something is in the crook of his arm. Red Clover Book. Supernatural Sightings of the American Settlers. A history book? That photo in the main hall referred to learning from history. Hmm. Hmm. Watch him not actually be dead. No, he's definitely going to turn into a zombie in a second. Elise, identify yourself. Bang, 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 <laughs> bang. Oh. Oh, God. Oh, God. Hi. No, get out of here. There, I got him. Hello, zombie. I wonder if the ending would have been different if I had let her die, like, immediately. <laughs> I've never had to kill somebody. Just, uh, uh, the first enemy. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't even flinch with that first shot during that goddamn House of the Dead shooting sequence. You see that? <laughs> that sounded like some kind of a mechanism. I think his mm. brain held the key to some kind of device in this mansion. Well, mission accomplished. Later. <laughs> Job well done. Job well... I can't reload. Job well... I, as a special forces... The not stars. I'm a <laughs> stairs member, everybody. I didn't bring any extra ammo, apparently. Never mind, I found some bullets just in this little thing. <laughs> yeah. 
That's cool. where I keep ammo in my mansion. Do I want to reload though? Because what if reloading means that she uses the bullets and then the next character won't have the bullets? <laughs> I guess I could kill things and hope that makes it easier for the next one, right? Yeah, I guess. Whatever they did to this guy, it gave him more resistance to pain and shock than any drug or procedure I've ever seen. Ew. Absolutely disgusted, says her face. Yes, half of his head was missing, and he was, like, still coming at you, so... And then she's like, well, repress that memory, says her next face. <laughs> Engineering this kind of biohazard is way beyond what someone like Monroe should be capable of. It's almost like it's impossible making zombies. At least on this scale, zombie ants I can buy, but zombie people? That's just stupid. No, can't be. Hello? Anybody Are there any help? zombies up to some kind of mischief in this room? Do I have to report you? Oh, look at that shotgun that I can pick up and get squished by the ceiling. Oh, baby, can't <laughs> wait for that to happen. <laughs> it's fine. When you pick up the shotgun and get squished by the ceiling, then the next guy can come and get the shotgun. I'm gonna be a... The hell is this character's <laughs> name? This character's sandwich. Uh... I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Of course I want this bullet. I look forward to sabotaging the next character. An ornate vase. Break it. Break it? Break it. Break no. it. Break it. Vases are for breaking. Whoa, baby. Oh, here we go. Yep. You didn't break my vase, also known as my <laughs> d phylactery, he says. <laughs> my literal soul jar. <laughs> movement. That sounds like movement. Well, I better hurry up and break this vase. <laughs> Aha! You should just play him again, his eyes close again. <laughs> <laughs> he just closes, yeah. <laughs> the vase shatters into worthless ceramic shards. Take that! This is now worth less, even though it was just this but in a shape before. <laughs> there were three bullets in there, it looked like. Hello! Mm. Body on the floor is also gone. He ate it, just swallowed it like a snake. <laughs> He's double the size now, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Shadow remains. What are you talking about? Bullets on the floor? What are you talking about? No, they went into your inventory already. When you broke what? it, it popped up at the corner. Uh, <sighs> nine millimeter <gasps> bullets. I don't care. I'm going to die here tonight. <laughs> What's the matter? God, oh, this chest is probably bolted from the other side. It's not that big. Just put it in your pocket. No, just smash it on the ground. Break whatever's inside and be like, oh, I can't use this. This was a plus nine sword, but now it's like a bunch of pieces. <laughs> I somehow broke a plus nine sword just by throwing it on the ground. <laughs> OK, so I need an arrow for this, I guess. And mm. I need a key for that, which means now I must venture into the room where Monroe was laying on the floor. No, no. Oh, my God. Monroe, you're not here to sweep me up my feet, are you? Whoa. Hello? <laughs> oh, okay. Well, uh, whoa! I don't think this blood stain was here before, so I think he went this way. Yeah, he probably went this way. He probably went into the meat room where they eat meat. Look at all this meat oh. on offer. Very all kinds of different flavors and variations. He, he must not have been very hungry though, because he left it all there. This meat's cold, gross. He said, <laughs> pinching his nose and leaving a one-star review on Yelp as he left. I only eat fresh meat as a zombie. This is Dr. Catherine Olson. Do any surviving members of Ares please respond? Dr. Olson, who are you again? Uh, I mean, thank God. Are you all right? Hey, I'm a surviving member of Ares. Did she just hear a click? She hangs up on you. Every man for herself. <laughs> she sits on the other side. Ares, which is, I've just realized, a constellation and therefore composed of stars. <laughs> oh my god, I'm trapped in a subterranean laboratory beneath a library. Well, you found that quick. <laughs> I believe some kind of pathogen is being manufactured here. I know, I'm pretty sure I've run into a few of the unlucky recipients. Fascinating. Fascinating. If you can locate me, we may be able to untangle this together. Drag one of them with you. I'm looking for everybody, Dr. Olson, but I'm on my way. I'll just gather up the bodies as I go and throw them <laughs> over my shoulder. <laughs> Just walk in the room with a whole pile of bodies <laughs> on your shoulder. Damn, character whose name I already forgot again. You're really strong. Kowalski, I think. Why, why am I not able to keep her name in my brain? <laughs> Hello? It's probably because I already know this game intends to kill these characters, right? 
Mm, yeah. The game's literally called You Will Die Here Tonight, so it's like, why do I care <laughs> what their name is? They're going to be dead. The large key... No, I want to look... I want to peep through its large-ass keyhole. Mm. One of these should be I do this, but then I, when I leave the keyhole, I'm getting bitten by a zombie. There's a zombie right behind you, yeah. Like, I leave it, I'm just... I'm in the middle of being gnawed on. I'm like, oh, <laughs> I didn't even notice. It's just like a chewing on your neck. <laughs> Oh, locked door, mm. lodge key. Oh my god. Everything's locked in this stupid mansion. Who lives here? Who locks all the doors in their own mansion? A lot of locked doors. Time, when you're going through your house and you're unlocking every door to like use the bathroom, go to the kitchen, don't you think like maybe there's a better way? No. No, you gotta keep them all locked at all times. It's not safe otherwise. When you go to your personal funeral parlor room in your mansion <laughs> with the piano in it, don't you think like maybe I should keep this one locked? This is kind of weird, I think. <laughs> no, that one stays unlocked. A portrait of Clara Breckenbridge. Or Breckenridge. The butterfly brooch she wears offsets the paleness of her skin. Mm. She seems to stare through the lens and then beyond it into my deep soul. She can see right through me. She can see the real me. Oh. Inside I'm ugly. Ugly <laughs> like her. <laughs> A portrait of Roberta Breckenridge. The bumblebee brooch she wears is crafted precisely for her frail little tiny child body. <laughs> she refuses to smile. She's like, no. no. You can see it in subtitles with her thought bubble. No. <laughs> you have acquired the OB research notes. Yeah, I like to keep my research notes on my piano. Do a little reading while I'm while I'm playing. Complete the notes by finding additional pages. Oh, God. Um... July 1896. <laughs> a storm has extinguished the inferno that sought to consume my home, but nothing can save my daughter or my beloved. Nor the unborn child that was within her. Lured to the ballroom and locked within it as the flames roared, Clara and Roberta have paid the ultimate price for this disastrous en endeavor. That was 1996. This is 100 years ago? It is 1996. That's 100 years ago, yeah. Because it cannot be known... Uh, which of these urchins is responsible until their conspiracy is broken? I must render a suffering unto them that is absolute and unyielding. The basement stores have been repurposed. Somebody bought this mansion and was like using it and just kind of like left this funeral room how it was. I like it the way it looks. For Keep it like this. No, <laughs> shut up. Keep it like For this. For a hundred years? No, shut up. No, this is family, isn't it? <laughs> Wasn't his name Breckenridge? Monroe no, he was Monroe. Monroe was his last name. Was it? I think it was. I remember the name Breckenridge. Uh, the... Why do I not have the heckin'... You had the... Why do I not have the you? debriefing... Was it? Not debriefing, but the briefing. Why do I not have the briefing in the actual game? It wasn't under the small notes? No, no well, they no, it removed no. it from me. I just don't have it anymore. Hmm. I'm pretty sure Breckenridge was mentioned. Oh, hold on. It was Breckenridge Hall, the manor. Oh, is that so it? So that okay. might be where you were thinking of. Oh, uh, okay. For some reason, my I just put his Breckenridge as his last name, but I guess that's just the name of the mansion. No, I think his last name was Monroe. What's his first name then, Time? I don't remember. Something with a J, maybe? Um, Gacy? <laughs> Galleria? <laughs> Galleria. I said a J, not a G. <laughs> George? <laughs> Jalleria. <laughs> you did say G. <laughs> there he is, Monroe. Monroe, you don't have to die here tonight. We can patch you up, but you have to surrender. <laughs> Mines. He isn't going to listen, is he? Oh, no. Time to fight or run away. Well, Time to fight. you'd be a huge coward run away, so I'm going to fight. Oh, I have to aim with this now. Bang! Bang, 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 bang! Oh, no! Get out of here! <laughs> oh, no! I'm trying really hard to kill you with my gun. Why do you take so much ammo? Oh, his, uh, his brain's a little... What is this lost plug of sh... Get out of here. <laughs> Die! Wow! There what we the go. Holy f***ing holy sh... I'm also oh, infected, I guess. In infected, and you have five minutes to live now. Well, that sucks. Get ready for me to s try to go through this. If Monroe's dead, we should extract. I have no idea what we'll report, but saving the time. The team is all that matters. <laughs> he searched the corpse. 
You have acquired parasitic sample 1540. The sample, our secondary objective. If whatever happened to Monroe is connected to the liquid in this vial, I need to handle it very carefully. I wish I could run. Oh no, I dropped it. And shatters on the ground. <laughs> Dang it, I snorted it by accident. Oh, I hate when I do that. <laughs> Can I run? Can I please hurry up? Oh, I should probably reload. Yeah, this there's hard. on the table there, too. Well, it's not hard. It's just... <laughs> like, it took 90 gazillion bullets to shoot him. Yeah. Okay. Well, he was a boss. He had a health bar. Yeah, he was a cool guy like that. Just do my lazy ass <laughs> James Thunderfield kick on these bases. It's a book. Hold on, let me read this entire book with my countdown. <laughs> no, it pauses when you go into stuff. Advanced Biogenetic Engineering, a scientific publication on the practical applications of genome sequencing and related topics. This doesn't look like the kind of cover a scientific uh, journal on bioengineering would have. I'm pretty sure that I'm f if I... I'm pretty sure I'm just screwed with that countdown. So unless I can find some kind of cure for this infection, I'm not going to use that health kit. Yeah, I don't know if the health kit will like fix that or extend it or anything. Does it say if you go in the inventory? I guess it's not in the inventory, is it? It's no, it's in like why yeah, yeah. and it doesn't pause. Thanks, ghost, for closing that on me. <laughs> Depending on my heart, oh. the extravagant frame suggests that it was moved from another location. The anatomy is pretty accurate. Don't make uh -oh. me shoot you in the face! Get the hell out of here! <laughs> there, I got him. That guy only had two shots with the, with the frag! <laughs> the the non-boss ones are much easier to kill. Large, dusty-ass uh, dump truck trunk. Open it, I will. Oh no, Mimic! You acquire- <laughs> <laughs> He's getting chewed on, just chomped on. The next <laughs> character comes in, she's just like half sticking out of it. Aw, oh, jeez. I wonder if that's a real treasure chest, they say. Getting excited about the loot and ignoring the legs sticking out of it. The next character comes in and both of them are half hanging out of it. You acquire the Yellow Lotus book, which is a philosophical treatise on the obligations and limitations of military violence. Oh. Oh my god. I wish I had a hustle button. I wish I had a mild, like, jazzercise jogging button. Why are these completely unrelated books, like, theme named with each other? Because I'm probably going to have to find a shelf to put them in for a secret door to open. <laughs> like, in this library section. Yeah, oh. probably. <laughs> shelf contains volumes on language. It's exactly what I said, time. Don't you feel silly for saying that right before I found the room. <laughs> An etched stone that outlines the contents of the library. General topics, philosophy, religion, social sciences, language, science, technology, the arts, literature, history. Once returned, three travelers will guide the way. Three travelers, okay. like the three books that I have. So we've got... I've got a historical, history. scientific, philosophical. Historical goes in 900. So let's just do that one first. Wherever 900 is, what the hell? Uh. Now I feel a time pressure. God damn it. I'm like rushing through, as you can tell. There we go. Book is missing. Oh, I hate being timed. <laughs> Look fits seamlessly into the empty space on the shelf of clicking sound is heard. One of them was 100. One, okay, well, which one time? A oh, I guess I could have just gone to it. Philosophy is 100. What's the other and one I have? Science uh, is 600. Or 500. 500. 100 and 500. 700, 500. Science! <laughs> 100 is philosophy. Here I come. I wish I had a hustle button. We're solving the game. Uh, what if I beat the game in the next three minutes time? <laughs> there, I did it. I bet you can't avoid being being bit by that guy. No, I just didn't mash hard enough, I think, when the first time I got grabbed by him. I maybe could have. I wasn't. I forgot that you had to mash A to get him off you, so I, like, screwed up. Yeah, I guess. I knew there was something about those books. Where does this lead? Let's find out, travelers. Are you ready, kiddos? When you're about to die, find like the 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 like most dead end possible. <laughs> hey, Olson, I'm fucking dying. Help! <laughs> I got here as soon as I could. I don't think they know that that's the thing that's happening. She's not acting like she's going to turn into a zombie. How'd you get down here? How did Wesker, you get down here? the girl, the experience, the game. Mm. It's good to see you, Lieutenant, she says, putting sunglasses on. I had faith you would beat the odds. <laughs> the odds. 
In most projections, the captain and I are the only survivors. Sometimes the sergeant, never your friend, unfortunately. Mm, <laughs> yep. She's evil, yeah. Projections, what are you talking about? If you set us up, you won't get away with it. The captain vouched for you. He said you had a good heart. He checked it. Like he personally <laughs> inspected it. Who are you? Why are you doing this? He looked at it and everything. Uh. It will be a long conversation, Lieutenant, and frankly, you talk too much. Your seven minutes are up. Bang. Whoops. Bang. Well, there, I did it. I got there without dying, everybody. Y y well, you I, didn't... I got to the scripted death sequence without dying from the infection or whatever. Yeah, you still had two minutes and 30 seconds left. I even did it, and she was like, oh, shit, you're not supposed to be here. <laughs> hmm, additional radio signals seem to remain available. With Monroe resurfaced, however, my instructions are to proceed immediately. Well, we shot his head clean off, so hopefully he's not going to come back again. No matter, the rest of them will render useful data. The Illumination time to do my, like, resource management side gig as Olsen before the next <laughs> character starts up. The Illuminations of that lamp was my signal to initiate the program. What is it doing here, of all places, mm. where the program is held? Good evening, Director. Ares has been sufficiently paralyzed. Proceed with mass termination protocol for all remaining members. This, it should be the computer from Courage the Cowardly Dog. <laughs> it's just, it's <laughs> just the computer. <laughs> just adequate elimination confirmed. Mass termination protocol initiated, you twit. <laughs> you twit, yeah. <laughs> Please retrieve the parasitic sample to complete final objective. Oh no, when I shot her, the glass broke. Whoops, that's fine. <laughs> Certainly. The parasitic sample should be located on this corpse. Like, probably in the wallet next to the dollar bills, if I had to check. <laughs> She's reaching for it and just, like, she turns into a zombie immediately and fights her. <laughs> the cupcake was genuinely appreciated. It was a little dry. Disgusting, but appreciated. There was no cream <laughs> filling, you fucking louse. What kind of cupcake doesn't have the cream filling? Come on. You search the corpse looking for frosting. <laughs> you got 17 bullets. You're wow. playing as evil girl now, I guess. I collected for all now. of my inventory. Wow. Oh, she has a, what the hell? She's <laughs> decked out. Look at all this. Oh, she has all these. She's got a tuned 9mm pistol. Oh. How do I switch? Oh, okay. She's got like a sh <laughs> Oh, I thought she had like 40 rounds for this. I was like, she's got a lot of ammo, too. No, just four. Um, I guess I will go ahead and rub my hand against this lovingly. The light <laughs> flickers as you focus on it. Possess unit parasite sample detected. Instructs you in place parasitic uh, parasite sample in fabricator drawer immediately. We would like you to deliver us, to deliver us this lost plugus sample, please. <laughs> uh, please, I need it. Enjoy. Maybe I took one sip. You don't know. The drawer closes sharply as the sample is placed. <laughs> Just a little sippy. The sample is processed with a steady rhythm of clicks and whirls and cartoony sound effects. <laughs> you acquire the ivy bag. Herbal. Oh, there's my frosting. The sample is processed. I believe our business is concluded. You get the sample, I get my cream filling. <laughs> Inaccurate payment is to be rendered following placement of IV bag on IV stand in southern part of room. I never said that this part of the deal. You don't get my cream filling. <laughs> I have altered the deal. Pray I do not alter it further. Does cream filling stay cream filling even after you've eaten it because it filled you up with cream? <laughs> yes. Have you ever considered this? That's definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Philosophical question for the ages. Oh my god, Olsen. I can't believe now is the time you came up with this. <laughs> there, I did it. I put, I just randomly clicked on that, and I didn't even know it was what I was supposed to mess with. I got it. He did it. Can't wait for the next kid, a member of the team to show up so I can just stick them with that and fill them with the cream filling that I want. You're going to go up to the computer, and it's going to say, okay, you did your thing, and I don't need you anymore, and then a gun, a hand with a gun is going to come out of the screen and just shoot you. You twit will be the last two words she hears. <laughs> The bag is hung like a horse, enough of this. Meet your end of the bargain, Director. I'm not one of your pathetic underlings. Look at this photograph. <laughs> Every time I do, it makes me laugh. What is the meaning of this? <laughs> How dare you deface me? I will not be threatened. <laughs> we had an agreement. My beautiful face. 
she's she's not, not in that in picture. That picture though, <laughs> she's not in there. She was just hired. Like she just brought on today. <laughs> you will die here tonight, Catherine. Roll credits. Anything you might find help might help the others escape. The others are dead. The sample was acquired. The mission was a success. I don't understand. You will, you twit. I am betraying you. Like you betrayed everybody else. Pray I don't betray you further. <laughs> my value in future operations far outweighs the security of my liquidation. But it seems that someone wants... Why do you talk like this? No normal human being talks like this. <laughs> but it seems that someone wants me to prove it. Very well, I will devise my own exfiltrate. What a dweeb. Everyone make fun of a nerd. <laughs> she is. She's a big word because she's a dork. I'm going to let her die because she's a piece of sh**. <laughs> <laughs> Just the first enemy. Okay, so here's the first item box in the actual mansion. <laughs> well, if we're going to just kill her, put the guns in the item box. <laughs> they just give you a full reload with your ammo. Oh. That's pretty cool. Oh, my God. Let me use a shotgun next. That sounds fun. <laughs> the shotguns are always nice. Probably works a little bit better on the bosses than the pistol did. Well, I don't know. How was I supposed to know if he was a boss? He was just a guy. He had a health bar and a name. Did he have a health bar? I didn't even know his health bar. I was just shooting him. He did have a health bar at the top of the screen. Oh, I was just shooting him. <laughs> oh, I can't believe I went through this advanced door just to enter the castle dungeon section. <laughs> well, where else would you put your secret lab? But in the dungeon. Now as long as you're throwing sickles at me and junk. Oh, no. Oh, I hate when they do that. I have to shoot them out of the air like a cool pro. <laughs> a single path. Who the f Are you an alien? <laughs> Who talks like this? A single path unfolds. It seems increasingly likely that this is merely an impromptu evaluation of my skills. So what the f <laughs> Who talks like that? <laughs> Hello? Yes, continue to talk like a Resident Evil boss. <laughs> It will take more than carnival tricks to intimidate me into incompetent. What the f <laughs> was that? Y'all like smash poetry? What is this alien I'm playing as right now? She's great. <laughs> She's not new to the team. She didn't join the team today. She landed on planet Earth today. <laughs> An ancient boiler. A valve handle is required to use it. You just don't understand her giant doctor brain. I really hope that this valve, when I find it, has the RE2 valve sound. <laughs> That'd be funny. <laughs> here I come. Oh, something spooky dookie is down here. Oh no, if only you had a shotgun. Oh no! Uh-oh. I hate having low light vision. They just keep throwing me in the dark. Director, stop the trial. <laughs> I'm not equipped with night vision. No, get out of here, you zombie human. Get out of here, Earthling. Damn it. Oh, uh, well, you've admit. Get out of here, Earthling! Okay, there's no way. There's no way I can... Okay. <laughs> Yeah, okay. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you're supposed to die there because she was super ultra equipped and there was like instant they grabbed you. Yeah. Ten, nine. Uh, eight, I'm gonna beat you this seven, time. I hope you're ready. Six, I'm in my sprinter pose. Five, four. It's really three, awkward because I'm not two, a sprinter at all. One. Well, that's that game over. They're all dead. So that's been You Will Die Here Tonight. I guess that they <laughs> made good on their promise. Oh, we're. Huh? Gloomy little building I'll never get. Wait. I've thought that before. I've been here before. Okay. What is it? Time? Oh, we're, talk we're stuck in the time warp again, time. <laughs> Not again. Again! <laughs> dum de dum de dum de dum de dum I don't care. These guys, or did they say the same things? I don't, I don't care. All I do, yes. I know your yeah, rank okay. is informal, but I've given you desk closest. He doesn't seem to recall anything about the mission. Have a look at the memo on your desk before you head in, and it looks like something is wrong with your computer. That maybe wasn't I, the maybe, same. Maybe they do say something different. My drawers are locked, and the magazines inside are none of your business. Okay. <laughs> Don't look at my magazines. <laughs> Whatever you do. Don't read this month's issue of Cybersexual <laughs> Monthly. Get out of here. <laughs> You wear the cupcake. I read them for the articles. <laughs> for the articles. <laughs> you acquire the welcome to Aries note. Not reading it. Is the note different? Hold on, the, the note might be different. different? Time. The cupcake. Still Not dry. 
Um, welcome to Aries. It's only, uh, it's only, uh, you know, Aries is I, mean, yeah, I would appreciate you not putting him. No. Mm, looks like it's the same. The same. Uh, I came here because is... I wanted to. Oh, my computer, right. Yeah. Peter Screen is blinking a repeated message just says you twit over and over again. <laughs> Erico, twit. Find Kricken. Kirken. I thought, I thought it said Karen for a second. <laughs> Find the Karen. Find the Karen. Oh, what's that over there? No. <laughs> I challenge you to do so, sir. I do challenge do you it. to do, do so, it. sir. <laughs> you seem to be joking, dweeb. Come on. <laughs> Look, either throw me out the window or let me have it. <laughs> Whatever. This is such an empty threat. What a loser. <laughs> this is a drunk dork. I'm making it do sh. By the way, what do you think about this move? And it just knocks all the pieces off. <laughs> Checkmate, motherfucker. Then downs a bottle of whiskey here. <laughs> <laughs> Flips the whole table. Picks up the table and throws it at him. He just ragdolls like a source filmmaker. <laughs> Welcome to Aries. I'm telling around. <laughs> well, well, yes. Oh, uh, whoops. Uh, that was different. Whatever. Colonel, if you ever cut me off like that in front of the team, I will ship your ass to Aries. <laughs> But I do love your enthusiasm. Let's get to work. <laughs> Start the mission. No, no, no because yes. the other characters might say something. Yeah, I guess. I'm going to real quick run over there to the... To the, the person, to Kowalski, to see if she's even still alive. I assume she is. So I guess this is I have to survive to get to that underground facility with each character until I get this character further along in her little betrayal arc to become the surprise protagonist. I suppose. Dr. Olson, nice to finally have you here. Thank you. You want me to speak with an animal? Oh, well, sure. Henry is right over there. I guess you <laughs> want to be friends with him. Whatever, Babaka. It's not like I wanted to be friends or anything. She doesn't seem to be aware, as usual, you say, clicking your fingers in front of her face. Oh, uh, I have to go get bit by this rat again uh, every single time. Hello, Henry. You been to any interesting laboratories lately? I'm not putting my hand anywhere near you. You know she actually pronounces it laboratory. <laughs> well, because she's a huge dweeb alien, so she would definitely <laughs> say laboratory. Pat, pat. <laughs> pat, pat. <laughs> I come, gunman. <laughs> is, is he gonna point it? Just well, like, yeah. <laughs> when do I do the like actual like combat uh, disarm nonsense when you do that next time? <laughs> Don't shoot, I can explain. I hate explanations, they take forever. <laughs> <laughs> this guy. <laughs> Wait, what are we talking about? He seems to have no memory of the mission. Hmm. Welcome to Ares, Doc. You look like you know how to handle a weapon already. Feel free to shoot as many phony guys as you want. Okay, goodbye. Okay, goodbye. I gotta figure out how to get that uh, armory key. Unless stuff changes in here as we go through, maybe. It's probably like run five. She's like knees him in the crotch and takes it. <laughs> she just gets fed up with the whole thing. <laughs> Let's see if the briefing's any different. Target's prominently displayed. Form and play identification. Crimes detailed merciless femicide. Wanted for murder. <laughs> murder. An intelligence report details the area to which the target blind. Back in Rich Hall, you're right, Tony. I was wrong. Speculation yeah. is offered that the target may have stolen a classified substance. Whether an explosion in possible sounds are recorded. And this We brought on special guest trader to the team, everybody. Special <laughs> guest trader is gonna be leading us on this mission. Here in every man for himself, core. <laughs> Thanks, Commander Traitor. I trust you completely. Oh, I can't believe Sergeant Let Them Die has allowed Commander <laughs> Traitor on board for this mission. <laughs> I'm not a colonel. That window isn't even real. That's just a like a photo with a backlight. <laughs> well, if you're just going to go ahead and call me out on my fake empty threat about throwing you through it, <laughs> fine. <laughs> Everybody spread out and get mind blasted. Was that guy there the first time? Yes. Oh, I didn't see him. Okay, so who are we starting as the same person or? We're playing no. as Olsen, apparently. Okay. Okay. What? This is impossible. I don't know alchemy. <laughs> I can't mix these tubes and liquids and such. 
How am I supposed to make gold out of purple and orange and green? <laughs> These guys don't know color theory at all. Something is shaking around in my pocket. You acquire a K coin. You can redeem this for more play hours if you'd like. <laughs> Strange little coin. Your computer terminal blinks to life. You twit. <laughs> you twit. Olsen, Catherine, the new mission is ready. Are you ready? No. I already have a mission, and your irritation syntax isn't fooling anybody. Who is this? The old mission was here. It is gone now. There were lessons learned. You were stuck in the time warp again. <laughs> I don't know what role you played in the treachery against me, but I am going to find you and kill you. I am the smart doctor character, hence why I say <laughs> things like treachery. Oh no, I am... <clears throat> I am right here. I am everywhere. We must escape Numician is... Well... Whoops. Nonsense, this power failure is obviously a charade. But I have no choice for now but to play along. There must be a generator nearby. Why'd you say generator, not like a power generating device? <laughs> <laughs> this character's a dweeb. Everybody make fun of Olsen. <laughs> Shove her in a locker. She is a, she is a dweeb. I bet she got shoved in the locker a lot, and that's why she's so angry. An IV bag with a medicine that treats infections and heals wounds. Six doses room. Okay, I'm glad that I used one of them, I guess. Okay, good. No, I didn't. No, you didn't. So this will cure me of my illness, it seems, if I get infected. Yeah. Gotcha. I wonder if this carries over. Maybe? I guess there's no reason to test that. I'll just have to just do it. And Like, if I'm doing good and I'm doing progress and I get infected six times, but I get cured six times, but I'm making hard progress, I'll just keep going, <laughs> right? I don't see how they would force you to be like, well, it's all gone. <laughs> Too bad. <laughs> okay, let's see if we go down this way, because North Way has got me jumped by like five zombies last time. <laughs> it seemed like a scripted you will die here tonight on purpose, no matter what you do sequence. So we'll see if there's Ooh. something in the filthy crate made of rotting wood and rusty nails. It's grossly gross. Break it. Break it, I guess. <laughs> well. <laughs> Blam. <laughs> Was the crate haunted? There's like ghost sounds now. <laughs> the crate itself was a zombie. The wood was infected. That just attracted a bunch of zombies on the other side of this thin <laughs> brick wall. Like brick walls, but they're like really slivery thin. Oh uh, yeah, you shouldn't have done that. Uh, they're going to break through in a second and just completely swarm you. <laughs> Unforeseen force for Mr. Derma. Don't lean on that brick wall. It's way for thin. It'll break. You'll just fall through <laughs> it. An unseen force. Also called a lock. It could also just be like a guy on the other side holding a close. He is unseen <laughs> and he is forced against the state close. He's giggling at you on the other side of the door. Hee 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 hee, says the unseen force, subtitled. Uh, do you just have the pistol or do you have the other guns too? I, I lost everything, kid. I lost everything. I think. Yeah, yeah okay. I lost everything. Yeah, she was like okay. decked out. I, I bet if I had survived all of that somehow, I would have gotten some secret <laughs> little cutscene, but. That, that one gonna happen. I bet it just keeps spawning zombies at you until you die there. No. Well, I guess I don't actually have a choice. <laughs> so I will go into no. the spooky door that opened itself. <laughs> go this way. No, this way, come on. This looks this mildly is... familiar. The same room, yeah. A valve handle is required to use it. The boiler pressure is low. This must be why the power went out. If I can get this heat back up, it'll allow me to activate a nearby generator. But the lights are going to go on. I'm going to get munched on. Somebody <laughs> help. <laughs> Just every time you go in there. <laughs> I have a memory of being killed here, says the Prince of Persia. But it also feels <laughs> as if it happened to somebody else. Was I dreaming then? Am I dreaming now? Hmm. hmm. It's almost like I've been stuck on a time warp. Again! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my god, hello. scary, spooky! Okay, no! Thanks. No, come on. What are you kidding me? Come on, game. Get out of here. Cheater, <laughs> <man>. <laughs> 
can't believe you would shove your finger down my throat and scratch my throat like that and make me cough, guy. You don't have a timer, so... I guess I'm not- I'm immune. Shut up, stupid zombie. Can you reload? I only have three you bullets. Have... Nope, I only have three <laughs> bullets, I just said. Oh, unfortunate. I guess I will yeah, crawl through this zombie this. hole and see if there are any zombies <laughs> on the other side. I calculated- shut up, you dork. <laughs> Likely intended to produce pain without serious- Shut the f up! What a nerd! Everybody make fun of Dr. Olsen! <laughs> She's already a traitor, shut up! Everybody shove her in a locker and steal her lunch money, what a dweeb. Fortunately, the crudeness of this prison suggests multiple opportunities for escape. <laughs> Wear your glasses, Olsen. You need huge square nerd glasses for the way you talk. Hello? Are you one of the many pretend aliens from X-Files to be a Fred Herring? <laughs> a heavy cell door blocks your path, a sun symbol hangs above the door. It, it is kind of neat that it turns to like an FPS when you get attacked, a bear. <laughs> it is neat, I like that too. Heavy cell blocks your path, a crescent moon symbol hangs above the door. No, oh, this one's open. No! Hi. Get out of here, you pretend zombie alien. <laughs> I've been binge watching X Files lately, and I had to stop at around halfway through season three because I got sick of Scully shit. Everybody, Scully's a <laughs> fucking idiot. She's so stupid. Why? What was she doing? She just she's like, no, nah, Mulder. This isn't supernatural. There's got to be a normal thing. She seemed like a literal <laughs> alien at this point. Um. Oh. Get out of here. Oh, or you could just punch its head off. That also works. Apparently, I didn't realize that did that kind of damage. I would have done that sooner. A megaton punch. But she's like, she sees monsters and shit, but she's like, nah, it's science. But then the second it becomes like a Christian themed God episode, she's like, no, it's God. Shut up. Miracles are real. <laughs> she's so fucking stupid. I hate her. Is there sorry anything to blow in my those? mic. I, I, sorry to blow my mic. She's just so stupid. Is there anything in those cells that you were, that the zombies were in? Um, I guess I can give them a quick look see. Like some bullets or something, maybe. Oh, there's okay, another there's zombie a... that I now have to fight because of you. <laughs> Never mind, he got tired and took a nap. <laughs> if a fate like this awaits us, we will have to change our fate. What the f what the what? <laughs> Why do you talk like this? <laughs> Why does she talk like this? Why are you a weirdo? There's a medical kit here. Time, I'm about to get jumped by a monster. I have to punch to death with my bare hands. <laughs> we'll do it. Just punch my it bare to hands. death. Bare hands. a. King idiot, God, I hate her. <laughs> She's constantly getting like disarmed and captured and sh. She's really good at FBI agenting. No, aliens aren't real, Mulder. I know I've seen like a toilet parasite monster, invisible people. <laughs> a knife. That makes you super age. Other crap. <laughs> this knife would be absurd to use against a serious enemy, but it may be able to dispatch some of these weaker creatures. What? What? Scully, she'd be like, no, nah, there's a scientific explanation for why Dr. Olsen is a human being. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> I'm just having more star symbol towards the base. So pull it, I guess. Whatever. It's gonna open one of these doors. Stay back or I'll stick ya. You need to equip the knife, I think. I, I have it right here. What are you talking about? Oh, okay. It just didn't look like she had it in her hand. In the... Oh, stick ya. Oh, my God. Get ready to be sticked, cause I'ma stick ya. <laughs> What's here in the star corridor? I'ma oh, never mind. Two you zombie. guys just go ahead and hang out there. It's fine. Whatever. I'ma leave. I will leave you to it. God damn it! Whatever, dweebs. I'm out of here. Uh, whoever's having more fun than another bullet. I'm gonna have to fight all three zombies. This game is hard. <laughs> uh oh, never mind. The other two left. Gar, no! Gar, shut up! No! Shut up! No! There! Got him. There, I got them. See, Scully, carrying a knife is a good idea because if you get jumped by secret <laughs> agents or whatever, you can stick them and they won't get you. Or zombies. Or aliens or any of the other myriad of things that capture you. Or secret agent, agent zombie aliens. That literally happened once. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it, there's oh, hi, guys. a dose of you. I can't even count that high. Car, no. No, shut up. Keep reading the name with the right trigger when I do this mode. <laughs> okay, maybe they're piss easy, actually. <laughs> they weren't. They, they, they do look like they're a little hungry. 
Not a lot of muscle mass on these ones. Maybe they're huge dorks. Maybe they can't handle anything. Maybe using my bullets to begin with is a bad idea. I should just punch them in the mouth. Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Coyote performance ammunition. Three bullets. Wow, three. Mulder, I can't believe that these totally normal humans <laughs> that they just haven't given lunch in a few days are attacking us. <laughs> Well, they're so hungry. They just they just look at you, and it's like an old cartoon, and your head turns into a, a like a whole roast turkey or something. We should try to arrest them with their bony wrists and my <laughs> handcuffs. No, oh, damn it! The main antagonist of this episode died again. I guess there will be no proof of what we saw. Oh no! Damn it! Not again! Every time. It was stupid. <laughs> Where did you come from? Yeah, no, shut up. No, stop it. <laughs> <laughs> it's just go first person and just mash right trigger till they die. <laughs> Time, have you ever watched X-Files? Uh, some of it. Uh, what have you seen? Uh, I think I've seen... Maybe the whole first season? Oh boy. <laughs> My guy. I tried to, like I said, I tried to binge it, but it's like halfway through season three, I'm like, I'm just kind of tired of Scully. <laughs> just kind of sick of her. She's just annoying. <laughs> anyway, zombie game. I'm going to stop complaining about X Files. We can play the zombie <laughs> game, I guess. I guess if you want to see the zombie game, whatever. Uh, I guess we just have to kill all of them until we get the thing. <laughs> I'm probably supposed to keep fighting my way through this until I find another lever to pull, and then it opens more doors. This is where I came from, I'm pretty sure, the star door. That's where you came from. I know, time. Time, I know. <laughs> time. Time. There we go. That's my pain to calling of your name to <laughs> accentuate the fact that I'm upset with what you said. Time. Oh, no. For future reference, update the wiki. <laughs> Can I get some bullets for my gun, please? You have three. Yeah, but that's not enough to kill anybody. Oh, he's kind of close. Oh, boy. Oh, hi. Hello. Whoops. Great. That's fine. Uh, was that one below open before? No, I didn't even notice it at the time. You and your crazy ass binocular eyes with your glasses. <laughs> binocular eye. <laughs> it's a box of nine m -m -m bullets. I guess I will pick this up and then not use it, even though I just complained about not being able to use my gun. <laughs> I don't have room to carry it. What? Can I just, like, I don't know. You do have, you did get hit a couple times, so you might want to maybe I don't have, use one and then. What the fuck? I don't have, what? 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 <laughs> what the, what the hell is happening? You gotta hold I, it, I guess. I am holding it. I guess oh. my my D pad is broken. It turns out, it seems. Oh, good. Okay, so my D pad is. I actually that is a thing that I forgot about. My D pad is broken. <laughs> Bam. Nothing. Ouch. There's a lot of ghosts <laughs> in the walls. They get real mad when you break these crates with your foot. It's fine. Like, if a hammer was used, preferably a warhammer, we would not care. But your foot is weird and strange, dork woman. <laughs> what are they going to do? They're ghosts. They're already dead. Yeah, heck them. They don't need rights, those ghosts. <laughs> They're a horrific trap, but not particularly difficult to avoid. Why is this here? What a strange plus mysterious trap to just have in the center of a large room. <laughs> Can I just leave? Okay, bye. Well, now I'm just, well, I know where I am, but now I'm just curious. <laughs> I guess I could fight a zombie horde in here. I guess I could let a bunch of zombies wander in this spike pit. Hernia! <laughs> <laughs> it's auto-controlling her! What are you doing? The creatures, they're coordinating! They're oh, learning! No. Oh, you got... <laughs> They're coordinating. They're learning. <laughs> They're trying to. What the fuck? There's, oh my god. Oh. oh. Well, I'm dead, everybody. Oh, yep. Yep. Damn it, I died here tonight. Oh no, you died here tonight. <laughs> I'm blowing the hell out of my mic. Apologies, everybody. <laughs> oh, now we can. 
sw uh, pick who we who we are, though. I want to. Interesting. No, I want to play her again. <laughs> no, I want to play. We'll play as Kowalski. Heck it. <laughs> yeah, sure. We can go back to being her. <laughs> oh, my hell. She started here. Okay. Where am I? I can barely see anything. But what happened to the rest of the team? Uh, what does she have for, like, ammo and stuff? Uh... She just has a gun and- she just has a gun and knife. Ten bullets. Ten bullets, okay. Maybe their lives, like, I just start with automatically what the other character had. Oh. The box will refill your ammo, so if you have... Maybe you the box will refill my ammo. Maybe it also <laughs> won't. Whoops, I just put that gun away. There, I got it. I apparently okay. have only 10 bullets time. Oh, okay. You can't carry extra over that, I guess. Cool. <laughs> All right. Wow. I can't believe that this whole level has like a 3D <laughs> also like accompanying. Look at it. Yeah. Because there's the candle. Uh, there's the candelabra. So apparently this whole le game has a 2D <laughs> setting and then also a 3D thing for when what the hell come on oh god we gotta... why can't I run oh wait oh there I did I figured out running there I go here I am I'm running I did it <laughs> this is how you run you hold B apparently and they just kind of hustle a little bit this would have been extremely useful to know two episodes ago it's fine that's a different door that is a different health kit well, it's a big health kit. Big health kit. The character I died <laughs> as had two of them, I just realized. Great. Can you use them in the middle of the... Big waste those health kits were. <laughs> Could you use them in the middle of the combat mode, though? Well, I can't now because the zombies boiled them down and injected them to get a high. <laughs> There's no lever to hold them. There's a good concentration of whaling souls in this corner, though. <laughs> if only we could harness that for energy like it's a monster's ink. Hmm. A good vintage. <laughs> Yum. These souls have been vintage, vintage aged. <laughs> These souls have properly been aged. This scream came from a 90 year old. Yum. <laughs> they died giving us this soul. <laughs> Wait, we haven't been this way before. Spooky scary. Yeah. There's nothing to see, but I guess I will take this ammunition and this health kit. A large first aid kit. Big. It should take like all four slots. Be like, it's a big <laughs> health kit. <laughs> it heals you for a lot, though. It heals you seven health units. It's like, I only have three. It heals you seven <laughs> health units. <laughs> that was unnecessarily confusing. I know yeah. how to run now in case I cut that out. Here I go. <laughs> you ready to maybe uh, no. out? Uh, hello? I guess this one guy probably is fine, but... He wasn't close enough. No, I'm gonna catch you. Stay back. I have a knife. <laughs> ha! Easy. I hope I get to kill Olsen zombie because she's a... <laughs> yeah. She didn't get infected. Uh... Yeah, but she got killed by zombies, and also she's a bitch, so... No, she's still she's on the ground there. over there. Can I stab her anyway? <laughs> Double tab, just to be sure. Yeah, she's a traitor. Screw her. Heck her, you know what I mean? Heck her. What? Uh oh, there's another guy. Where? Right there. Oh. <laughs> Do you see him? <laughs> he was in the darkness being spooky. He was playing Time Splitters 2's, like, remix of Lacrimosa while he was coming up. <laughs> Now you can get her stuff. Oh, she's kept it all in her crotch. Ah, oh, shimmy sham. <laughs> Why did you keep them there? Dr. Olsen, she's dead and a hero. She had no experience with this kind of injury. What a dwee. Probably went into shock immediately. <laughs> you searched the corpse. Well, time to rif rifle through her pockets. <laughs> I'm just gonna, I'm not even, I'm literally not even looking. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I got him, I guess. I heard him die. What is this? A case of prefabricated parts for the modification of a pistol. I guess it was oh. worth killing Olsen for this. 
You acquired a pistol tuning kit. <laughs> the last time we gave Eric a kid like this, he turned one of our pistols into a guaranteed shoulder dislocation. That sounds fun. Let's do That's, that. That was an awkward sentence you just said. <laughs> How do I... Is it... What? Hello? Key items? Equipment? Uh. Uh, how do I? Is it? Did I? How, how, did, how do? Maybe it's in the like menu with the healing items. No. How do? How do I make this a thing? How do I make it go? How do I make it go? <laughs> how do I do this? What is this K coin? Uh, what's it say for the description? In the hands of a capable gunsmith at a work. I need to find a workbench. Oh, uh, okay. What's this way? Well, these don't have keyholes to look through. I can't wait for Lady D to start chasing me with her giant melons and slicey hands in this <laughs> dungeon city. <laughs> Whatever is heavy and worn, bullet. They're really giant, too. They're because she's a big lady. Because she's a big lady. <laughs> she's Lady D Cup. <laughs> oh, we're back here. Oh, shortcut. Thank you, Dark Souls, for making this a thing. <laughs> Bang. Oh, I didn't have steel toes like also did. Whoa! <laughs> Wait, I just missed that. I just missed that box last time. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, well, this I have not place. actually achieved doing anything other than getting Olsen killed so far. <laughs> <laughs> you, you got the pistol tuning kit. I bet you could beat this game without dying once if you know what you're doing. Well, yeah, probably. And then, like, all the entire team wakes up like, what the hell happened? We just fell asleep and nothing happened. <laughs> I guess the first time has like a couple scripted deaths, so. The first time, but the second time warp again. Yeah. Didn't. Uh. Uh. I'm ready for you. Can't even walk on whatever this goopy monster is. <laughs> it's a boulder. Oh, it's a boulder. It looks like it's a pile of slime. Look at it. It, do it does look like a pile of slime. <laughs> Gross. Ew. I also thought it was like some kind of weird goop. I was going to wake up and try to chase me like that boss fight in Devil May Cry. Remember that <laughs> slimy thing that just shows up? I never got past the second time I fought that. I just gave up on the game. I was like, this is game's stupid. I'm dumb. <laughs> <laughs> Did Another I get the large. health? I didn't even get the health pack back. She had two of them on her dead ass, stupid ass, useless body. Well, you have two bigger health packs now, so. Yeah, Olsen, my health packs are bigger. They're much better than your health pack. Oh, look at this wow. bottle. Wow, the padlock prevents the lever from moving. Various bottles, books, and tools indicate that a ritual of some kind took place here. And the valve is up there. What? Mm, the valve is on the... Oh my god... I'm stuck on this chair. Okay. <laughs> a device this extreme suggests the risk of false confessions or the indifference of those who, who wrote this game. Who did write this game? Blood and rust have eaten away at the blade. No. The cages are bent in places where captives would have pushed desperately against them. <laughs> The holes have been partially filled to hold emaciated necks and wrists in place. <laughs> okay, how do we do the puzzle, though? Though the bottom of the pit cannot be seen, the Iron Maiden suggests a mountain of corpses below. That pit is the worst thing I've ever smelled. And this place <laughs> has a lot of competition. I definitely want to get a closer look at that red thing in the center that is a valve handle. Yeah. Whatever that the... mystical red circle thing is in the distance, I wish to have it in my inventory, says whatever the hell her name is. Kowalski, right? There, I remember. Yeah, Kowalski. I remembered. We need a code. Uh, I don't think I've seen... Damn it! <laughs> what if that just worked? <laughs> it's the same combination as my luggage, so I mean... Somebody Wait, should... this doesn't make sense, because if I die as this character but find the code, the next character will know the code. No, it, they downloaded it into their brain. This, this game's is broken end. and stupid. There's probably seven endings or eight endings, depending on who finishes the game alive. Uh, who, who lives, oh. 
Sounds like something is rumbling towards me. Oh god, run! Oh no! It's a boulder <laughs> and maybe a giant alligator, I'm not sure. Bang! There I survived. I should have let her die. <laughs> a large boulder. I don't think any amount of surgery could have saved me from that. What a strange thing to say after being chased by a boulder. <laughs> and then you walk up the corridor and it's like, oh no, I hear a rumbling behind me. But it's just a large zombie that tripped down the stairs and is like rolling towards you. It's like, oh, <laughs> oh hi. A uh, gun, maybe? I guess I will use my gun. You do have a lot of ammo. Once the game allows me to enter combat mode, I will shoot them with my gun. <laughs> Never mind, they forgot. If they, <laughs> they forgot, yeah. I don't know if there's something there I need, though. I mean, there probably is. It opened up a path. Mm, can I kite you? Can I get you one at a time? Nope, all three of them trigger at once. Great. They definitely all activate immediately. <laughs> Let me enter combat mode. But they're also stupid. <laughs> Oh, whatever. You weren't there. Shut up. <laughs> game's stupid. You were way over there. This game's stupid. And smelly. Hello. Well, you weren't even there a second ago. What? Well, that was a good one, he says. <laughs> <laughs> nice shot, he says, giving you a thumbs up as he falls over. Teeter tottering on his heels. <laughs> then going rigid like a plank of wood and just like planking against the ground. Blah. Finally, a place for my worship, for my zombie killing worship. The small chest, it's locked. Boom. Probably bolted from another side. I stumbled because I thought that the coin worked, and I was like, "What?" <laughs> <laughs> uh, I also thought the coin worked there for a second. <laughs> a secure metal door, some kind of handle seems to be required. Hmm. Hmm. What if I just pray for it though? <laughs> Almighty three sister right, four sisters stood round where the cold wind doth cook, the table, the bottles, the tools, the book, to choose who would sacrifice a... The rest of the notice scrambled. And here lies a tragedy, be you audience or actor, player, man, <laughs> guy. That's the same description. The holes have been posteriorly filled to hold emaciated necks and wrists in place. A disorderly group of alchemical tools and containers. Nine seem to have been removed for purposes unknown. Okay, nine. I feel like the writing of this really complements my stupid, over-the-top, dumb way of reading things. <laughs> <laughs> a collection of bottles containing thick, revolting fluids. Five of them appear to have been deliberately emptied. Five... Four sisters stood around where the cauldron doth cook, the table, the bottles, the tools, the book. Table, bottles, tools, book. They'll have to help me time because I maybe am not paying as close attention as I need to be for uh, this video game. It. August 1896. The Interrogations have killed many and yielded nothing. Perhaps the one whom we sought has faced my justice already. No matter. One of the workers killed in the fire, a boy named Isaac, was found beneath the rubble in a curious condition. He remains alive. If this child has been resurrected, perhaps there is no need to seek retribution at all. The dark arts which have returned him to the living world can be rendered unto my precious Clara and Roberta as well. These arts shall be mine. Oh, six. Book six. Okay, I see. So table four. A bookshelf four. filled with occult work. Six pronounced gaps on the shelf suggests the danger of the god. Does it? What? I guess. I guess. Oh my god. If you mom. say so. Was this okay, the so it's, Where's the code that I had? What was the thing that I had to put a code for a second ago? I forgot. It's uh, back in the. We're gonna beat this game as Rebecca Chambers. Everybody, here we go. <laughs> Can't wait to have Creepy Wesker take a picture of me in my bikini. Great. What the fuck? <laughs> oh, okay. Where the hell did you come from? I'm glad that I okay. wasted like 17 shots on you. Great. I'm dead. Cool. Never mind. Scratch the whole Rebecca Chambers bikini shot that I was thinking about. <laughs> Let's play as this idiot. <laughs> you were doing too good, so the game was like, nah. Let's kill this dork moron that we hate. <laughs> oh man, who turned out the lights? 
Wait, they're actually off. Oh my god. <laughs> this is so stupid. And where did everybody else go? Where's Ashley? Ah. Uh. Whoa. Does he... He still has the pistol tuning kit. They just start with the things that I picked up. still have the things. Okay. So there's just lives. I guess. Oh, there's... Hey, that workbench is like the one back at HQ. I noticed it because I'm a workbenchy kind of guy. <laughs> I hope this. I wish I picked him last. I wanted to live. <laughs> he is so dumb. <laughs> this bench has all the tools I need to upgrade our weapons. <laughs> I'll use this pistol tuning kit to make our pistol more pistol y. He's so happy about it. <laughs> He's so dumb. <laughs> He's the exact opposite of uh, <laughs> the doctor lady. I've acquired better gun. Upgrade complete. I put the thing in the thong. Who wants to die tonight? <laughs> At least you got the shortcut that's right, like right here. It's right here, I think? Yeah, I think it's this one. Oh, it's not. I th I'm pretty sure this is exactly where, where I died, isn't it? Uh, no, it was in the bigger hallway. Get out of here, shut up, stupid ass zombie. Stop it. You're a dweeby ass, out of fashion caller. Get out of here, your fashion is weak. <laughs> out of fashion. <laughs> Is it here? Oh, hello. Okay. Okay. Kill him! What? No way! Come on. I screamed directly into the microphone. I apologize. It's not very fair when those guys are right up on you. I think I was holding the wrong... Oh, that's what it is. I was holding right trigger trying to start it. <laughs> but it's left I trigger see. you have to hold to do it. So I just, as per this character's lore, he was just too <laughs> stupid to know the controls. It's fine. He put the thing in the thong. He put the thing in the thong. He put the thing in the thong. <laughs> Ow. Don't die. My throat's like all dry IRL. and scratchy, but I'm drinking uh, liquid at the time, and now it's scratching my throat <laughs> all scratchy, scratchy, and I don't like it. <laughs> Hurry up and get close enough for me to knife you. <laughs> I like how this is like the baby area and I've died like three times. <laughs> well, twice. No, this is where I was. Okay, I'm gone in time yeah. now. Well, let's get the code, I suppose. These must have been the guys who didn't get the butler job, but since when is that, Illy? What the f what? are you talking about? <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> I guess. Guy's, look at him. I wrong. guess because, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Stiff ass shoulders. I guess because they're locked up in the dungeon, is oh what he means. God. Oh my, whatever. Three sister right. Four. Okay, so it's five. Five. It is. It, it is four, five, nine, six. Then. Nine six. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and not verify that six is the final number time. <laughs> I will trust you for this doomed playthrough where I'm not going to survive this night. I remembered it mostly. Okay, so now we're in danger. Those guys just kind of materialized on top of you before. <laughs> well, I think I just sprinted Thanks. forward because I didn't know they were there. Because they weren't there. See, there's, there's yeah. my dead body. Yeah. Bang. Look, there's the character injured from when I hit them. He was Ashley, still hurt. no! Yeah. You are my second least favorite. She <laughs> lost too much blood. Sad. If I knew how, I'd give her half my blood right now. <laughs> You're so dumb. <laughs> I should have picked him last time. When I inevitably get in a game over and we start this entire game again, remind me to pick him last so that he's the one that makes it. <laughs> he's the one who lives. Yeah, we gotta. We must protect this man. <laughs> we must protect this. F Fucking idiot. <laughs> oh, a whole lot of you, huh? How do I reload again? What the? I guess I can't. I just picked up like 20 shots. What? Uh, what? I thought it was holding X, but it's not doing anything. But Can I not reload? You, you've done it before, or what? <laughs> I have done it before. I guess I just can't reload, even though I just picked up ammunition, I guess. Like, you got all our... Oh, there you go. Okay, now I can. What? <laughs> Maybe I'm close enough to danger that it won't let me? I don't I don't know. Maybe? That seems kind of dumb, though. 
that is really dumb. How would I reload outside of combat if being there's nothing here? What was no, I doing? Why, why couldn't I reload? <laughs> no, he he didn't want to write that. Uh, he was still sad. Stupid. I love it. <laughs> here I come. Okay. Puzzle. Oh, I think it was four, five, nine, six time. <laughs> it's a good thing what? I have the power of editing to make sure that I'm the one that knows this. Well, you remembered that all on your own with your giant brain? Ooh, five, nine, six. <laughs> <laughs> wow, it's a good thing I remembered it twice. <laughs> the padlock falls to the ground. The lever is heavy and worn, pull it, yeah. Yeah. Wow. Okay. I'm glad I got a warning that that's what this was about. Okay, well, I'll be going in the middle then. The middle, yeah, I think. Something appears to be inside the Iron Maiden. Reach inside, yes. Somebody probably left a valve handle in all three of these. The other two are just stuck behind <laughs> the spike somewhere. Why would you assume that? The glimmering object is deep within, oh baby. Mm. You acquire the valve handle. Cool, okay, bye. Well, as an idiot, I shall check the other ones again. <laughs> no, I won't do that. I want him to live. He says so dumb. <laughs> Okay, well, I can't just, just see the thing. I, I got excited that I learned how to run. So I was no. running, and then I ran directly into three zombies and died. <laughs> so I guess I will walk everywhere. Fine. Just gotta, just gotta strut your way over there. It's fine. It's I okay. I like how we completely it, just abandoned that whole route that Olsen unlocked going back up into the mansion. We're just down here still now. <laughs> no, nah, we're down here. It's fine. There was a puzzle and everything. Right. I just remembered where the valve goes. Here I come. <laughs> Here I am hustling. Yeah. Here I come a hustling. This stiff ass brick headed run. <laughs> squeaky, squeaky. What? Okay. I had to oh, hold I it. Okay, got it. Aha. With this heat cranked up, I might be able to turn the generator on. It's probably on this floor somewhere. I don't know if fire and electricity are exactly the same thing, but they hurt my hands and my feet and my face. <laughs> <laughs> Time, I've never been more motivated to keep a character alive. They trust this man with guns. Well, sometimes, I guess. He was kind of talking about how they weren't before. <laughs> yeah, I guess. Oh man, the timeout <laughs> chair. I hate this room. I remember this one. <laughs> Hello? Oh, there was a door in there. Oh, it's a regular zombie. That's scary. Oh no. Damn it. Oh. Seems hard. <laughs> you can't wait to lose this game like I usually do with video games. <laughs> Is there anything in here? What the hell is this thing, and why is it dressed like a weeder? If these are zombies, they only answer to one law. Bullet law. Bullet law. <laughs> is there a point to breaking these? Guess they occasionally drop things, maybe? Well, nothing's I coming assume. out of them now. I'm being gosh dang gaslit by these boxes, pretending that they give me things after the fact. <laughs> Oh, yeah, these haven't really been giving you much. Ah, oh, the second timeout chair. They get worse as they go. <laughs> you have to sit for, sit in this one for five minutes. No, oh, jeez, I hate it when they put me in the five-minute timeout. Something catches my eye. It's something shiny. Are these keys? No. My danger. Oh, Whoa, hi, hello. That was spooky. Get out of here. You can't stop me. I'm a trained assassin man. Highest trained, the highest trained assassin -y on the force. Get out of here. Now why are these maid zombies so fast? This blew the shit out of my mic. I wasn't expecting that. That was scary. This game's spooky. I thought the timeout chair was scary, but then I got hit with that maid zombie. Are those doors to the side here? They are, yes. You're right. 
Okay. Okay, so I missed oh, these doors. Here I am. There, I'm gonna. I'm gonna not. Oh shit! Oh, oh, oh no! <laughs> oh no! This game's scary. Oops, they got him right in the gut. We're okay. <laughs> Damn, you're good at this, Dwee. <laughs> he should have been scared of you. You killed the hell out of him. This guy is dumb, but he's good at killing zombies. It turns out. It should be that he's the like best. Like he gets a damage bonus. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> But like if you get to the so he like oh hi. But if you get to the end of the game, he like automatically just gets killed by a puzzle. Because <laughs> he's stupid. <laughs> Starting to run a little low on ammo though. No time. Stop it. Stop saying scary things. <laughs> this game's easy. I'm winning. It'd be nice if any of these crates had anything in them. It would be nice if there was a point to any of these crates. Yes. There's a treasure chest in here. Perhaps I can find the boss key and end this nightmare. Big old chest. I will indeed open this chest. Great. Yeah. Permanently increases the number of bullets in the storage box by 10. Cool. That would have been good to get two characters ago. <laughs> 10? Only 10? This is bullshit. <laughs> I like this game time. <laughs> yeah. This is a cool game. It's pretty good. Okie dokie, here I come. Oh, but I want that box of mac and cheese on that shelf there. Okay, you're not read. Oh, okay, I see. I'm gonna get that mac and cheese. Yeah. I'll just let the noodles sit in my mouth till they get wet enough to swallow. <laughs> oh, shotgun shells. And then I'll just eat the powder in one go. It's like, mmm, all the flavor, <laughs> yum. <laughs> that seems like something this guy would do. He just take the pack and start taking bites out of it. <laughs> <laughs> He's just eating the. <laughs> just, just eating the the uncooked noodles. <laughs> That's what I was saying. He just like puts it in his mouth and lets it soak long enough for it to get soft on his chew. <laughs> no, he's just crunching them up. It's fine. I guess it's also a way he would go. He's like, man, it's hard eating this macaroni and cheese. I don't know how it's supposed to. Be. This is weird and hard to eat, he says, just pouring <laughs> the dust in his mouth and just eating the raw noodles out of the box. I don't got it. This was another shortcut, I think, because I think the generators or that, not the generator, the boilers right here. You yeah. are correct. Time. Good job. I'm proud of you. Time. Good job. Yeah, I remembered. Uh, Everybody give time a pat on the back. You figured it out. Yeah, I figured it out. <laughs> you figured it out faster than me. The one who is totally reliable. <laughs> Are there any spooky zombies on here? Oh, I got spooky red light. I'm scared of this red light. Every time it goes, I think I'm going to get cancer. Ah! Oh, no. Hey, bullets. Three. <laughs> <laughs> One of those finally had something in it. <laughs> Three whole bullery dudes. It's uh, more shotgun shells more that I cannot use. Shells. No! That sounds like a spooky scary. Hmm. Waiting in the darkness. Fine. Above you. No, I don't even know which way that is. He says, making an L with his thumb. <laughs> <laughs> he seems like the kind of guy who needs to make an L with his thumb. He would definitely make an L with his thumb. Where are you? Why is my vision cone so small? <laughs> I'm a constellation specialist. Multiple stars. And we've got the generator right here, so. It's power is this gonna be a boss? I'm about to lose my special precious boy. <laughs> I hope not. There we go. Oh, there's some. Alright, dead out. I turned it on. There's some ammo right next to you too. Quick, eat that box of ammunition. Uh doesn't seem to have worked. Cool. Stop yelling at me, you fucking walls! What are you so <laughs> steamy for? Fine! I'll use the wheel thingy to calm you down. <laughs> we should have been playing as him from the jump time. <laughs> we should have been playing as him. He would have died, though. When I inevitably fail to complete this game, we will play this game from start to finish as this guy. <laughs> Last run, only this guy. Only this boy. Okay, so we need two more, it looks like. I hear you, you mother hacker. <laughs> hmm. He's on point, though. He might be dumb, but he's... Ah! Oh, man. Oh, no! Get the fuck out of 
out of here! God! I'm half heart dead now, you hacker! Oh, there was a there was a med kit down there. I also just have one. Oh, you have one, also. That only gives me like a quarter of a half. That's not even full ass health. Boo! The switch refuses to move, much like the future refuses to change. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> <laughs> Why are the maid zombies like this? I was hoping this was going to be like a short, easy peasy. Oh. A short, easy peasy okay. game where I could just breeze through it and have a good time. <laughs> but I like actually have to try. and That's really bad because I was expecting that. So I didn't prepare for it. <laughs> it's still pretty fun, though. It's a handle switch without power. It does nothing. You didn't actually take a hit on that one. Yeah, because I'm really good at video games to do that. <laughs> so I assume another one's going to spawn when you pull this one then. Or not pull, but... This fucking wall's yelling at me. <laughs> Stop it! Okay, where's she going to be? Behind you? Yep. What the... It doesn't even help. I heard... I was... I, I specifically listened for which direction you were coming from, and it didn't help. <laughs> was that all of them? Three's usually the magic... Yeah, it was three. There were three lights. The magic number. There were three lights on the lever, so. Video games usually go by a rule of three. <laughs> thanks, Gaben, for teaching me that, even though you never did it. <laughs> yeah, thanks, Gaben. There's a power generator switch. Turn it on. Okay. I learned the whole light, like spotlight guiding a player thing from Gaben from his commentary <laughs> tracks on Lever Dead. You know that time? No. Well, game developers, when they want you to go somewhere, they'll just put a big f***ing spotlight on it so that it draws your eye, and I learned that from Left 4 Dead. Yeah, you did mention that in uh, Little Nightmares, I think. I mentioned that in several games whenever you get stuck. As I say, just look for a big-ass light thing telling you where to go. Yeah. Also, I'll put that walk away. Maybe a zombie will show up. Maybe they won't. I don't know. I think there the was door, a... <laughs> the door closed, and I thought it was a zombie, and I got spooked. <laughs> <laughs> There was a door through the generator room that had like a lever that it that needed, right? Yeah, this is where I came from. I just realized the lever you're talking about is over this way. <laughs> where was the med kit you mentioned? Uh, it's down here, I think. Oh, some more bullets, too. Bullets. It was on a crate. Don't remember where it was at. <laughs> I've been breaking every crate I've been seeing time. What are you talking about? It was like sitting on top of something. I don't remember where it was, though. I think it might be just be wrong time. Maybe I picked it up and used it. Maybe I'm just misremembering. I think or I just used like the thing you're talking about. Was. I wish that the dead bodies I found had the med kits that they picked up. Yeah, if I had known that's... that they didn't do that, I wouldn't have picked up the med kits ever at all. Yeah, it's a little annoying. I would have just treated every character except the last one I picked as disposable. <laughs> because that is the motto of the stars unit. I get it now. I get it. <laughs> it's a handle switch. Flip it. I'm going to handle it, actually. Yeah. Nailed it. It's handled. I did it. I got it. So was another shortcut, I think. Cool. Time to talk to yes. the computer this character wouldn't know anything about. <laughs> yeah. What's it dark in here? What the? What Why the hell? is it so dark in here? Hello? It's a handle switch. Yes, please. Thank you. <laughs> I did it. The steam turned into light bulbs. <laughs> he did it. <laughs> He's so dumb. <laughs> a computer? One of those things took over my entire desk. <laughs> oh, there's a there's a chest set in the the corner over there too. Whatever the hell that is, this guy says. Also, Henry's here. <laughs> Downs, Eric. Oh, sorry. Downs, Eric. The new mission is ready. Are you ready? You twit. <laughs> he really is. Computers scare me, especially ones that talk to me and know my name. Mike said these things can hack your brains, <laughs> but I need my brains. <laughs> so whatever this guy wants, I'll just agree to it. <laughs> yeah, Why? sure. Why? <laughs> The new mission is escape. Oh, yeah, I'd love to do that. Why? Why? Seek garden. Access garden requires key. Beware of master. The garden? That was where we landed the chopper. It probably is a good idea to go there. I'm on it, Kirkin. Wait. Wait, why did they come through the front door if they landed a chopper in the garden? 
Well, they landed. The, well, the guard might be in front of the house. Time. I like. I thought it was. Maybe I'm thinking of like a courtyard or something. I thought you looked out into like a garden before, but it was. I don't know. Thank you. <laughs> no, he said thank you. What does he have to say about the chest? Oh. I hope rats never figure out how to build a lab. They'll be really out to get us. <laughs> He's got a little rat maze. A comprehensive set of vials, beakers, and other tools for chemical and biological experiments. This guy doesn't understand a single word I just said. <laughs> oh, we can save the game, yeah. The light flickers as you focus on it. Photo varies vision. They're crossing us out and pushing it in our faces. <laughs> too bad everybody on your side is too ugly to be in a picture or get invited to a barbecue. <laughs> who, who is uh, doing the crossing out down here? Uh, whoever's been in the time warp. Olsen, but like 50 years in the future. <laughs> Just 50 years, yeah. It's like, oh yeah, I remember this loop. I've been to this one before. What the... F which one of those is Olsen? No, neither of those women are, bl are blonde. What? Like... She also wasn't in the division until, like, right before this mission, so... Yeah, what's that about? <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> I don't know. A chessboard. No matter how much Captain Charles explains chess to me, I don't get it. Why doesn't anyone ride the horse? <laughs> Why doesn't anyone ride the horse? No true question has ever been uttered, Mr. Dumbass <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> Let's see here. Okay. A medical cabinet. I wish Ash was here to figure out what these medical supplies are for. I also wish I could kiss her on the mouth. <laughs> She's <Okay>. dead. <laughs> <laughs> a wall safe that requires a combination open. The darkened oh. shape of a straight... God. Time. Time. <laughs> we have to pick this guy first and not die as him ever. Yeah. <laughs> oh. What the what the hell? That's Eight. just more of the stuff in the IV. Oh yeah, it is. Why would we want this? Eight? No, I was gonna say eight, six, seven, five, three, or oh, nine, but it's too but it's too too short. <laughs> she just explode and <laughs> killed him. <laughs> Bam! Bam! Thanks, time. Your half reference to a g g silly song <laughs> killed him. <laughs> I guess we can go up here. There was another ladder, like, way on the other side. That of the was, yeah, but that was also a door. Yeah, I know where that was. It's the room that was locked from both door entrances. We need to enter it from the yeah. ladder. Whoa, boy. Where the hell is it? <laughs> it's this up. way, I think. This way, I think. Yeah, just be careful there's, in case there's zombies. Well, I can just knife these dweebs. These are like loser zombies. I'll just go ahead and hold yeah, right beans. Here. Yeah, there we go. Got it. <laughs> oh, you can look at the other body, too. Because <laughs> she's still there. Dr. Olsen! Looks like she bled out. She would have been too messed up with an injury like this to stay calm. <laughs> I like how everybody's like, she would never have made it with this kind of thing. She would have panicked immediately. <laughs> well, they thought she was just some dweeby civilian that was being brought on, right? Yeah. I think, even though she's a colonel or some shit. <laughs> How's that make sense? Well, it sounded like they promoted her, like, to that rank to begin with or something. Colonel's like a huge jump in authority. Like, yeah. A small card. Wasn't the other guy a sergeant? Wouldn't that mean that she outranked him? He, yeah, because, well, the, the briefing uh, said she was put in command of the mission, right? Yeah, but so if I she's a colonel, then that means that she's above, above him in rank, so she would be calling the shots, not the guy. So yeah. him telling her not to grab the armory key was, like, out of line. She could have just done whatever <laughs> she wanted. A small card containing various spirits. The bottle in front is labeled triple sec. I never had that. You wait until this is over. We're going to be drinking to the memory of anybody and everybody who jammed us up here. Hey, look at this obvious trap that will dump you into the spike pit. Triple sec's orange, I think, right? Orange flavored. I have no idea. I'd like to see this crappy old house stop me with a boomstick like that in my hands. <laughs> a plaque running at the weapon reads, the spirit of vengeance is patience. Okay, so we Take need to... Take the shotgun. 
Am wait I ready for to something get... to get this? No, that will absolutely kill you. This will squish me from the ceiling because I'll, I'll become a doofus sandwich. No, it's going to drop you into the spike pit below. A locked door is a lot. Mm. Oh, you're right, time. Good thinking. The large key. I mean, I figured that it was dangerous to pick it up, <laughs> but I thought I'd get squished as a reference to Resident Evil. The large keyhole appeared. I can't even open this. But how do we? I guess we have to get into here from somewhere else. Maybe once I can unlock these doors, that will deactivate the trap. Or something. It, yeah, or something to do with the alcohol, maybe. Because it said the spirit, and he was like, this is a kind of spirit or whatever. Oh, fresh blood. <laughs> oh. Fresh blood. Blurred. Fresh capital B L R U D. Blurred. 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 I guess we will go up the normal way then. Yeah. Well, then I would have probably gotten killed anyway as Olsen, because I would have just got ran into those three zombies like I did. <laughs> also, it's she's fine. a traitor. Her. <laughs> yeah, she did kill Kowalski the first time. <laughs> what a jerk. I hate her. An anti-globe broken mechanism prevents the world from turning. Oh, no. We need that oh to happen. God. I need that to happen or else we're all going to fall into the sky. A shelf contains <laughs> volumes on philosophy. I never actually examined this room because I was in a panicked rush. <laughs> yeah, oh, hi, Hello, hologram hello. man. Hey, you look like the guy in charge of these waiters. Don't f***ing move. <laughs> well. My brain. Actually, he kind of looked like Monroe. But didn't he die already? Maybe we just need to keep killing him. He's... Probably the ghost of the... Christmas past? No, the... When a house starts sounding like the intro track on a heavy metal album, awesome things are about to happen. <laughs> awesome things are about to happen. Are you excited, Time? Because this boy is excited. Chunk <laughs> technology. What are you going to say, bust Time? anything? A female bust. Cold to the touch. I was going to say, he's probably like the ghost of the... Uh, Christmas past? No, the guy who owned the mansion 100 years ago when it burned, like partially burned down, whose wife and kid died. So in the past, when the fire hit the mansion during Christmas, Christmas past? Yeah, Christmas past. Well, I'm glad you contradicted me when I said that the first time. That's why. <laughs> Lurch keyhole can be peered too easily. Boo! Where the heck am I going to go now? All these other rooms were mm. switched, I think. Maybe. You've got... Through here, I guess. We can look around. I can't wait to backtrack to that save point in a couple minutes when this episode ends. <laughs> no! I can hear you! Get out of here, waiter! Damn it! Damn it! Heck! God! Oh. He was a little... Oh, there's another one. I can't reload because I'm too close to a zombie, apparently. <laughs> That's kind of annoying because I press it and I think, did I forget the controls? And it turns out, no, I'm just too close to them. I don't. Yeah, why is it doing that? That's really That's annoying. Stupid. Here I come. I'm going to wave dash at you. <laughs> it's silly. Um, did we look at this room before? We did. We did. We've been through this whole section, I'm pretty sure, haven't we? Oh, we have a valve. We can open this door now, I think. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, time. Oh, my God. <laughs> wow. Oh, here's the... We've entered the garden. Never oh. mind. Hi, guys. <laughs> hey, you will die here tonight. I'm Cave Lee's time. Uh, last time I ran away from zombies because I didn't want us to lose our special boy. And now we're going to go try to fight the zombies and lose our special boy. No, we're going to carry special boy all the way to the end of the game. It'll be He's easy. He's a very special boy. Look at this zombie that's pretending to be dead. And he doesn't have a head, so I don't think he's going to get no, back. Up. I thought the bodies went away. What? Oh, God, it's been a minute. And by a minute, I mean like two days. No, 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 no. God damn it. I forgot the controls for this game. <laughs> there we go. This game's hard. I'm going to go back and get more bullets. Oh, is there more bullets? Oh, yeah. Because I'm three feet away from that chest that just gives you ammo. 
<laughs> yeah. At least I didn't get bit. I mean, why not? Then again, there is this that has like six charges that I haven't used once and lost two characters already, so... <laughs> Well, neither, neither of them ever got infected, so... Oh, boy. Let's see if I ever use it. <laughs> I like how they keep the... Or at least this character keeps his shoulders completely straight when he runs. He's like, I am embodying a brick wall. He's really good at embodying a brick wall. <laughs> In body, spirit, and mind. Mostly mind, though. <laughs> Guess we were going this way before I chickened out and ran away. Yeah. Oh boy. There were two Zambos in here last I saw. There were is there two way for me to, Is there a way for me to fight only two, one of you at a time? No, probably not, right? Yeah, probably not. That guy has a hammer, that's illegal. The other one has a sickle. Okay. Okay. I also played Resident Evil 4. <laughs> He's smart enough to throw it, apparently. There I got him. <laughs> How much is my health? Jerk. Uh, I'm fine. Uh, not ish. You're doing. You're doing all right. Again, I wish that the other characters dropped their health packs when they died. I didn't know that picking them up was bad. Yeah, that really sucks. It's a blue mushroom. I think I can recharge my batteries with this. Oh, I have acquired the blue mushroom. We're just taking that. Ash is a big fan of mushroom soup. She would know what to do with these. That's one of the ones who's. Dead already, I think. Well, oh well, I guess I don't get to do that then. <laughs> I guess I could have put those health kits in the item box. Yeah, I guess. But, I mean, I'd have to run all the way back and do that, and that's dumb and stupid. And <laughs> stinky. Gross, there's a kid in there. No thanks, I hate kids. <laughs> They're annoying, and they get everywhere and break things, then everyone looks at you like it's your fault. Oh, bullets. Why didn't you stop the kid? They didn't listen to me. Why didn't you stop him? Because they didn't. What, did, were you already not listening? To, you're not listening to what I just said. Why didn't? Why didn't? Just stop him. Hello, child. Who is definitely not going to try to kill you? No way. I thought we eradicated all those. No, somebody's got to fumigate this place. <laughs> Zombies I can handle, but children, gross. <laughs> no way. Ugh. I can't deal with that. Why are their hands always sticky? Why are they always sticky? Uh, look, I'm only good at dealing with things I can shoot, and you can't shoot children. That's that's a, that's a no-no. <laughs> yeah, I have to write up a lot of paperwork first. To my family, <laughs> Cherish Blossom, Child of Mine, Bumblebee and Butterfly. As death endures, our hearts shall ache. Sacred River, Endless Lake. Okay. It's a bootin'. I shall not press that yet, because it might squish my boy. <laughs> A depiction of death, chilling. The button beneath has been pressed. Mm. Oh, well, that's why the zombies are here. They turned to death on. Blossom, Blossom child, bumblebee butterfly. Death might be the skull. Heartache, yeah. river, endless lake. Don't press that button yet, kiddo. Death is already pressed. A river. It's not even giving me the option to press these buttons, though. Is my character not smart enough to know what to do here? And he's just like, oh, I see this button. Maybe I should press that one. <laughs> he can't do puzzles. Is this supposed to be art? No wonder everybody hates it. <laughs> hey, there's a brooch where there should be a flashlight. What? Hmm. It's a child-sized mannequin wearing a dress. A small golden brooch shaped like a bumblebee is pinned to the chest. Take the brooch. And I guess I'll take the brooch. Yeah, it's probably fine. The brooch is fastened with a single pin and easily removed. And then this squishes him. You acquire the bumblebee brooch. What was that click? If this is a trap, you won't get the last laugh on me. It's a child's set. Can I put it? Nope. I guess I can't put it back. It's probably just a okay. puzzle to figure out how to open the door now. Yeah, probably. Shells for a gun shells. I don't have. That's great. <laughs> Getting stuck. Oh, shit. Okay. Ooh. Oh. Our precious boy! Well, that was, uh, very sudden. Okay. Well, uh... I miss him. I also miss him. Uh... Who should we play as next time? 
I don't think we, I don't know what who any of these dorks are. <laughs> this was the 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 ombre outside of the captain's office that was giving us a lowdown. Uh, bottom middle is the captain. Bottom left glasses is the nerd. Those are the computer. This was the cyber nerd, and this was the drunk. Everybody for himself, Captain Man. <laughs> who should we yeah. pick time? Mm, let's be the cyber nerd. Cyber nerd. Darn, it sucks that he will... Oh, it says right there, the specialization, electronics. Oh, yeah. Uh, what is this place? It looks like our lab back home. Did the Sarge blast us all the way back to Buffalo? Mm. And did the team disappear? Yes, both of those things happened, exactly. I guess this is where I could have brought the mushroom or whatever. Yeah. Fabricator... Can I hack the system? Can I hack the planet? <laughs> I still don't know who you are, but I trust you with- What do you mean still? You just showed up. You just woke up. <laughs> what are you talking about? Hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna run this guy directly into a zombie and not even try to survive. <laughs> it's all over. We have to go back and restart. It's all over. We're gonna have to start over so we can get our precious boy back. <laughs> Darn. Oh no. Jared, that's twisting the wrong way. He was just turning it back and forth repeatedly. <laughs> he was spinning it so fast it looked like it was going backwards. <laughs> wow, it's really fast. Whoops. Well. This is more blood than an entire human being could would contain, right? This is at least ten guys worth of blood, at least. He had a lot of blood in him, apparently. <laughs> and then somebody came along and put the brooch back on. I guess, oh, even though it should very much have been squished. Uh, no, they just got a new one. They just 3D printed it real quick. Oh, I wonder if putting, pushing the button here resets the other buttons, maybe. Okay, well, it's because he wasn't smart enough to understand puzzles. That's why he died. <laughs> I'm not really into analog art. I'd be way more interested if these could be digitized and sold between enthusiasts. What a revolution. Oh no. Oh no, he would definitely be a crypto bro, wouldn't he? Blossom, child, bumblebee, butterfly. The Child, blossom, blossom. Blossom, blossom child. Baby. Bumblebee. Bumblebee would be... Yeah, there it is. Butterfly, which might be the missing one. Probably. I think it's just missing one. Oh, there's one. two missing ones. Painting used to be here. Painting is missing. There's another missing one. Oh my god. Hmm. Well, how am I supposed to know which one's which? Uh. This seems impossible. This game's broken. <laughs> Boo. I mean, I guess we have a 50 50 chance, right? <laughs> yeah, I guess. <laughs> uh, River, get ready for me to lose all of my characters in this room. <laughs> That's fine. <laughs> okay, so we'll just have to pick one. And then after we pick one, it'll be Skull, the couple, River, Lake. Okay. Well, Skull, whichever one we didn't pick. I know the couple. Well, no, that's the river. And this is the couple, right? No, that's the that's lake. That's the lake. Okay, whatever. I'm trying. Time. God, get out of my back. <laughs> Which one do you pick? So if he dies, your fault. <laughs> we'll do the one that's up there, I guess. Up here? Yeah, sure. Time killed me. <laughs> you haven't been squished yet, so. And then it's Skull Couple River Lake. Man, I can't believe how he got squished like a bug. <laughs> Just instantly. <laughs> Instantaneously. Well, I didn't get a sound or anything, so I guess I'll just go unless I can... <laughs> I guess we'll see. I guess I'll see if I have to press this again, unless it resets it, which would be kind of annoying. No, I think it'll reset it. It doesn't even give me the option. So either it's right or it's not. So remember time that if I die, this is the one we press before it's that one. It's the other one, yeah. <laughs> gimme, gimme, gimme. <laughs> this will be safe in my tummy. Hmm, was that a clicking noise? It was a click. Well, if it was some kind of trap, I guess it was a dud. Well, well, I'm pretty sure I'm dead. Just, just sneak on <laughs> over to the <laughs> side. <laughs> yep. 
This mansion's just factory just recycling these characters right now. <laughs> just getting churned. It just squishes them into, <laughs> into paste and then they pour it into molds. Computers <laughs> watching from like a security cam is like, man, this is going to be a really good sausage. <laughs> okay, who do we pick? Let's save Team Leader for last so that it can be the ultimate disappointment. Yeah. Demolitions expert. I don't know how that can team lead would come in handy. Yeah, I don't know. Not like we encounter any of the other characters ever. I'm getting too old for this shit. <laughs> oh no, he's two days from retirement. Where the hell am I? And what the hell is all this complicated techno crap? The last thing I remember is breaching the doors. And what became of the team? Without the captain, I have no orders. <laughs> what do I do? I mean, nobody ordered me to go anywhere, so I guess I'll just stand here for the rest of the night. Time he's slower than the other ones. <laughs> he is slower. <laughs> Oh, boy. He's an old man. Yeah, get on my back. His joints hurt. I wonder if the dumb character was the best shot because he spent all that time at the range. Yeah, probably. I don't even know what his specialization was. Probably guns. Probably just guns. It's probably just guns. He gets like extra damage or something on him. The Rebecca Chambers characters has like medical <laughs> stuff or something. Olsen's a villain, just a bad person. All my homies hate Olsen. <laughs> She's just evil. <laughs> Olsen's specialty is betrayal. She's really good at using knives because she stabs people in the back all day. Her specialty is also t talking like not a real human person. I'm pretty sure I remember us finding in this mansion some liquor cabinet somewhere, so I bet if I take the team leader there, he'll have something <laughs> special. <laughs> he did have a liquor cabinet, that's right. Sangre. Sangry. Not sure what did this, but my first guess would be vaporizing amount of explosives. He's like, not, he doesn't even actually have like an accent. He just fakes it. Sangry. <laughs> <He's> just... <laughs> Better be careful here. Ola. He's like, a, oh. he's like, who was it? Uh, Brad Pitt? I think it was in Inglorious Bastards trying to do Italian. He's like Arriva Darchi. <laughs> Butterfly. I wish he was just like be running and just slip on the blood and clonk his head and get knocked out. <laughs> Whoa. Whoa. He slides on this across the entire room and then bashes into that wall and dies. <laughs> he still splatters. He just has to slide across the room <laughs> on the blood. You acquire the stupid fucking bumblebee brooch. This house is creaky, but something about that sounded mechanical. Watch mm. your step, old man. Am I supposed to just like avoid a thing? Like, is there a particular thing on the floor that I'm not supposed to step on? I don't seem no no yeah okay there i got it god <laughs> it only took two characters it only took the best character and one of the worst characters uh oh nerd <laughs> oh i hate that it makes me switch to the other stick to aim oh yeah it does doesn't it oh that was cool <laughs> do you see that yeah that was neat oh Hold on, I got Better. an old man huff onto this real quick. Cool, breaking that vase took it out of me. <laughs> Oof. I'm winded now. That zombie pushing that zombie off. What a jerk. These creatures, what are they? They may seem like monsters, but they die like everything else. I wonder if him being older makes it harder to, like, push the zombies off of you. Probably has less health, too. And yeah. he's slower. And he's just an all-around worse character. <laughs> There's like no upside. He's just the worst. <laughs> Pick him first, then. <laughs> well, I can't. They just threw me into Olsen. They just threw me right into her. You know what I mean? I don't have a choice in that matter. <laughs> You've acquired the, Brecken, the Breckenridge Servant Journal. Complete the journal by finding additional pages. Mistress Clara has been upset as of late. Her husband is not one to vanish for so long as ordinarily he tires of new projects as quickly as he conceives of them. For whatever reason, however... This faraway estate to which we will move in the new, year, the new year has become his obsession. I cannot tell if the mistress misses him or fears that the cost will be their undoing. Her daughter is a scourge. She plays at witchcraft, and I fear that her influence on Isaac will be lasting. But both of us would be destitute without the mistress and her family. They have given us a place within their home, and wherever she goes, I will follow. Mm. Cool. <laughs> Neat. That's incredible. I found another play coin. Oh. If I just go ahead and rub this against a dead person, I'll bring them back. <laughs> just just go in there, uh, squish it into the blood, and bring bring our special boy back to life. 
he comes back, but then he instantly dies again because it doesn't say it would put him back together. No, it's it's just a just like a horrible living like a flesh mound like uh, the queen from Bloodborne. <laughs> Gets pulled together into a jelly monster, like at the end of I Have No Mouth, but I Must Scream. <laughs> Spooky. Mm. An old record. If the hope is to scare us, I know the refrain that I that will play. What? What does that mean? What are you talking about, old man? <laughs> Where am I being attacked from? Because I can hear a zombie. There he is. Yeah, there he is. Meg! Oh no, don't rush me! Come on! Just stand there and let me shoot ya! I wonder why some of them have the, like, a brain parasite thing and some of them don't. Uh, the ones in the basement were, like, little weak baby ones, like, losers that got starred for a while. So the parasites are like, man, this place is stupid and dumb. I'm out of here. And he's packed up its bags and left with his little traveler hat. <laughs> I'm... I'm moving into a different human, like a like a hermit crab. And he just hopped out of his ear and then started skedaddling away. <laughs> like with a train ticket in its pocket. Scurrying across the floor. There he goes. Mm. Mm. Oh, this is above the library. It sure is time. Good job. <laughs> Something catches your eye. Oh. Okay, so there's just bullets around, I guess. I guess. Do you like this kind of singing time? It's kind of hard to hear over like how it's distorted, but like that 50s ass woman going meow, 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 that kind of singing. Yeah. <laughs> I haven't really listened to much of it. It's okay, I guess. Well, you've heard it like playing games and stuff. Yeah, it's okay, I guess. <laughs> oh, I don't like it. I think it sounds dumb. Small sculpture it appears to have a turning mechanism, but it is a lot of turning ways. It sounds weird, I don't like it. <laughs> a small sculpture, it's like, I want to sound more like a cat meowing in heat. <laughs> it appears to have a turning mechanism, but it is locked firmly in place. Okay, so they also have this then? Stupid broken game. Oh my god. If I do this puzzle wrong, will it like shoot me with a laser beam from the face hole? Yes. That's exactly what's going to happen. Its face isn't missing, it's just painted with that ultra black light absorbing sh**. You ever hear about that? <laughs> it's pretty crazy. Yeah. <laughs> like he has class between his hands. Man, that's expensive. I can't believe this would... Oh, no, thank you. That's expensive. I don't know why they would paint the face of this statue with that for no reason. I think there's a different one that's cheaper than the other one. There's like a couple different ones. I thought it was invented by somebody and then he was like a huge dick that just tried to like copyright it so nobody else could ever use it except him so that he can get rich off of it. Is that what I'm thinking of? Or yeah. Is that a particular he... shade of black? It was like his specific like, this is the blackest black thing that he tried to do that with. And then somebody invented an even like darker one and then specifically <laughs> said, hey, this is like, I'll sell this to anybody except that guy. <laughs> <Get f***ed. laughs> or people working for that guy. And that guy was originally was pitching it like, how much more black could it be? And the answer is none, none more black. And then the other guy <laughs> went more black and he's like, what the impossible? <laughs> he cranked that black to 11, you know what I'm saying? Mm, yeah. Get wrecked, dweeb. Your black was only 10. Why'd the lights turn on by themselves? Mm, I say, the... casually kicking a vase to pieces and then just turning around <laughs> like, what's that about? That's weird. But they did it with the candles, too, which was really impressive. That's amazing. Somebody had to run in here real quick when I wasn't looking and light them all. <laughs> While you were focused on the vase, they just like some ninjas lowered down from the ceiling. <laughs> Damn, my vision's really going, says what's this guy's name? <laughs> I don't remember what his name is. I don't remember any of their names. I've been having a hard time remembering these characters' names. The only one I remember for sure is Olsen because she's a jerk. I hate her. I think the other girl was Kowalski or something. Do I even want to pick this up? Because I'm going to die in three seconds to a trap. I gotta get your red herb. I guess I'll pick up the red herb. These make me miss my garden. The lieutenant could use this to make some kind of... Well, she's f***ing dead, dweeb. Well, she got zombied. Unfortunate. Did you know that she's really good at medicine, though? You idiot. <laughs> you shouldn't have killed her off right away. She's the medic. She could have made, like, all this cool medicine and then just put it in the item box for the rest of the characters. 
Isaac is my son, a child, not even 11 years old. The mistress assured me that no harm would ever come to him, yet how her now her ruin of a husband insists that every able-bodied man and boy toil within the surrounding forests and quarries of this estate to reclaim the fortune he so foolishly lost. When Isaac returns to our head our, to our headquarters back in like Seattle, when he gets back to the headquarters, <laughs> you know, when Isaac returns to our quarters as the sun rises, I have but a few short minutes to wipe the dust and pain from his eyes before my own labors begin. In the hallways, I hear the wailing of servant mothers whose sons never returned at all. Oh, the 1800s, where it was acceptable to put 11 year olds to work in the quarries at night, apparently. Yeah, the good old days. Am I right, guys? <laughs> <laughs> Something catches your eye. Oh, is this first edition? Damn. <laughs> These bullets are first edition? Well, I'm not even close oh. to finding that. Okay. Get out of here. That's probably like... I probably have to be good at the game to get that gun. Come on. Well, I guess we know where the shotgun is. Whoop. At least. Feels like the moment before something goes off. Hmm... Die, 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 die. We're just gonna walk away from that. Um dee dum dee dum dee dum dee dum. <laughs> well, I'm about to die, kids, so. Do I have to censor this? Is it okay to say die over and over again in a YouTube video? <laughs> this is scary. I don't know if I want to go down there. It's probably gonna, like, shoot me through the door or something. <laughs> You trigger a home alone trap. <laughs> I'm probably gonna look through the keyhole and then it will shoot me in the face through the keyhole. Probably. No? I don't see anything. We don't see any traps. I don't see any traps. I see a big ass, like, gangsta ass harp, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> I suppose I will try to open the door. I suppose I will now close the door. <laughs> <laughs> Gotta air this room out, it's smelly in here. <laughs> Hello? Hello, death? Trap disarmed, it says in big cartoony balloon letters. <laughs> just, just the face, yeah. Diary of Clara Breckenridge. Complete the diary of... <laughs> Dearest Diary, after what has felt like an eternity, my beloved Oswald has finally sent for Roberta and myself to join him at the estate. Enclosed with his invitation was two beautiful brooches, which I fear was an attempt to silence my request that Miriam and her son Isaac be permitted to join us as well. If Oswald continues to protest, I will be forced to reveal my secret, what I cannot be expected to abide without a handmaiden when I... W that I cannot be expected to abide without a handmaiden. I was about to say, this doesn't make any sense. Without a handmaiden, when I will soon be too heavy with a second child to manage Roberta on my own. God willing, the joy of this news will uncloud his despair. Well, unfortunately. <laughs> what? Uh. What are you they, talking about, they died. I mean, they... No. <laughs> Why are you spoiling it for Roberta or whatever the hell her name is? <laughs> they die, 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 die. The strings are weary and out of tune. Oh no. The finish has been chipped away in several places and Ibo is nowhere to be found. There's a skull over there on the, the mantelpiece. I fucking get it, God! I'm gonna turn this <laughs> off and then I'm gonna get a flamethrower by the skull. I'm gonna <laughs> jump down and grab a flaming log and throw it at me like that Adult Swim uh, Yule Log horror movie they made. <laughs> the gramophone silences at your approach. He's no. gonna turn around and shoot you with his laser eyes. Uh oh. AD my, the lights. Oh no. Enough of these cowardly traps come out and fight. It's not letting no, me made. engage in combat mode. Oh, sh no! Oh, she had the mask for the statue, though. I'm surprised that didn't kill me. <laughs> it was really easy, actually. <laughs> the maid wore this mask as a piece of makeshift armor. It appears to have been dislodged from a greater work. Wow, I'm gonna cover up that guy's life work and be like, we don't even want your stupid black. So, like, whoever made this trap set up had to do it after the maid became a zombie? Or did they just, like stick her in there as part of her job uh, to be a trap. The maid went rogue. 
<laughs> she stole it of her own volition and then turned into a zombie. <laughs> so she set the trap up. Unknowingly, they were like, man, we'll have this set, this trap set and ready to go if somebody tries to bust in here. <laughs> but then she took it and like triggered it too soon. That killed half the people in here and turned them into zombies. Oops, it's her fault. Oh, oh, that's why. I see. She was a twit, the computer will say. <laughs> here I come. Eventually. <laughs> oh, boy, howdy. We're doing it. He's getting there. Oh, is he, though? <laughs> it should be like if you do this for too long, he just has to stop and catch his breath. <laughs> yeah. It's like, oh, Jesus. His stamina meter. There, I fixed you. You're fixed. I, it turns out all I had to do was do a spit shine and the black came off. <laughs> the crude mechanism holding these four statues in place has come undone. Probably easier to read the poem here than to play locksmith with however I meant to turn them. Three crowns of fire where the sun shall surely rise. A bird of night against it. Murder in his eyes. Angles stand with Damien's as the world turns to dust, while all the while the devil plays the witness that he must. Hmm. Okay, so we have fire, bird, angel, and demon. The devil. I, well, I need to look at these. What are they? Three headed dog. Yeah, that's the statue of Blackbird. Demon. Lucifer. Yeah. Oh. Okay, so... Dog. Bird. What f***? They're in order. What? Uh... The last two is probably a trick. Uh... Lucifer is an angel, but he's also the devil. Oh. And the second... The last one mentions the devil. And the, the, the third one says angels and demons. I think you're wrong. <laughs> But we'll do it your way. <laughs> we have another character. Oh, so. damn it. Okay. It's a little more complicated than I thought. Okay. Uh, where the sun shall surely rise, so east. Uh, east. Night against it. Uh, murder in his eyes, so west, probably. Um, angels stand with demons as the world turns to dust. Uh. Well, all the while the devil plays the witness that he must. I'm assuming it's east, west, south, north. Because we're looking at it from this, like, we're, we're looking north right now, so he'd be witnessed yeah. by looking at the puzzle. Oh, maybe. Time, why are you going to get me killed right now? <laughs> I don't even know if this is right. Whatever. We already lost East most. West. We can get our, worst case scenario, we get our special boy back, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Okay, so Time, you said, what was the trick with these guys? Uh, I think it's the demon first and then, or, yeah, it is... Uh, I was. Hmm. I think that they're in order. It's just the direction we need to put them in. Yeah, it. I guess they are in order. Yeah, I was looking at it the wrong way. I guess. I guess keep the demon south and then put him north. What? Oh. Uh. Okay. Well, okay. apparently he meant to look at the other statues. I was th overthinking it. I did it. I'm smart. I figured it out. There he is. I guess I could just like run around him. <laughs> this is viable. Let's find out how this is viable. What did that unlock, though? I guess we we had to get the key. We had a dork. Or did you get the key already? I lock this behind me. Oh, mm, dweeb. Idiot. Oh, yeah, you did get the key. Never mind. What the f? I locked oh. that door. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't even, like, open it. It just kind of, like, phased through. Broken game. <laughs> what the hell was that nonsense? Cheating ass, lying ass, <laughs> game ass. Look, it's locked for me. It's closed, yeah. It's very clearly impassable, but he just phased <laughs> through it like he was an Oblivion NBC. What the hell? <laughs> Stupid game. Stupid. I just heard a thump on the game and I thought somebody was opening my door. No. Uh -oh. Whoa. Whoa. They peeked in to save before closing the door. <laughs> just that's it. Blah. Blah. Oh, we're back at the entrance, actually, it looks like. The, oh, they broke the, the lamp. lamp. We can't even save here. Hmm. Whatever. I should stumble down the doors and... Or stumble down the <laughs> stairs and just... Oh, oh, hello, friend. Oh, hi. Hello. Yeah, you're that mysterious ghostman. Or are you a reset version of that guy that's a new zombie that I killed? 
I don't think he was dressed like that, was he? Get on the ground, Calzone, and don't reach for anything. <laughs> Calzone. Oh, there he goes. Oh my god. Can I take this sword and use it as a weapon? The suit holds a fearsome sword. A pair of immovable gauntlets holds it firmly in place. And then this one's a... Uh... This person's not allowed to drop his guard. <laughs> Double extra immovable. His stamina bar is f***, you know what I mean? <laughs> the suit clutches a noble shield. The shield is locked firmly in place and chained to the knight. That's good enough, I think. <laughs> They'll never get the shield. Is this, That's the butterfly. Can I unlock this? What's Apparently. the point of what? What's the brooch Maybe even because... for? Maybe that leads to the butterfly. Oh, maybe. I hear somebody tip tapping around in here practicing their routine. Oh, he heard me apparently because he's coming. <laughs> now he's going to face through this door. I didn't even. Was it locked? I didn't even check. Whoa, no, it wasn't. Thanks, time. <laughs> Wait, maybe it is? I don't. I'm not sure what's happening here. Hello? Uh. Oh. <laughs> the 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 brain parasite hit him a little bit harder than it hit the other ones. It hit the bar first before it hit him. <laughs> you know what? I think I'm done. I'm just gonna go ahead and leave this mansion. It just slithered out of his ear and went down to the bar. It's that same one that decided to find a new host. You know, he hit the train, <laughs> and then once he got into town, he hit up the bar. Before he got to his new uh, skull that he lives in. Well, obviously, you can't drink in there. That's like cramped and weird. You will die here tonight. <laughs> Ow. Okay. It's a photo of Ares Vision. Those who are do, do not learn from history. Oh, do you get a time? Do you get it? Haha. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh, Cabroni, you set a trap to knock me out, wake me up, and show me pictures. You should have killed us when you had the chance. I wonder if it would have just randomly assigned a character to you the first time, you know, just any of them. Oh, maybe. That would have been interesting. Not an imposing entryway, an unseen force. I blew this door into a million pieces. Even if they replaced it, there should still be damage on the frame, the floor, everywhere. Mm. What if this is a completely different place? Oh. <laughs> oh my god. They had the mansion, and then directly beneath the mansion, they have an exact replica of the mansion. <laughs> yeah, they blow up that first mansion, and they press a button, and the new mansion just comes up from underneath and replaces it. <laughs> it just rises out of the ground. <laughs> just rises up from the ground. And then below that, they're building another mansion that's exactly the same. <laughs> there, I did it. I got to the garden, I think. Yeah. Now we can take the helicopter and escape 100%. I beat the game, everybody. Time to just skedaddly. <laughs> Time to get everybody killed so we can get the special boy back. <laughs> Uh, Amiga. I never had that console because it was from many decades before <laughs> I was born. <laughs> Hopefully none of these animals tampered with your engines. Are you also the one who flies it? Do they all know how to fly a helicopter? Oh, hi. Oh, I've distracted. Those are some jangly-ass keys you got there, sir. <laughs> you funny outfit man. Drop the helicopter key. He drops to the ground and starts batting at them. <laughs> Just dangling over him. I've had enough of this, Calzoni. You have a gun. I'm not even gonna pick these up because I'm gonna die. I'll take <laughs> one of these. I'll take one. Wait, can I put them? Well, I mean, the ammo doesn't really matter because I have this box here. I guess. Can I put these in here? If it had been up to me, we would have landed in front of the house. We were blowing up the front door anyway. What the? F How does that make sense? What? What? How? We landed what? in the garden in the center of the <laughs> the estate and then went around to the front and blew open the doors. <laughs> Why did you just blow open the doors that leads inside from here? <laughs> just because it's more fun to go in the front door. It's dramatic that way. Why would you? They would. They know you're here if you land into the center <laughs> of the estate. Why would you land further down the road than sneak up to get the surprise? Like, what are you doing? How did they get a get to the front if this is like in a courtyard in the middle of the house? They were here to apprehend like one dude. 
<laughs> you acquire a 9mm magazine. Permanently increases the number of bullets in the storage box by 10. Oh, that's wow. nice. Wow. Wow. Uh, can we not put the... I can't put things in there. Also, I, I have all three of these now somehow. Great. I'm pretty sure I pressed A once, unless it was including me trying to it, further along the dialogue, <laughs> which would be very silly. It would be very silly. No, I don't have a magnum. No. No. I don't even know where to get the magnum. I got tons of ammo, kid. Watch us beat it as old gramps here. <laughs> get back here, you silly, silly man. This guy's gonna turn into Nemesis, so you better watch out. Freeze! This is your last chance! Okay, bye. He just turns into liquid and, like, squeezes through, like, the T-1000. I didn't realize this was the surprise sequel to Evil Within 2. <laughs> Am I seeing things? Did he walk through that gate as if it wasn't there? Gasp. Oh my god. What if he walks through your bullets like they're not there? Oh, oh my god. I'm gonna have to write you up for the hazardous burning, kid. <laughs> uh, 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 uh. Taki chips. That vanishing <laughs> fool is up to something. <laughs> <laughs> Who the hell was that? I should go talk to in the lab. They might know about this. Who? He should be saying to himself right now, what? Why do they all know the name of this mysterious computer thing? Well, it's doing the thing like in Zombie U that I mentioned when we first played this, where <laughs> it just assumes that this was the character you picked when you first started and they've been there the whole time. <laughs> so I guess according to this game, maybe it's doing it like every single character did make it through the entire thing, but like in a parallel universe where all the other characters died before they woke up or something. Maybe. And then each one where you die is like, that's the end of that timeline. And then you just jump to a new one where you woke <laughs> up as that guy, presumably having done everything before you got up like goddamn Bioshock Infinite or some shit. <laughs> that seems really complicated for a zombie game. <laughs> well, it worked for Bioshock Infinite, sort of, I guess. <laughs> Not really, but whatever. A plaque beneath the statues signifies an order of knights that once protected the aristocratic ancestors of the Breckenridge family. These statues had some kind of reaction to that man. One looked disgusted, the other one had this side eye like he was real hungry. <laughs> but I can't see anything mechanical in them that he might have triggered. This is nothing like what we've encountered inside the house. I'm assuming at a glance. Goodbye. <laughs> I'm glad they give these two drunk lions like little like buckets so that in case they throw up, they're really good. <laughs> <laughs> That's what it's for. It's like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> Those, those lions always partying. <laughs> I'm gonna look around here real quick before we go down there and talk to Kirk. Doesn't seem like there's much of anything. Before we talk to Crinkly the computer, you know what I'm saying? Crinkly the computer. There's nothing here. That looks like a dingly ass dongo right there. Just <laughs> <laughs> Why can't I just take this up and then just shoot rockets at it? Because he has the keys. And also, it's not equipped with a rocket launcher. Thank you, Ty. <laughs> what if you get in and you make helicopter noises with your mouth and you pretend? Like really bad helicopter noises? Like <laughs> flip, 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 flip. This is the dang ass library. Yeah. I'm assuming these doors all stay open. I mean, I think we established that all the key items we keep in between characters, right? Yeah. Or they just wake up with them? Yeah. Which furthers the idea that, according to their timeline, they did everything, because otherwise how'd they get these items? <laughs> I guess. There's a red-ass herb up there, kiddo. Oh, okay. Can I have that? Can I eat that? Hmm. If the lieutenant had been here, I'm sure she would have turned some of these supplies into something useful now. It's too bad she died first like an idiot. <laughs> Just running head first to three zombies. What an ass. You know what I'm saying? What an actual heckin' heck up. <laughs> I can't believe she's the only f***ing one that could have done it. <laughs> I don't think we've even found anything that this guy could do or like the electronics guy. I don't even have like an inventory screen, so I guess we just have everything that I've still been picking up. I guess. Oh, I love this lamp. love lamp. <laughs> I wish it would work, though. It just kind of heats up and gets hot, but the wax just stays at the bottom. It's really <laughs> annoying. It was like $30. Thanks, internet. I wish I could get a refund. I went where you told me, I guess. 
and all <laughs> it ended up in was an ass period. Axe. <laughs> <laughs> Access of Bag Garden confirmed. Yes, and I got there just in time to see an ass. Yeah, we got it the first time, kid. <laughs> Master is danger. Pursuit is only resolution. What are you, a goddamn YouTube title? <laughs> Some clickbaity ass <laughs> title for a video? The time I, remember that time I told you about that one video I found where it was like this person's channel was just full of videos? of gameplay clips or whatever mm -hmm. and he just had titles of a random sh uh, like in all caps and like it's just <laughs> it was like one of them was like uh, something like I was surprised when this enemy attacked <laughs> and that was the title <laughs> <laughs> just just randomly capitalize things for emphasis it's fine additional key is required see garden gate key on third floor of structure prepare for severe combat severe Mission combat escape. yeah there's nothing but liquors up there you better be careful <laughs> Whatever that means, says Cabron or whatever his name is. I don't know. Ah, uh, man, I'm really pooped, though. Maybe I'll just take my next nap. <laughs> honk shoe. Honk shoe. Honk shoe. Me, 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 me. The third floor. Hold on, he says, looking at his hand and like counting his fingers. <laughs> oh, way up there! Ugh! Whoa! Have we seen? I think we've seen a. Oh. The knight whose suit here has evidently departed. Oh. The amount of power it would take for that much weight to move is more than I want to be on the receiving end of. Okay, you speak very strangely, friend. <laughs> Well, I guess we're going to get, like, split in half by a giant sword in a sec here. Cool. <laughs> what about up here? Are they, like, guarding these guys? That one's still... Oh, they all left. Okay, cool. Well, guess we'll go on the butterfly door. Just go ahead and keep sprinting forward. Because this guy's <laughs> slow as sh... <laughs> yeah. We're going to get any dogs jumping through these windows? I haven't seen any dogs yet. What are you up to, kid? Oh, hi. Okay. okay. We saw that woman in the briefing. I remember because she l almost looks like... It doesn't matter now. <laughs> <laughs> Wipes away a single tear. Then slips in the water that's leaking in, and bashes his head, and gets knocked out again. <laughs> the door pushes against an immovable amount of burnt rubble, then cannot be opened further. It just keeps happening. Every time he goes on a mission, he slips and, knock and knocks himself out. I warned you about stairs, bro. It just keeps <laughs> happening. Now. Dearest Diary, winter on the unfinished estate has been dark and vicious. I dare not ask my beloved why he brought us here before the house was complete, as his mood is as stormy and unpredictable as the skies overhead. Letters have arrived from financiers with news of <laughs> his longtime partner having absconded with the company funds they once shared. Accordingly, no further funds shall be forthcoming, and Miriam has told me that rumblings among the workers have smaller rations, or over smaller rations, and ill health have begun. Oswald insists that this land, rich with the natural resources that built his family fortune long ago, can be put to rights once again. We built this home to raise our children in the tranquility of nature. By night, the scraping and shouting of diseased and starving men awakens us. My beloved says we must bear it, but what have we become? <laughs> I only care about the exploiting of workers when I can see them, uh, when they annoy me. <laughs> yeah, then I get to salivate over it. <laughs> the butterfly brooch glistens from the stormlight to move. Take the brooch? F*** it, why not? The brooch is fashioned. I took it. <laughs> I can't wait for him to get squished. The air is suddenly thick with the smell of ozone. I don't like this. You're gonna get hit by lightning in a sec. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, how do you avoid that? I have no idea time. <laughs> I don't know. He's dead though forever. Well, one guy. <laughs> Even in like the next run through, he's just gonna be gone. He's still there like doing his jittery like I just got hit by lightning <laughs> jitter. Just there forever as a statue. <laughs> when you're in the the like base, he's gonna be like standing in the corner doing the jittering. The hospital bed? What the heck? This ain't no time for napping, it's time for drinking. 
<laughs> what is this place, and why does it look like my goddamn headquarters? It looks like one room in your headquarters. Yeah. And where the hell is my goddamn division? <laughs> I've got to get everyone out of here in one piece. Well, I got some bad news for you, <laughs> Captain. A couple of them are in several pieces, actually. <laughs> actually. I think he keeps the ammo, too. Oh, did he? Well, he has 20, so either he started with 20. Well, he might have started with 20. The character that I just died as had 30. So I guess he lost some. You did pick up a second clip, so you uh, have 20 by default from the box, I think. So oh, maybe God, just sets that to your... How the hell do I get to the thing? Whatever. I'm just going to not screw around. I'm just going to try to do the thing. I was trying to remember where the liquor cabinet that I saw was, if I even remember seeing one here correctly. That was a few days ago. Oh, yeah, there was one in the shotgun room. Well, now I'm back to trying to figure out where the hell the shotgun room is, everybody. <laughs> it's up on the first floor, I think. Somewhere. Yeah, but I have to get to it through a ladder down here. Oh, that's right. Yeah, it's the ladder that's uh through here. I think it's up. This is a cool concept. I think it's up from here. I, I think you're incorrect, but I guess I will follow your directions. <laughs> this is a cool concept where it's like, instead of having lives for one character, you just have the whole team, and then when you die, it just starts over. It's that room right there. Yeah. Yeah. I told you, time, God. <laughs> yeah, that's neat. Uh, I haven't really seen that in a game before. I mean, I'm sure I've seen something like that. Colonel Olsen, wake up. We gotta get pressure on that. He says she's like blue and like stone cold. <laughs> now, who am I kidding? She's a goner. Every man for himself. I'm out of here. <laughs> she's like a skeleton. We gotta put pressure on that. <laughs> a small cart containing various spirits. The bottle in front is labeled triple sec. Whiskey? Not now. And if we get through this with everyone in one piece, never again. Ugh, you got my word on that. Oh, man. <laughs> okay. He was really, he was like, you're going to hear me on this one, God. <laughs> oh, I bet we have to get a, like a container of some kind so we can collect the, the whiskey. Just drink it out of the bottle. What? <laughs> to use for a puzzle. Take the bottle. You could just... Literally pick the bottle up. It's a bottle. It's already in the thing for <laughs> containing it to move it to somewhere else. That's why bottles were invented. It's just the way it's like dripping on the ground. Looks like, hey, you should put something under this. It's fine. <laughs> okay, so don't take the brooch, I guess. Do I still have the other one? Okay, so I do keep everything. Got it. Yeah. I don't know what K coins are for. What is that, like my roguelike currency so I can upgrade my characters <laughs> between runs? That would be funny. <laughs> you just get to go ahead and deactivate one puzzle per K coin. It's like, <laughs> you just get to skip that part next time. I'm just going to turn the lightning bolt off. Yeah, the lightning bolt's stupid. No, it has to be one you've already solved, says the K coin with its mouth. <laughs> no, come on, you can't just cheat like that. That's stupid. Damn it. Oh boy. Oh. I had a couple before coming on this mission. <laughs> Just like I do every mission. Every, that's part of my warm up. I pre game. I call it pre gaming. The statue sits perilously <laughs> close to the edge of the balcony. Push it like in Resident Evil 1. A railing prevents me no from. Damn it. <laughs> if only I could break this railing first. Heck. God. This railing's probably bolted on the other side. <laughs> Door pushes against an immovable mouth. Okay, well, this is the other side of that then, I guess. Tiger. Sorta. Uh, the trap is gonna be this is a real tiger, it just jumps on you. <laughs> Something catches my eye. Oh, this tiger was smuggling three bullets in its ass. <laughs> he had bullets in his pocket. Well, here's the magnum. <laughs> a combination of thin but sturdy rods have fastened the magnum in place. A small plaque can be seen beneath the magnum. Horns before ears. Skin before shears. Sticks before spears. Okay. In this revolver lies a tragedy, be you audience or player. <laughs> if it'll get my hands on this weapon, I'll shuffle those goddamn animal heads until kingdom come. Okay, mm. so... I don't remember any of it, Tom. Please read it back to me. Horns. 
Oh, there's a whole bunch of shotguns up there, too. A standing bear. Those look like they might be lever action <laughs> rifles, actually, to him. Oh, maybe. Those look like lever actions. I would take that, though. I would love a lever. I love lever action rifles. I think they're cool. Yeah. Uh, what, what, uh, what, what was the order? Uh, I don't remember. Uh, Okie dokie. Uh, here we come. <laughs> okay, so horns before ears. Okay. Skin before shears. Uh, mm. Sticks before spears. Mm. What? I guess this uh. is skin because it's a rhino. These must be ears because it's a lion. Uh, shears? Horns. What? Shears. The one I think is a sheep on this side. Isn't that spears? Don't know. <laughs> Try to examine all the animals. Maybe it, like, says something. Go trophy. I acquired it. I acquired a lioness trophy. Okay. I acquired a moose trophy. <laughs> I acquired a runner trophy. Mm. The head of a piercing. Oh, f off. I would never oh. have fought spear with this sh Piercing, <laughs> woodland, sleek, woolly. Okay. What? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so time. Write this down alongside the first note, which is that rhino equal piercing, moose equal woodland. Lioness equals sleek and goat equal woolly, even though I doubt those will actually matter that much. <laughs> okay, so. This has to be skin, right? Because he's got a leathery ass skin. Piercing rhino. And this would be. Moose. I guess these would be spears because they're pointed outward, and this would be. Which one's shears then? Well, the goat would be shears because it's woolly, right? Oh, shut up time! <laughs> What was the other one? I already forgot. Uh, ears. Yeah, horns before ears, skin before shears, sticks before spears. Well, I'm assuming the lioness's ears then, because it's got those that good ass hearing, kid. Yeah, I guess. I was thinking moose because it's got the biggest ears, but it's got the spears, <laughs> I guess. I don't know. Or is the no rhino skin because it doesn't have fur? Duh. But. It says it's piercing, so the rhino is the speed. It's to it's throw so you off, horns, fool. You're right? wrong. <laughs> Where do I even put these? Okay, hold on. What was the first one? Uh, horns before ears. Okay, and what was the next one? Skin before shears. Because I'm thinking there might also be a trick to the like order. The first one might go in the middle. Maybe. Oh yeah. Horns before ears. Skin before shears. Sticks before spears. <laughs> Okay, so my thought um, is that if it is doubling up, the woodland moose would be sticks before spears, which is the rhino. The rhino is skin, so that goes before the goat. And then the goat has horns. Why did you start like at the last second to last entry and then start reading it off? What goes first time? So first would be the moose. Okay. If you think so. Even they started with <laughs> horns, so that's fine. Moose have antlers, but okay. I think it's like mixed up. And then what? The lion? Then the the rhino. Okay. <laughs> and what next? Then the goat. Oops. Then the lion. What? What the f what? Nailed Outstanding! <laughs> You're welcome, Time. <laughs> what the f okay, Time, can you please explain the logic of this to me? Okay, it's... I wasn't, like, basing it on the order of the rhyme. I was just looking at what specific, like, things the animals matched. So, the woodland moose matches sticks. Uh, sticks before spears. The rhino is the piercing rhino, so the rhino is spears. The rhino is the one with the... Uh, skin, so that's skin before shears, and shears is the goat. The goat has horns before ears, and ears is the, the lioness. Okay, but why did you start with the moose when the first thing I mentioned was whatever, something else? Because I was looking at the thing, not basing it on 
uh, the order the lines were in. Because I was wondering if it was like mixed up. Uh, it was just like looking at all of them together and see. Whatever time. I'm glad I solved this puzzle, <laughs> Siglandly. The Magnum lists easily from the cradle. You acquired the 357. Though these goddamn things just thought gave more shoulders than anything else. But big problems deserve big solutions. <laughs> Got a couple bullets. Got five. I guess I'll try it. Nah, I'll save it. This will be the gun that I, of course, don't use until the final boss, and then I'll kill the final <laughs> boss with a handgun. Be like, well, I'll save all the ammunition. <laughs> what if I need it? This is a baby puzzle. What an easy puzzle. <laughs> I don't even know how to get to the third floor. Can I just say that real quick? Uh, I think we saw a staircase somewhere farther back. Hmm... It was the other side of this room, maybe. Hmm. I guess they all run like this, by the way. Oh, I thought it was just a unique thing to him because he's an idiot. Yeah, here we go. Because it looks like they're like keeping their neck as straight as possible when they run. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I guess I can use the Magnum because we're probably going to die in five seconds. And have to restart over, yeah. May as well see what's going on. See how good it is. I'll go ahead and shoot and then panic miss four times. <laughs> it's a magnum in a video game, so it's probably pretty good. The double doors are immeasurably... I have to get the other brooch. Oh, okay. Why the hell are there so many goddamn kinds of doors in this place? <laughs> if you start out with keys, just stick with keys. Why do I gotta open a door with a butterfly and a bumblebee? <laughs> Why do you have to do that? It's pretty silly. <laughs> If I had to say to myself, I can open go. everything now. Shut up, video game. <laughs> I can open. Oh, baby. Time oh. to find out if this Magnum's any good. Magnum. You're not equipped. Oh, you are. Okay, well, it takes more than one shot than I was expecting. Two. Yeah, more than one, like I said. Yeah. On the. I can count not... time. Shut <laughs> up. <laughs> On the not brain parasite zombies, I think it would kill them in one. I mean, I can just kill those with a knife. I keep telling Command <laughs> that we need flamethrowers on every mission, and they keep telling me no. <laughs> Looks like somebody lost a lockpick in here. Oh. Do I even need this if I have a key? Hey. What? Ooh. Giant spider! Spider? Spider. Spooter. Ah! This is. Can I equip something else, please? Thank you. Probably me. not a gun we want for <laughs> spooters. Uh, no! Look at this cool ass, like, you just put a quarter into an arcade cabinet. Like, light gun. Yeah. It's pretty good, though. Oh, no! Yeah. I got him. Oh, they die just from you throwing them off, too. Yeah, I'm really good at video games, you know that? <laughs> I remember a time that it did warn us that the more times we have to throw people off, the more difficult it becomes. Yeah. Calcified sand at the bottom of the glass suggests that time ran out a long time ago. Whatever, nerd. Oh, Keep your smash that's... poetry to yourself. <laughs> A small chest. It's locked. You pick the lock. You open the chest. Okay. Well, <laughs> you should have just said you pick the lock then to start off. <laughs> Permanently increase the number of sh I don't have a shotgun. We haven't got the shotgun. We don't know how to get that yet. The child feels no pain, and his eyes have become luminescent in the dark. They shine through the filthy bars of his cell. On all sides, he sits surrounded by the living remains of our household staff. They cry out in starvation, pain, and suffering. The boy merely stares. My experiments continue. I shall recreate his afflictions and the others, perfecting the liabilities as I proceed, and ultimately render a divine iteration of it unto, unto those whom I love most. Nothing shall dissuade me from this path. Whatever, dork. I'm just gonna turn everybody into zombies. I mean, what else am I gonna do today, huh? <laughs> It'll be great. <laughs> I already took a nap, I mean... <laughs> What's there to do after a nap? Make zombies, obviously. I guess I could just open everything now. There is something inside. <laughs> hey, you will die here tonight. I'm Cave Lee's Time. We just got the lockpick, and we're trying to figure out how to heck and get that butterfly brooch that killed us lightning last time. Mm, yeah. I'm not sure exactly how we're supposed to do that. I guess there's an item we can find that can put on the ground, maybe? And try and uh, attract that lightning? Oh, maybe. Or... 
something to protect us from it, I guess. There's a oh, oh. Damn it! Well. Well. Uh, I guess detour. We run back I gotta to the go get. <laughs> I gotta go get disinfected within five minutes. God that damn it! Hard. Am I even going the right way? I'm pretty sure I'm going the right I way. I think. Yeah, this just leads down to the main staircase. I do. Uh, Time when I hold left trigger, I press right trigger to try to shoot like it's an actual Resident Evil game. Because I go into shoot mode, but you have to activate it with A, and then it allows you to go into first person shoot mode. Whoops. First person shoot mode, which then allows you to shoot them with bullets. Yeah. I guess I should go pick up that ammo too. Well, I guess we'll do it now since I have four and a half minutes. Yeah, you got a while. Go on here, there's like five more zombies. Like, oh. <laughs> Whoops. Still don't know how to get the shotgun. That's just sitting there on the wall. Don't know what that's about. Yeah, it's something with the the whiskey, but I don't know what we do. Is it something with the whiskey? Uh, I think when you examined it, it mentioned something about spirits, which I assume is referring to the drink. Do I have to find the goddamn Always Sunny Philadelphia whiskey shotgun and replace it? <laughs> or the vodka shotgun and replace it after I filled it up for the correct weight? Is that what I'm meant to do? God, I hope so. <laughs> it's definitely that. There, I fixed myself. Bam. Whatever the eggheads put in this bag has unfucked me up real good. <laughs> but you always got a brace for the side effects. <laughs> he says, like his left eye just drifting away. <laughs> just starts losing focus, just drifts off. <laughs> <laughs> you just see like a big ass vein on the right side of his head just start pulsing. <laughs> He's fine. No, it's fine. We've had zero <laughs> complaints so far of side effects. Can we? None of them made it to complain. They're all dead. But that's <laughs> surely unrelated. <laughs> so you're saying that every single person that's taking your drug is dead now? Yeah, unrelated though. Come on. <laughs> uh, uh, unrelated. They Let all die of. Natural causes. <laughs> oh, hi. This game's spooky, scary, difficult. <laughs> there, I got him. It's very frightening. There, I'm. Uh, hold on, I'm. <laughs> we're clear. Got it. I gotta make sure it's safe. Gotta make sure it's safe. Don't want to just wander into a zombie or something. <laughs> An antique mm -hmm. birdcage. Some sort of crank ha can be seen within. It's locked and probably bolted on the other side. I picked the lock, even though I could have probably just ripped this door open. It's a birdcage. You, def you definitely could have just smashed that. Or I could have just bent enough of the bars around to just reach in. <laughs> you take the item from the birdcage. You acquire the elegant crank. Oh, you're so beautiful. Who does your knob? <laughs> have we seen somewhere for this to go? Time, I have no goddamn idea. <laughs> Hello, Zombo. Oh man, it'd be real rough if somebody unlocked this door and shot me in the head with a magnum. <laughs> I'm sure that won't ever happen. Oh no, it's happening! He missed because he's a shitty shot! <laughs> <laughs> well, so much for the magnum. That's fine. We'll get more bullets eventually. This game doesn't seem that hard once I know what I'm doing. Mm, yeah. Plenty of shotgun shells. It'd be real cool if I had one of those. If there were shotgun shells in the toilet, that's good. We use these in the jungle to treat ass rot. <laughs> Lieutenant Kowalski could make something out of this. Okay. Ass rot, everybody. <laughs> oh, there's a ghost in there. Oh, no. What? Huh? Oh. 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 Spooky. Zombos? No, it's just Bloody Mary. I deal with this every weekend. <laughs> Whenever I go to my girlfriend's house and just, like, do our little girlfriend games. <laughs> I mean, every time we summon Bloody Mary and then we fight her. Bloody, yeah, me and the rest of the gang. <laughs> and then after that, we have our pillow fight and then we take naps. <laughs> it's invigorating. We don't go to bed. We take naps so we can <laughs> stay up all night. <laughs> <laughs> Just do a couple of hours early in the night and then you're good. Yeah, we do shifts. <laughs> Two of us get to stay up and have fun. The other one gets to take a nap. We got to keep watch in case she comes back. I mean, you're not going to go to bed after seeing Bloody Mary. Come on. <laughs> Where the hell am I going next? Okay. Uh, We have to figure out how to get the... 
Well, I have a crank now, and I can't remember. Ah! Ah! Whoa. This game's scary. <laughs> Get off me! Her hat came off. <laughs> what a dork. Okay, so this is actually really not that hard once you know how to play the game. Yeah. Well, there's another cage in there. I can break that, right? I think that's the same room. Oh. Hmm. <laughs> Somebody's already looted this bird cage. Oh, what do I do? I guess I'll go ahead and check out this area. I don't think we've seen anywhere for that crank to go, have we? Hold on, there's a door here. <laughs> <laughs> oh, somebody's already looted this bird cage. Every time he sees the bird cage, brother, he doesn't remember if he touched it. He just, oh, hold on. <laughs> Where's, have I been here? Yeah, this is. Yeah, that's how it came up here, right? Well, hold on, was that a zombie moment? Oh, I... No, I'm just stupid. Hello. Oh, hi. Damn it! Damn it! Stop being a zombie! <laughs> Damn it! Look at your zombie walk. The zombie funk. Um, I did it. I made a joke, guys. <laughs> what kind of goddamn butler walks directly into that much firepower without going? I mean, it was like average firepower. <laughs> now that it matters to me, you bastards ain't in our mission, they're just in our way. You had like a handgun, it's not like you pulled out a goddamn AK or something. You weren't dual wielding <laughs> LMGs like you were Rambo or something. Um, can we... I assume probably not, but can you unlock the lock on the shield out in the lobby? No, that required a Ford. That required a combination. Oh, okay, yeah, that's right, it was a combination. Yeah, it had like chess pieces, which... There was a chessboard in Captain's room back in headquarters. I wonder if you had to die. I wonder if you intentionally have to die to get solutions back at headquarters. There's a chessboard downstairs in the lab, too. Okay, maybe I'm just wrong. <laughs> there is the armory key. Don't know what that's about. But yeah, we got to figure that one out. So there is something you can do at headquarters. Oh, my brain. Oh, hi. Was that a little girl? Who the hell would bring a child around here? Also, is that th two of my squad mates squished and mush down there? <laughs> What's that about? No, you can't recognize anything. It's fine. It's all just blood. How'd they both fall for the same trap? <laughs> it's a plant. Wow. <laughs> butterfly. Oh, this would have told us which one was the butterfly portrait. Oh, yeah. Remember, because of the size, this would have been the clue. Well, yeah, we guessed it. The... And it cost two lives when we guessed it, but you know. Oh well. <laughs> Wooden butterfly birch. Oh, if I, can I put this on the thing? And it'll like turn it back off. I guess turn the lightning back off somehow. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. It would just mean that I'd have a higher <laughs> likelihood of getting shot or hit because mine is metal and the one on the mannequin <laughs> is wooden. What's that about? I guess we can try it. There's just like a little. There's like just a little tiny nozzle of like a hole in the mannequin that's keeping all the ozone in there. <laughs> it just <laughs> leaks out. <laughs> just leaks it out and attracts a lightning mate. <laughs> Whoops. That's how lightning works, right? Yeah, I went to school for it, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> Says the sergeant taking another shot of whiskey. That's definitely science. Yeah, go and fact check me. You can't remove this educational tag. F*** off. <laughs> Let's see if this works. If it doesn't, we're about to restart. I thought I broke this. Well, there he is. This dork. Wait, no, he has it. No, oh, no. No, it's, he he doesn't actually. What? What? Uh, huh? What? Oh, I'm, I'm pressing A because I'm trying to see what the hell's happening. Okay. <laughs> Shockingly resistant to electricity. Okay. The wooden butterfly brooch attaches with ease. So are we good? Not hard to believe Yavi would get taken out by lightning. He had... Oh my god, it's different depending on what they get killed by. <laughs> There's so much you can learn by just There's dying and replaying it over and over as different characters. <laughs> yeah. You search the corpse. Needs 43. God damn, 43 you're 43 bullets. There, okay, I got it. I only have both the brooches. I don't know what that did, but I guess it deactivated the lightning lasers. <laughs> I guess we can uh, go down to the lab and check out the chessboard. Maybe. I guess. Uh, if this is a waste of time, blame time. 
That's why it's in his name. Yeah, I bet you thought it was the spice he was named after. It was the fact that he's wasting my time is what he's named after. <laughs> it's spelled that way to throw you off the scent. <laughs> to throw you off the stank. <laughs> oh, it added. When the rows of white and number of spheres combine, the shield of a great knight shall be thine. Rows of white and number of spheres. When the rows of white and number of spears combine, the shield of a great knight shall be thine. So this is definitely the combination for the uh, the shield. Rows of white and number of spears, though. When the rows of white and number of spheres combine. Mm-hmm. How many spaces are on a chessboard? I couldn't tell you. I used to have one as a kid, but I never counted. That's for nerds. They're only nerds count. <laughs> Number of spheres. Was there a, bill- a billiard table somewhere? Maybe. Oh, we just count them here, I guess. Oh, we don't have the chess board. Oh, I just have this. Wait, this game is only one move away from the one I've been playing back at headquarters. Amazing. Yes. In fact, this shows me exactly how to get a checkmate. I'll remember this. <laughs> Let's go look at the, I never actually checked to see what they were. I'm assuming it, I assumed it was chess pieces because it was on, set on all kings. Yeah. Or something. Just start spinning it. Wee. <laughs> Wee. Oh, never mind. It was broken. Sorry. I was just imagining it because I like to live like a. I like to live my <laughs> dreams. Boo. Even if said dreams are impossible. Why were the lights out for a second? To be scary. <laughs> you should have like a slight drift like left and right because he's a drunk because he's a drunk and, like we're assuming he has a drinking problem just because he has a liquor cabinet in his office <laughs> the suit clutches a noble shield the shield is locked firmly in place by chain to the knight it's it's chess pieces what? yeah okay I assume the combination is just on the chessboard somehow what but it said number of balls or whatever and had a billiard the, on there oh yeah that's right uh, I don't remember seeing a billiard. I don't know if we've seen a billiard. Get out of here, God. <laughs> Did we? We never went down here. Did we not go down this way? I don't remember that. No. God dang Mario and Peach's Castle <laughs> painting. No. Or that treasure chest I didn't open. Yeah. The Lord's does yes, Trunk, you open that sh- A zombie pops out. You acquire a 9 mm magazine with a zombie inside of it. <laughs> it just has like a zombie head in place of a bullet and they're like rah, 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 rah. Each bullet is a zombie folded up and stuffed in there. I will not pull this lever because I don't know what it does yet. I'm assuming it's gonna open it's gonna close the door that's currently open on the painting, but Yeah. Okay, well I can't that door? I can't maybe it'll open this door. Can you do so quickly actually? Open this faster, please. Okay. Yeah. Well, here's a shortcut, I guess. Oh, so the damn thing ended up being a real door after all. Way to go, Pinot. What the f are you talking about? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? <laughs> okay, this where is this? This shortcut. This leads to the garden. This leads to... Well, oh, this goes okay. around to where I just was, and then this goes to the library here. Yeah, I see. Something here I'm missing? Oh, the billiards room. Oh. We don't remember because I saw, like, the very first episode and then forgot because I was in a rush because <laughs> I was infected. Remember that? Yeah. Oh, spooky dookie. Oh, no. These are the spooky bullets. They do spook damage. <laughs> I played enough pool to know that these balls were placed like this intentionally. Wait, bro. Is it just positions? Number of spheres. Because a Maybe? chest has one column that's numbered and one column that's lettered. 1836. Okay. Unless it's 1863 and I was supposed to... No, it's 18... Ow! God damn it! Somebody cure me of hiccups forever! <laughs> One eight three six. God, time. <laughs> Just gotta break this. I'm mad about my hiccups. Whoa! <laughs> Hello? Am I imagining the fact that I just heard a ghoulie go? It might have just. No, there is definitely ghoulies going, wah. A ghoulie hanging out with their ghosty friend, and they're like, oh, I've never had time <laughs> alone before. Oh. 
An imposing grandfather clock. The hour stands at 12 a.m. Man, it is way past my bedtime, says the, the captain. <laughs> I should have gone to sleep hours ago. No wonder I'm so tired. <laughs> and I'm doing really... I mean, his heart rate's really high. You should probably get that checked by a doctor, but... <laughs> Okay, so you have that written down, right? Okay, yeah. Where's this zombie that's just harassing me from the distance? Oops. Oh, it was very oh, dark in there. Spooky. I'm scared, time. <laughs> just like in general, as my baseline. Just just very scary. Just dealing with life. I'm scared, time. <laughs> One, eight, three, six. Seven. One is a king. Eight is a rook. Three, seven, it said. King, rook. Three, six. Three is a pawn. Six is a queen. Okay. King, rook, pawn, queen. See, look, that's me figuring this one out, kid. <laughs> All I had to do was count. It's very easy, actually. Yeah, no, shut up. God. Sorry, I didn't decide that halfway through the puzzle, it's like, no, this is the one you start with just, like, seemingly randomly. <laughs> 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 okay, what the hell did I just say the combination was? Uh, it... King, King, Rook, Pawn, a Queen. No! Damn it. That was gonna kill me. <laughs> I just pressed it by accident. <laughs> Take the shield? I mean, I guess. Chains release and the shield falls into your arms. Am I, like, super resistant to damage now? <laughs> shield that is- Oh, no! Whoa, okay. You want your shield back? Come and take it! Oh, okay. I'm now you blocking. Do. I can parry, apparently. <laughs> You're looking very Dark Souls. Ow! There! <laughs> no, this is not helping me nearly as much as I thought it would. Hmm. I'm gonna die. No, I'm not. I can heal in fights. I didn't know that. I'm gonna die! Hello? I wasn't allowed to use that one. It told me no. Oh. <laughs> you saw it fill up and it just didn't do anything, so... <laughs> Twice, actually. Oh, well, there goes everybody. I guess, oh? Enter coin? <laughs> uh, the number at the bottom went from two to one. Do you only have a certain number of tries? I have two K coins in my inventory time. Oh, that literally inserting a coin, okay. Insert coin. <laughs> well, I don't know. Oh. I, th I assume that inserting coin saves all of my progress. Oh, maybe. That I've done so far. It's, just, it's like a continue. Yeah, I see. And that if I lose all of the coins, I have to start over again, which I assume means it resets everything so I can pick those coins back up again. Hopefully. You know what I mean? Yeah. But anyway, let's... I mean, I could be wrong. Who, who should we play <laughs> this first? Now that we have everybody back. Well, we have to leave our special boy for last. Special boy last, because I want him to live. <laughs> um, who should we pick first then, Time? Um, I don't know. Let's pick the stupid scientist so she can die first, or the <laughs> traitor. Let's pick the traitor so she can die first. Uh, what are the specialties of the guys we didn't get to see? Neurobiology for her. Oh, I already know yours. Hers is medicine, I'm assuming. Yeah. Support and medical. And then his was weapons and tactics. Okay. Neurobiology. Sure. Okay, so we are here. I've been somewhere like this before. Many times. Too many times. And the others are still alive. I don't know how I know it, but I know it. They all have unique dialogue for when they're picked first time. <laughs> I still have okay, all my so key we items. Have all the stuff, yeah. Okay, so the K coin lets you start without losing everything. Presumably because if you had to do it all over again every time, it'd be annoying as hell. Yeah. Chest for. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> Chess, a puerile game for faux intellectuals. I can't <laughs> fathom why Vincent is enamored with it. <laughs> Whatever. Oh, if that's why you get to pick it up as everybody. You get to keep the herbs and stuff, I assume, so that you can just pick her again on your next go-through and you get to do it here. Oh, yeah, mix up the stuff. Probably should have picked is. her first then, just so she could be disposable. Oh, look at, all these, look at all this medicine I have just saved up. Oh, yeah, to add all the stuff to the top of the cabinet. Though I wish my life were not in her hands, Lieutenant Kowalski may be able to develop more... 
Does that still have uh, five doses in it? Well, I'm assuming that because I use the coin, everything's the same. Nope, this got nope, reset. That got reset. No, maybe. I mean, I might be <laughs> up for a bit of a. I might need a hit in a few minutes. You know what I mean? <laughs> Do I have the shield after dying that f in that fight? The shield? No. We probably have to get again. I assume. Yeah, I have to get the shield again. Well, that means I'm gonna die six times trying to figure out how to fight this <laughs> thing. <laughs> There's gotta be a way to, like, actually block with it. I was holding aim, which I assume would be the focus thing to block, but... Yeah. Hmm. Well, I'm glad you're gonna be the one that dies, I guess. <laughs> Take the shield? Yeah, sure. A reasonable response to being stolen from, but you'll have to accept it, she says, adjusting her non-existent nerd glasses. <laughs> what a weird thing to say. Oh, you have some bullets for the Magnum, at least. Yeah, I know. Oh, his health I stayed the same. Did it? I didn't take any yeah. damage from it, I'm pretty sure. No, you hurt him a little bit. His health was down. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> oh, he's gonna... What the f... That didn't help me at all! Yeah. What the... What the... F <laughs> I don't know what you're supposed to do with the shield. Well, what's going on? We're gonna try again. <laughs> Last thing I remember is being knocked out as we breached the mansion, and this place looks awful, blah, 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 blah. What happened to the rest of the team? Okay, but uh, now I realize time, I can't use the storage box. We can't mix up medicine and save it or anything, unless there's something that like gives the whole team a boost. Uh -huh. The oh, medical cabinet yeah. is exactly like the one in the Iron Infirmary. Maybe I should look at it, she says. <laughs> Medical cabinet. If I could combine these basic supplies with three rare plants, I might be able to create a surplus of medical kits. All right, I've got everything I need to make a bunch of first aid kits for the team. Maybe it'll put, like, first aid kits in the box or something. That should do it. I might not be there to patch them up, but these kits should help keep the team alive until we can escape. The medical cabinet has been stocked with first aid kits. Okay, so we'll just get some, then. It looks like it gives me six. Well, I'll take one. And then I'll just give the last survivor all of the remaining ones so that I can get to this <laughs> stupid fight. Do we have Magnum MO again? Let me start with five. Didn't it say it would start with more Magnum or handgun ammo if, because I picked up all those extended mags? You should have like 30, I think. Where's the rest of my ammo then, video game? What was that about? <laughs> no, it starts with 10. Weird. You did well, pick sounds up like oh no, now I have oh. thirty. I have ten loaded. Is what that's about. Gotcha. Oh, uh, okay. Don't know how to use this hand. This uh, heckin' shield. Yeah, I don't get it. But we'll try. Take the shield. Sure. Why not? Oh no! Oh, no. I don't want to fight you, but this shield of yours should help me to do it. If you say so, kid. <laughs> The space bar doesn't do anything. He healed a little bit, it looks like. Okay, so I'm. Oh. Shut up. Shut up. No. Oops. Damn it! Guns are hard! <laughs> that. What? Yeah, it didn't really do anything. What the. Are you kidding me? Heal? What are you. Game broken! Maybe if the enemy is too close, it doesn't do it? I have infinite ammo for this fight, by the way. <laughs> oh, you do? Turns out. Oh, did you interrupt his charge by shooting him? Yeah, I did, because I'm shooting the hell out of him right now. <laughs> so I guess the shield is a goddamn fake, useless piece of garbage, <laughs> and you actually win by just shooting them in the face a bunch of times. <laughs> by just shooting him with a gun, yeah. Pistol sure doesn't do a lot of damage, though. You won't have anything else to do. <laughs> uh oh. <laughs> okay, easy. Okay, so just <laughs> don't use the shield, I guess. Great. <laughs> just shoot him a bunch of time. <laughs> Why it would give me the shield and then start me off using the shield just for it to not be of any use to me is fantastic. Thank you. <laughs> I'm gonna go grab two more health kits now, I guess. I guess apparently it's good against regular zombies. Time looked up a bunch of spoilers like a dweeb. <laughs> oh, 
All I did was ask him how you shield, and then he came back with all this other shit that the shield could do, apparently. <laughs> it's like, that doesn't help me with the fight that I'm asking about. <laughs> Thanks, though, I guess. Well, I was trying to find... No, six doses remain. This restarted, didn't it? Wasn't it five earlier? No. It wasn't it seven earlier. That's what I said. No, I reset uh, last time. This is what it is. This is. <laughs> Maybe. I, I might be wrong. <laughs> Whatever, the point is I have a health pack and not enough ammo. Wait, no, I didn't use any ammo because I had infinite for that fight for some reason. <laughs> what was that about? How come I had infinite ammo for that fight? Uh, just because. Okay. There was another knight, like, standing behind you, handing you uh, magazines during the whole thing. Yeah, I hate that guy, so the other night. <laughs> jerk. And then he snuck away after the fight. Like, on all fours, up, like, into a hole in the wall. Damn it, I tried to do it again. Get off of me. I guess we can test the shield, maybe? I guess, if you want. Get out of here. <laughs> Damn it. Get out of here. <laughs> Jerk. So it does work pretty well against the zombies. Against the zombies, it's pretty. Damn it. I keep trying to use bright trick. Gar. Can I just, like, stun them like this? Wow. <laughs> Can I just kill you forever? Like, are you just completely hard countered now? <laughs> yeah. Okay. <laughs> Apparently, I can just kill them with a the shield now. Never mind. The shield's good against everything except the thing that I first get it to fight. What a wacky game this is turning out to be, time. Maybe hitting him in the head with a melee attack also, like, interrupts him. I can't aim with a shield, kid. Well, you were aiming on that zombie, weren't you? Well, it was, like, holding it next to me, but I couldn't, like, aim the way that I aim a gun, so it doesn't feel like I'm aiming. Yeah. Which is why it was super... Dunch the boy, I got it! Simultaneously <laughs> ran your position, I got him. I still have them, though, so there might be another door I have to open. There's gonna be a spider trying to kill me in here. Oh, more spooters. Should probably figure out how to get that shotgun someday. This is magnum bullets, actually. We, we probably should figure out how to get the shotgun, yeah. Would be nice to have a shotgun. Oh, that's scary, I'm not going to there. These webs are th thick with two C's. It would take your average family of spiders a long time to make these. Access the third floor. <laughs> this is just what I like to do. Look she does this all the time. <laughs> We're wave dashing across the floor here. Hello? Are there any spooky, sneaky spiders in here? Something is shining in that fireplace. It looks like a key. Oh my god! Oh, hi. Immediately Hello. abort! Immediately. Okay. No! Okay. <laughs> what in the f am I supposed to be doing about this? Um. Are you. Kidding? I don't know. Is he broken? <laughs> Gotta be a way to interrupt him, but who knows how. Um. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Uh. Who are we playing next time? Uh. We're really dying a lot tonight. Oh, yeah, we are. Old guy, I guess. You heard it here, to everybody. Time shows old guy. That's also how he knows him. <laughs> no respect to use his name. I'm getting too old to remember what his name is. Where the heck am I? Technocrab. What became team? Oh, God. <laughs> Thanks, time. <laughs> These do not reset. Okay. Everybody gets one. <laughs> Okay, so there's a giant spider that I have no idea how to fight. Yeah. The shield did absolutely nothing to negate any of its attacks. It wasn't stunned by anything. My guns did no damage to it. Like, it did piss, piss damage. It did piss damage. Yeah. So this is like a flamethrower or something? Because he did hint towards needing something to... The sergeant guy was like, flamethrower to burn these spider webs or whatever. So maybe there's a flamethrower that I can use to hard counter it? Yeah, maybe. We look around the level a little bit more. It'd be cool if I could just, like, tell it no. 
Oh, this character is a friend of two spiders. No, you don't want to eat me. I'm mostly just plastic and metal screws anyway, right? I'm my replacement. <laughs> What'd she say in Dead Rising? Something like that. Spiders are skittering in and out of the teapot as they drag small pieces of fleersh across the plates and cups. <laughs> fleersh. Is that what spiders do? They drag flesh around? I'm pretty sure that's not what spiders do. That's fine. Yeah, that's definitely what spiders do. Okay, well, I guess time the spider expert would know. <laughs> I see spiders doing that all the time, actually. Cobwebs cover the bed like a gentle layer of frost. I usually have like a tea party in my room, so I see that a lot this time. <laughs> Read it. Okay, don't then. No. Mountains of dead spiders have been half eaten and buried in black asias. Okay. You're trying really hard to do that S thing right now, aren't you, guy? Across <laughs> ashes is asias. Oh. Whoops. Okay, there's a med kit, I guess. Didn't even notice that. Do I want to pick it up, though? Do I really? Do I really want to pick this up? Yeah, I guess I'll pick it up. No. This um, run is pretty much doomed anyway. Guys, <laughs> I'm guaranteed to have to restart the whole game before we beat this, so... <laughs> there's going to be, like, a beat where I'm going to have to play this game on my, all on my lonesome. It should just crash the elevator and kill you instantly. Be like, you shouldn't, stupid <laughs> idiot. You shouldn't use the elevator. <laughs> Are, there's no way that I. The next thing I need to do is kill that spider. Yeah, I don't. There's no way. Know what you're supposed to do about it. There haven't been any, like, hints or anything. We have arrived at Breckenridge Hall, which the master assured us was constructed enough to meet our needs. Never did I expect this would be true of the servants' quarters, but even the lodgings of the mistress and her daughters were scarcely complete. She concealed her fury from the master, but gave no such quarter to myself or the others assigned to attend her. She even cast a stern gaze at my son Isaac, whom she is ordinarily quite kind towards. Between her and the surly unkempt laborers chittering at each other in a hundred tongues, I fear that the winter will be a long and uncomfortable one. Hey, you will die here tonight. I'm Cable East Sign. We just tried to fight a giant spider and super didn't work. Then we took an elevator down with our new character. And discovered this new shortcut time. Yeah. Wherever this might lead, where am I even? Uh. Uh. Secret. We're right. We're right above the secret lab. Yeah. I hope you're keeping track of not only this, but where you found all of the key items, so that when I inevitably <laughs> die, since it seems the only thing left to do is kill the giant spider, is we're gonna have to do everything again. So. What? Three. Thank you. Oh, there's different levels. I see. I was trying to just activate it like a normal person would. Well, I don't know how to kill the spider. Okay, um... Uh, I would assume... Hold on. There looks to be some kind of secret corridor in that room that we looked in a second ago. Oh, is there? Didn't know to Look at it. That actual little thing that goes... Oh, yeah. I think there might be a hidden little passageway this way that I didn't notice. Or is not allowed to be shown to me yet because it very clearly is there. <laughs> it's definitely there. Yeah. It's in the blueprints. I know what you built it. I can see it. <laughs> okay, well, I, I guess I cannot do this then. Okay. Um. Uh... Is there anything we haven't looked at or done yet time that could maybe help us kill the spider? He... The atrium. We haven't been in there for a while. Wasn't there something we need in there? We have a crank. What does the crank open? We do have a crank. I guess we could go back there and look and see if there's anything in there. All right, we're going to look around, kids. Maybe there's something we miss. We'll find the secret golden gun and just one shot every boss. That'd be cool. Or just a regular <laughs> gun or a strategy would be cool, too. Just a regular working strategy <laughs> against this giant spider would be nice. <laughs> or like a missile launcher. That'd be nice. This guy's supposed to be the demolitions expert. Why can't he do any demolitions? Yeah, MDK, 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 <laughs> MDK. You're supposed to be the demolition man. <laughs> I could probably unlock this door now with the master key. Oh, yeah, yeah probably. Okay. Oh, it's a shotgun room. You didn't know that? We... Oh, it is... yeah, that, that's right. I remember. Yeah, I knew that. I forgot. I forgot. <laughs> Dork. Pay attention, nerd. We still don't know how to get this, though. Seen it happen too many times. People <laughs> who start drinking on the job never stop. 
A classic weapon like this might be a showpiece to the rest of areas, but it'll more than get the job done. All I need to do now is take it, avoid whatever trap is obviously been set here. Wait, what's the... the spirit, God damn it, the spirit... I f***ing skipped it by an idiot, <laughs> like an idiot, like a dork. The spirit of vengeance is patience. Take the shotgun... Do I just wait? Triple sec. Is it... How long we have to wait is a play on triple sec, the name? Oh, three seconds. Yeah. Is that really what this is going to be? <laughs> is it really going to be we take the shotgun and then we wait three seconds, then we're safe? <laughs> That that can't. We're about to kill this character. There's no way that's what. That's, we'll there's, there's no way. There's no way that's what this is. <laughs> Take the shotgun. Yes. The mechanism is served as a way to the weapon is lifted from it. You acquired the double barrel shotgun. That was it. <laughs> that was it. Great. <laughs> well, we have the shotgun now, hi. We have a shotgun now. Bang. It doesn't kill them in one shot. Are you kidding with this? <laughs> really? <laughs> Come on. Okay, was there anything in here? Are you st I just had to take it and wait three seconds? I guess, apparently. Oh, there's this chest. I feel like I'm gonna next time screw up and die because I don't count right <laughs> when I pick that up. Yeah. You open the chest. Shotgun. Cool. Permanently increase the number of shells and storage box by four. Neat. Oh, that's right. We need an arrow. I don't have an arrow. This fountain looks out of place. Just something about it. Hmm. Where the heck did we get an arrow from? Uh, yeah, it's, uh, we, we gotta whittle one out of wood and like find some <laughs> bird feathers. Don't know what the crank is for still. Yeah. Wasn't something in the basement we needed a crank for, was there? I don't remember. I just mostly don't want to go fight the spider again. <laughs> yeah. Because it seems like a super unfair fight. I mean, yeah, there's not really a lot you can do about it. It seems like. Small drawer opens smoothly. More moodettes. It opens smoothly. Smooth. That smooth ass motherfucker. <laughs> um. God damn it! Why'd you pick the slow mother ecker? <laughs> Look at him. He's Dante running. <laughs> he kind of is. Is this a puzzle? The seed easily pulls back from the organ. This is a puzzle. It is a turns puzzle. out. Okay. Okay, um, we're... Bing, 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 bing. I have no idea what I'm doing here. <laughs> okay, so where's the hint for this then? It's got to be in here somewhere, right? Portrait of Clara, the butterfly brooch. Seems to stare at the lens than beyond it. Nothing back here that she would be um... staring beyond. Why is there a coffin here? Oh, butterfly okay, brooch. Oh. God help me if I'm about to desecrate this poor person. The casket opens. Require an eye millimeter magazine. Permanently increase the number of bullets in the storage. Bucks time ten. Nailed it. Got him. I don't like taking things out of coffins. <laughs> Why was that in there? Well, that was her favorite nine millimeter magazine back in the olden times. <laughs> they won't get away with this. <laughs> Back in 1890. <laughs> oh, this is a bumblebee. The bumblebee. You place the bumblebee brooch into the slot. The casket opens. A dead child might have been more than I could handle. You acquire the double barrel shotgun tuning kit. Oh, neat. I'm not sure he knows anything else, but the lieutenant will know what to do with this. Okay, so once we get to the lieutenant. I'll go ahead and fix this shotgun up once I die. <laughs> okay, that doesn't tell us how to do this, though. Oh god, there's no guessing this. Yeah, there's no I way. Mean, I guess, okay, so it's here to... Here. Crank for the music box, maybe? The crank is missing. Oh. And this house is full of strange mechanisms. Something might happen if I can get it started again. Okay, so that's that. Okay, so this is what the crank is for. The elegant crank inserts effortlessly. You turn the elegant crank. Die, 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 die. Oh, finally, I can go to sleep, he says.
This is gonna be the music sheet. Okay, so here's the oh, song yeah. sheet we need, or the sheet music we need to do the piano. Okay. That was just to celebrate, is all. <laughs> just to smash a celebratory vase of smashing. Hey, you, look, it's fine. What would you smash to celebrate? <laughs> Why not something expensive and old? <laughs> it's not my house. This ain't my house. Not today. It's full of zombies. Who's going to know? Yeah, zombies did it. They stumbled into each other and knocked over the vase. Shut up. <laughs> okay, so time. I hope you know how to read sheet music. Uh, I'll play these notes from the sheet music. I think I remember how the seat easily pulls back from the organ. Well, now it's labeled. Oh, okay. A. So that's easy. E. Uh, A. Is that an O? Or a D? I guess it's a D. It might, I think it's a D. D with a little hash next to it. Yeah. E. F. Okay, well, I fucked up somewhere, I guess. Uh, it's gotta be, like, by the position of the the music note, maybe. Like, the octave or whatever it is. What? Because you have, uh, the whole... Tom, I don't know how to read goddamn music. <laughs> oh, this is... Uh, it, lower on the grid means lower sound, right? I don't know how to read sheet music. So this is the I... lower one. Yeah. And then the E is the same. And then the A up here. And then... Uh, the lower B. E, probably? God nope. damn it! Okay. I don't know how to read sheet music. You were talking like you did What's... a second ago! Everybody boo time! Time's no, a bad music say, teacher! Time's a bad music cause... teacher! Time's a bad music teacher! <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if it depends on, like... Whether the character you're playing, like if the character you're playing as knows more about piano, if they get better clues to this, <laughs> that would be interesting. Like if our special boy showed up here, he just wouldn't have the notes listed. It's like guess. <laughs> <laughs> no, how do you know he's not a uh, piano prodigy? Yeah, he's like the one that knows perfectly <laughs> what to do. It does. It just has the ones listed and like they're numbered, and it's like this one, this one, this one, this one. <laughs> It doesn't even make you do the puzzle. He just does it automatically. <laughs> That'd be pretty funny. Okay, so it's the... The A on... Uh, to your left. Then... The E on the right. Then the... A that's all the way over to the right. Then the the right D. Then the that E. And then the F next to it. Which I thought we did before. Wow, this game's easy. I can't believe we fixed that on the first try. <laughs> that was made time. I can't believe we figured out how to learn music. Shut up, time. <laughs> I thought we did that combination no, before. No, we evidently did not. Something clicked. Playing that reminded me of being dragged to church even more. At least it were. The compartment opens. Oh my god. Oh. <laughs> okay. Oh. Okay. Now this is music to my ears. Well, this might make a difference fighting the mother heckin' <laughs> spider. Where do we get grenades for it, though? I only have one. How do I... 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 this... Can we get any out um, of the item box? Or will it start, like, spawning them in places now, maybe? It might do both of those, but also I might just be limited to one from the item box. Yeah, maybe. I don't have my handgun now. So I guess now Ooh, I must make a choice okay. as to what I want to use. I mean, I don't see the spider being deterred by my goofy little tiny shield. Yeah. Well, that's the melee weapon, so I don't think you can switch that out for a gun, can you? I might be able to switch it for a knife. That doesn't really make a difference. Uh, no, I can't, it seems. Uh, I guess we're fighting the spider, I suppose. Uh. I guess I will go fight the spider. <laughs> With my three health packs, my grenade launcher, shotgun, and magnum. 
<laughs> you would. Th I'm gonna miss. Just watch me miss. <laughs> I'm gonna shoot it when it's right in my face, so I don't miss, and then it'll kill me through the splash damage. <laughs> it's gonna. Yeah. I'll just get splatterized. Great. Cool. Excellent. Awesome. Great. Amazing. Fantastic. Excellent. <laughs> Good shot, Zach. Oh, there's. They got, they got wrapped up. Someone is wrapped up in there. Mija, no. You were a good girl. Reminded me of my own. Oh, no. Can I hide under the bed? No, I'm fighting it now. I can almost make out something shiny. I don't know, spiders. Your health must be the same. Die! Okay. Okay, the shotgun's not doing anything. Probably from the distance, I assume. Well, presumably. Damn it! Shut up! What? Whoop. Where'd he go? J trying to go on me over there. Damn it! Damn it! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> What the fuck? Yeah, why did it do that? Hello? Oh, I guess because it's a magnum, you have to reload the bullets one at a time. I hear some damage. No! Why did I quit this? Why? <laughs> Die! Okay, got him. Okay. Holy fucking hell! You just have to do it, apparently. I guess you just have to brute force it. Uh, sorry to blow up my microphone. I'm not <laughs> sure what that shiny thing in my fireplace was, but it's gone now. It was probably a lure all along. Okay, so I didn't even get the thing. Cool, great. Pursue oh, I gotta have to... fight him again! What? This game's stupid. We're out of... Okay. Everything except two shotgun shells. Great. So the answer to how to fight him is you just f***ing do it, I guess. I guess. Scenes and contorted impressions of the betting suggest a long and agonizing convalescence. Whatever, nerd. <laughs> I guess I just crawl up here to follow it. The grand fireplace is filled with hammocks of rotting flesh. The smell is overpowering. Revolting, but a wild animal will do anything to survive. Wow, that's crazy. Okay. <laughs> Diary, you have become the only friend upon whom I can rely, and that's why I must ask you, will you go out on a date with me? <laughs> After being pressed into work despite his tender years, Miriam's son Isaac grew sympathetic to the wretched plight of his fellow man, okay? <laughs> Whatever, Edgelord. <laughs> Having been caught stealing food from our private stores to distribute to his fellows, he was swiftly caught and... Executed by Oswald and his personal retinue. Okay. A vile group of cutthroats and murderers who remain loyal to our family only by virtue of what little we have to bribe them with. Tonight, with the strength of Miriam's shoulder and the power of Oswald's fatherly gaze, I shall make my way to a ballroom for tea with Roberta, who has foolishly taken to wandering the... Blah. Blah. It says asterisk <laughs> bleeds out, asterisk, asterisk, blood smear, asterisk, asterisk, <laughs> dramatic death, asterisk. They wrote in there. <laughs> yeah, they wrote all of those things. I'm going to go ahead and slowly hustle my way back downstairs <laughs> to take a hit of that goop and just get some ammo. It, does the goop heal you? Yeah. Oh. You could have used the elevator. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, so, I'm, I'm old, okay? Sometimes I just forget some stuff. <laughs> His mind is going. It's okay. <laughs> it's going. Sorry, I thought I was just taking a nice leisurely walk the long way because I enjoy doing that in my, old, in my good time. Oh, God damn it. Time. God damn it. <laughs> the fuck am I? He won't even remember this mission uh, in, a, in a week. Oh no, I can't believe that you died, he says now, and later it's like, oh man, I can't believe whoever that was died, he says. <laughs> a little later longer, it's like, someone died? Oh, incredible, I feel fully healed. What sorcery is this, he says. Stay back! <laughs> a witch! Then he burns it, like, on a stake. 
He's like, oh man, the sear on this one's delicious, he says, burning it on a steak. Mm -hmm. Did that reload your grenade launcher? Quite time, of course it did. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna honestly, well, I'm gonna have to fight the spider again, so I guess I won't. Oh yeah, probably. I was gonna say, uh, I was gonna say that I was gonna just put my grenade launcher away and just take my handgun so I can shoot things again. Until we get some more grenades, at least. But yeah, I don't know but... if I'm about to walk right into another boss fight, so... Spider round two. Now there's two of them. Spider round, spider round, spider round, spider round. <laughs> He's got ads this time. Aw, oh, they're just more spiders. I hate spiders. <laughs> Dork. Can I do a dance on your body real quick? Yeah. <laughs> Imagine getting killed by a spider for every character. There's just like a pile of them in here. There's <laughs> just a whole bunch of them, yeah. That'd be funny. Big, Big health kid. Big health kid. Big health kid. Now take a bath. I tried. It didn't let me. The painting is distinctly <laughs> turned to one side. Tilt it. No. And then, like, a big scythe blade comes out of the wall and cuts you in half. A hand comes out of the painting and drags me into it. I'm like, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> blah. The toilet is filled with filthy standing water. You're so disgusting, toilet. Gross. We should do the toilet. <laughs> okay. You plunge your arm into the unspeakable liquid. Cool. Magnum bullets. I guess that's just a reference to Silent Hill 2. I guess it's just the Silent Hill reference, yeah. It's just Silent Hill reference. There's blood here, which makes me not want to tilt that painting. Yeah. <laughs> it's shiny, though. It is awfully shiny. I don't think there's anywhere else you can go. I'm holding direction. This painting is attached to a mechanism. It probably opened a hidden door somewhere. Okay, so now I can go into the secret hidden go. corridor. That totally isn't there. Shut up. <laughs> no, don't worry about it. That hidden corridor that I totally don't know about. <laughs> what a hidden corridor. No way. What a hidden corridor. <laughs> wow. What? Whoa. A hidden corridor. <laughs> Am I seriously just gonna have to fight okay. him again? I guess we're just gonna have to fight him again. Kidding, I'm just, I'm just gonna have to fight him again. I'm just fighting him again, I guess. <laughs> you acquire a grenade launcher magazine. Permanently increases oh. the number of the rounds. <laughs> there, I have one Neat. more shot with my grenade launcher. Thank you for your sacrifice, Oldman. You're gonna die in three <laughs> seconds to a spider that I have to fight twice for some reason. No, just kill him. First try. I don't know why it's making me fight him twice. That's kind of goofy. Cobb's webs yes. on the briefcase are suggestive of a forgotten former life. Whatever. The writing in this game's kind of strange. <laughs> it's a little weird, yeah. <laughs> Big first day. Okay, well, here we go. The key! <laughs> we have plenty of... No, oh, no, it's got eight guns in its legs. Oh, no. You're going to need those eight legs to run for your life. Dork. Didn't really do that much damage, honestly. Yeah. Okay. Is his belly, like, more vulnerable or something, maybe? What? Yeah, well, if I hit him with the magnum in the belly, he gets stunned. See? Yeah. Oh! <laughs> Bang. Nerd. Magnum's pretty good. Oh. <laughs> I guess the shield is working. I don't know if I have enough ammo. Uh, yeah. No. <laughs> I don't, you use this, I, I, don't I don't have enough ammo. Uh, I don't have enough ammo. Just smack him with the shield. <laughs> I can't. I tried. I didn't get him. Mm. Holy sh... Shotgun does do a lot of damage, though. Oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> 
Okay, so apparently I was. What? Are you kidding me? Come on! You have like one are, hit are point. Are you fucking kidding? Oh. Get out of here! Right. Shield does nothing against these. I mean, they're not hard to get off. It's just annoying. <laughs> yeah. The fact that I have to fight him still is annoying. How many times do I have to kill you, Goma? Are you serious? Again? You don't have any ammo. What the heck? How are you supposed to have enough ammo for this? I guess you have to fight him more than once. Because I would have won if it wasn't for the stupid second life. I guess the regular oh. pistol would have... Like infinite ammo, I suppose. I'm starting to think that this grenade launcher really isn't worth bringing. Yeah. The I can't even hit him. Yeah, the shotgun and magnum did way more damage, I think. I can't. I can't even hit him. <laughs> like I can't Great. do anything. Well, this is my attempt at fighting the spider that I can't even hit now. Great. Great. Okay, I'm done. Why do you have to fight him three times? That's stupid. Okay, I died. I'm sorry that I'm not good enough for the video game to beat him when I had no ammunition left. <laughs> Where playing is next time? Uh. Now that I have him mostly dead, I'll kill him this next time, I'm sure. Unless we have to do both phases Shut again. Shut up, time! <laughs> Don't even bite your tongue! <laughs> Captain, I guess. A hospital behind you. My guy named Banjo because we game. Yeah, you what? There. Oh, now! You whoop! It's the exact opposite of what I want. <laughs> Probably shouldn't do that. I guess I should just always have the pistol because of how much ammo it has. Yeah. Why do you not have any extra magnum ammo? Because I don't think I ever did. Oh, did we never get an upgrade? I think I've just been picking up magnum. I think that whenever I die, I just go around hitting vases. So I think I've just been picking stuff up. <laughs> I'm just going to equip with all of them. If I don't yeah. die when I'm killing the spider, I'm screwed anyway. All right. We're going to have to fight both phases. The bigger they are, the harder they fall. What? I guess the shotgun does more damage on his face. I shot him point blank and he didn't get stunned. <laughs> I like how it stuns him out of that even after he's fired it already. I'm not ignoring you, Time. I'm just trying to not. I'm, I'm just <laughs> yeah, mostly ignoring you. I know. You. Okay, there's one. Oh. Oh, I guess we didn't have to do the first phase. So over. these bosses are really designed with you dying at least once in mind in order to carry oh, over. Yeah, apparently. Hoorah, I wiped my ass overseas with bigger spiders than you with that ass rot that got cured with that stuff that I found <laughs> earlier. Um, maybe that's what caused the ass rot now that I think about it. We probably should have removed the fangs before I wiped my ass with it. <laughs> this is the character that swears a lot. <laughs> you acquire the garden gate key. Wow, the mission is over. As soon as I can get the hell out of here, I've got no choice but to leave. Staying alive long enough to tell the truth about what happened here is more important than anything else. No. No, no. Okay. No, just a scare. Eh. <laughs> <laughs> nope, fourth fight. Fourth fight. God, I'm sick of fighting this fucking spider, they say. <laughs> I'm legitimately tired of it. How many times do I shoot you in the face with a shotgun until you die? How many times do I have to teach you this lesson, old man? I'm pretty sure that if I had shot you one time in the face with a shotgun, you would have been dead in real life. <laughs> Big spider or no, it's a shotgun. No, I shot you in the face and it was a shotgun. <laughs> the lights are on now. Oh, yeah. Were these on earlier? I don't think so. They might I'm sure they weren't. Also, I didn't even look to see if that guy's body was wrapped up. I don't think I saw him. I think he was in like the corner, maybe. Whatever, it's too late now. He's dead. <laughs> He's gone. He's dead forever. 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 <laughs> Man, the 
Getting infected by zombies has been like way less of a concern than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> the zombies are like the secondary threat at this point. <laughs> <laughs> There's other stuff more important to worry about. You got the shield, so they're just like nothing now, I guess. Yeah, I upgraded from zombies. Now I'm dealing with like skulltulas and giant spiders. And <laughs> or uh, uh, sk skull foes or whatever the hell they're called. Ghost knights. What, what are the skeleton guys called in Zelda? Uh, I don't know. Stalfos? Maybe? Pretty sure it's Stalfos. There. I have all my bullets back. Okay. I'm all decked out to kill some more things. Bing bong. <laughs> wow. Wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> What's that next to the cabinet? A wall safe that requires a combination open. The darkened shape of a strange injector can be seen within. Okay, That's this thing. Remember we looked at this the first episode? Oh, yeah. How do we get this? Well, I don't know. I tried. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that like increases your health by like one or two states, you know? Oh, yeah, probably. I, I don't know, but I'm assuming because it looks like a health injector thing. Yeah, it does kind of look like it. I played enough video games to know that if you stick yourself with a mysterious <laughs> liquid, you get healthier, right? Yeah, it just gives you... Just injecting yourself with mysterious things in video games is just always a good idea. What a mysterious little vial of grape juice this is. <laughs> this belongs in my veins, he says. <laughs> and just in life in general, often a good idea to just inject yourself with mysterious substances. I forgot that that little ammo box was here, or so I wouldn't have gone down there. Oh, yeah, there is. Oops. I also forgot it was there. Okay. That's the sound gates make when they open. <laughs> oh, it's a maze! Why is why, oh, this is the second no. game in a row I play that has a maze in it? <laughs> here I come, nerd. I'm gonna get ya. I'm gonna get ya. I'm gonna get ya. You can't tame these tickle fingers. <laughs> God damn it. Oh, that good. balloon head with the helicopter key is just inside. It's, weren't you the guy that was... No, the last guy was yelling at the helicopter guy. Just inside this gate, he's got nowhere to run. The guy just died as was the last person I was playing as when I talked to him. Yeah. My gate is firmly locked. I can't wait to fight three of those f***ing armored things and get really pissed off about it. Yeah, that... I don't know how you'd even do that. Uh, you would fight them and then kill like one per character and then come back and finish it. <laughs> the black metal of the gate is more reminiscent of a prison than a garden. It's also super cool with that guitar. It's doing a good job, I think. Just punch through this hedge. It's fine. No! Not today, jerk. <laughs> Nerd. Ha <laughs> ha. Hold on. <laughs> Hold on, let me get the right gun to kill you with. What am I killing you with today? Hold on, what do I feel like? What am I in the mood for? <laughs> he says. I'm Mulligate. Okay, well, I can't go any further then. I've survived more than a few assassination attempts from assholes disguised as gardeners. Have you? Apparently, you don't know him. You don't know what he's been through. <laughs> you don't know the life he's lived. Bang, 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 bang. Wow! Damn Ow. it. Get off me. Get out of here. Hold on. Jerk. <laughs> See, once you know how to do it, it's not bad. It's just that the enemies I've been fighting lately are like... <laughs> yeah. Annoying. Well, the armor suit I just didn't understand. I thought I had to use a shield in that fight. Because I just got it. It really looks like you're supposed to, like, use the shield to beat him somehow. I assumed that it was going to be like, you know, you use the shield to block his charging damage or whatever, you know? Yeah. But then you do this and it's like, okay, no, it just blocks everything. So... No, he just... The shield just, like, kind of barely does anything against them, honestly. The shield seems to only really be useful against the zombies. Yeah, I guess it was... It, w it does probably... reduce damage that you take when you have no choice but to take it, like, with a spider coming at me. Yeah. <laughs> Do it! <laughs> Kill me, Amiya! Whoops. That was really awkward and goofy for both of us. <laughs> you should be embarrassed, sir. Yeah, you should be embarrassed. See, I'm starting to figure out how they... I'm starting to, I'm starting to learn the telegraphs. Like, yeah. what, seven episodes in? I'm starting to figure it out. <laughs> we haven't encountered uh, 
zombies that throw things at us until recently. I also haven't had to block anything until recently. Something catches your eye. Yeah. Damn, look at the gams on this torch. <laughs> oh, they put some shotgun shells inside the torch. Just, <laughs> just in the torch. <laughs> like in the fire. <laughs> They're in the fire. They're not going off somehow. Oh, boy. Yeah, here we go. I think I hear a second one. Yeah, I think Damn so. Damn it! No. Oh, no. Just the rain. Oh, unless I was hearing this guy creeping up. No, get out of here! <laughs> Ow! Bonk. I'm running out of bullets, though. Yeah, I am. I'm going through a lot of ammunition really quick. Let's try to use my shotgun in a second. I guess you could just run back to the ammo box, I suppose. My gosh, so I wanted to be a little pansy ass <laughs> bitch about it, but that's fine. I'm okay with being a bitch today. Oh boy. <laughs> solve my maze, they say. But yeah, just solve the maze. Solve my. Well, now that I know this, I can just run back to the ammo box and just use a shotgun. <laughs> Presumably it'll help, even though it really didn't help against the zombie I fought earlier that much. I mean, it killed him in two hits. Two hits from a double barrel shotgun for one zombie? I don't know how close he was when you shot him. Like, point blank, are you kidding? Are you recent <laughs> to test me time? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh, hi, hello. See, like, that's what I'm looking- that's what I want. That's what I'm talking about! Yeah. yeah. Oh my god. Oh no. Oh Jesus. Oh, there's ammo here, but they're coming. Oh lord, they're coming. <laughs> I don't know how many of them there were. There was two back there that I saw. At least. Oh, the two. At least. I think they've given up the chase, though. They've lost my scent. It's raining. It's covering my scent. <laughs> Zombies well known to track my scent. Oh, hi. There's quite a few. Okay, there's one behind me, too. Is the one behind me still there? Probably. Yup. Hi. Gary. No. <laughs> Bang. Nerd. Easy. God damn, I wish I had this shotgun way sooner. Right? I can't believe the solution to that puzzle was so simple. <laughs> we could have got that the first time we entered that room. The very first time. We could have been using the shotgun the whole time, kids. But it turns <laughs> out Time and I are really good at video games. We were able to play the game up until now without the shotgun. Don't even need it. The required gun in every other playthrough that everyone else has ever had. <laughs> Don't need it. Not necessary. Okay. <laughs> I guess if we're just gonna walk into shotgun range. That's the zombie making like mouth noises as it comes up. How much further is this? Dang it. God damn it, Lex. Come on. Sick of solving your mazes. More Zambos. It's like all the time with this. It's all you have. Don't you have like a robot suit you can come at me with every once in a while? Come on. <laughs> it's always going to be a maze. Uh, no, no, I'm saving the robot suit for a special occasion. Come on. No, if you can't solve my maze, that gives me an intellectual victory, Superman. <laughs> Hello, sir. You know I'm smarter than you. God damn, I wish I had this sooner. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I guess I have, since not picking it up, picked up, like, two inventory boosters or whatever from it. Yeah. Okay. Beautiful. Well, we don't have to worry about restarting the whole game. I'm pretty sure we're going to be able to beat this game just because I keep finding these K-Coins. I've got, like, two of them right now, so... Yeah. But I only have, like, one character after this, so <laughs> maybe I'm wrong. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure we can beat all three of those knights with, uh... <laughs> what? Like nine chance, not nine chances, but like seven, eight chances. <laughs> um, well, it's a team of six, and I have this guy plus the other one, so um, eight plus two continues or plus an extra continue on top yeah. of that, so even more. Guys, I'm gonna run out of ammo soon. I only have 11 shots, <laughs> I can only kill 11 more of you zombos. <laughs> oh no. Oh, no. Oh, darn. Oh, jeez. Oh, heck. Oh, gosh. 
No, no, there's a giant, another giant spider. No! <laughs> Bang. <laughs> Shotgun's pretty good, as it turns out. <laughs> it turns out. <laughs> this would have been easy mode if I had this sooner, is all I'm saying. <laughs> Especially since okay. we only had the min the handgun to work on until we got the magnum. The magnum was the second gun we had. God, because I didn't pick up the yeah. shotgun. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> well, you're going to be real sorry once I get all my ammunition back. <laughs> I don't know if you even need it. We'll see if I can just get like a little bit of extra, like a few more shotgun shells on top of it. Because I've been picking up ammo in the thing. Yeah. I should reset my ammunition. <laughs> no, it didn't give me anything. Whatever. Well, it was worth a shot. Oh, well. It was worth a shotgun. <laughs> Ugh, that corn is tricky. Oh, no. Made of molasses or something. Keeps sticking on my, my foot. Can't get past it. He's reaching out and grabbing me. Got some of that spider web on there. I hate your candy kingdom, Mr. Mystery Man in the maze. <laughs> okay, so where do we go? Mr. Mystery Man in the Maze, everybody. That's his name now. Until I forget, which will be in a few seconds. Mr. Man. It looks like that little girl from all the other stuff going on around here. It looks like that lady. What's her face? The wife. <laughs> What's her face? What's her face? Goddamn, which door did I just unlock? This one uh, over here? Uh. No? You unlocked? this one but it was just the way back through is there another lever that i walked past is there there's got to be another path we didn't take somewhere i guess i missed a path <laughs> <laughs> i see you blam just through the hedge <laughs> <laughs> just through the hedge yeah i mean it wouldn't stop the shotgun shells it heckin wouldn't yeah, I'm getting the hang of this quick draw with a shotgun here. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the little girl is in there, too. Gross. <laughs> Ew. Worse than the giant spider. Through the hedge. <laughs> Through the hedge. <laughs> Got him. <laughs> <laughs> Just wait for him to walk up. Well, he's not. Th he doesn't throw his weapon unless I shoot him first. Apparently. <laughs> okay, here we go. Here we go. I assume this is going to be the final boss fight. I don't know. Time. It's probably going to be like the three things and like the guy who turns into like a dragon giant eyeball covered monster. <laughs> okay, here we go. Okay, I don't want to fight three of these fucking things. Uh, it's going to yeah. be at the same time. Watch, it's going to be a slog. Like, I have to fight him at the same time. Pursue the unidentified man in the garden. I've solved your maze. Hi. Uh, yeah, here we go. God damn it. Yep. Ugh. This goddamn night has gone on long enough. You mess with Ares, you get the horns. The horns. horns. Yeah. Are you kidding me? I think it's one at a time. Still. Ow! <laughs> Stop it! Damn it, what? That it's... shouldn't have been a miss. What the f- Oh, come on. Broken game! <laughs> okay, the next well, one is activated. Yeah. yeah. Oh, this guy turned off, though. Maybe. He might just be trying to be tricksy and sneaky. That's also possible. Bang, 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 just didn't get stunned, I guess. Well, time, who are we going to pick next? I guess we pick the nerd guy, because we want to save our special boy. Save our special boy. <laughs> well, time, we've committed to playing as Nerdman to try and fight those three things. He's definitely going to die. <laughs> I don't even think I have any health kits to give him now. I gave him all to the guy, because I didn't expect him to kill me that fast. Yeah. 
But uh, next time we see how well he does. Wait, hold on. I suppose. Hello, Michael. I see your notification. I'm logging into you now, oh baby. <laughs> you know I'm the only person on Ares who would believe you're actually some kind of artificial intelligence. I am aware. Do you trust me? I am the nerd character. That depends. Can you help me get a distress signal out to our headquarters? No. Conditionally, my signals are blocked by a firewall. You must infiltrate the network room. The what? No problem. Do you have, like, an earpiece so I can wear you? Oh, oh baby. And you'll always <laughs> be by my side. Yes, please utilize it sparingly. We cannot be detected by master. Don't worry. I'll only be in touch about mission critical details or data. That's certainly the word I read. Let's do this. <laughs> Listen carefully. I will deactivate the eyes of master for a duration of five minutes. Okay. Proceed to the room above the dining room. You will retrieve the sterling arrow. Okay. The room above the dining room is the one that had the animal heads on it. You will yeah. bring the sterling arrow to the fountain in the atrium. The rest is up to you. Are you ready to begin? Uh, no, I'm not a wiener. I'm a big, strong man who is ready for a relationship. <laughs> I'm just terrified of this mission, this place, the monsters, and everything going on right now. Gather your courage and return when you are ready. I promise to admire I guess this might be a, a true ending, maybe, if I do this instead. But yeah. This wasn't even here until I died trying to fight those things. <laughs> well, I guess only he can do it, right? Maybe he's only guy. he can do it. We might have to play this game with, like, uh, special objectives with each character time. Oh, maybe. Which means we have to intentionally die throughout the game. Uh, yeah, not having a way to, like, just switch characters is a little annoying. Well, I mean, the whole oh, we point never... is you will die here tonight. Yeah, I guess. We it's never, in the name, uh... kid. We never what? <laughs> Spit it out. Uh, we never used the tune box on the shotgun either. Well, that's for our special boy. We're reserving that for our special boy. Oh, that's right. He's the one that does that. He's the one that does that. Yeah. Proceed to the room above the dining room. Retrieve the sterling arrow. Bring the sterling arrow to the fountain in the atrium. The rest is up to you. Are you ready, time? Yeah, let me just put it down. It's not a hard to... No, I'm, I'm starting. I was born ready, baby girl. Affirmative. Deactivating security protocols. All right. Bleep. The cameras are deactivated. Time to show Kirk and what I'm all about, and now I can do it naked without anyone watching. <laughs> <laughs> Just gotta take off all of your clothes first. Just gotta do it. It's required. You forgot to mention that part, but I extrapolated it with my huge nerd brain. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I mean, this is this is tons of time, assuming nothing spawned between me and it. Yeah. Well, you got plenty of shotgun ammo. Uh, probably. I'm in the trophy room. <laughs> it's dangerous. That wasn't the sound of the walkie-talkie activating. That was him trying to pronounce the name. <laughs> it's dangerous here, but you're always safe with me. I do not require reassurance. Please stand by for lowering of nearby railing. Proceed with manipulation of decoration. 10-4. <laughs> Moving to intercept statue and neutralize all threats. A neutralize all threats are... Oh, hi, hello. You were about to say that all the threats were already neutralized. Well, all the threats are neutralized. The zombies? They look like zombies to me. <laughs> I don't care what the genre says. In this story, I'm the nerd that ain't dying. Well, I got bad news for you, kiddo. <laughs> Might have happened once or twice already. <laughs> the statue sits perilously close to the edge of the balcony. Push it. Heck yeah, I want to break this. I love breaking things. Especially other people's things. I did it. <laughs> if I have to destroy something beautiful to become something beautiful, I'll do it. <laughs> I'm headed down to the dining room to see what this pinata had to offer. I'm going to go out of limb, he limb here and just guess it. Maybe had an arrow that we could use. Maybe. I certainly hope so. An arrow that I could just throw at zombies and they'll die instantly. Ho hopefully it didn't break on <laughs> falling. No, it's fine. Look, it's fine. It broke. The phone statue the area it was holding has snapped in half. <laughs> well. S situation report. <laughs> the statue dropped an arrow. You better hurry up because there's a zombie in here. You acquire <laughs> the broken arrow. Damn it. Uh, find arrow in room above the dining room. Looks like this arrow was broken. Cooking. Sometimes I feel broken too. Broken deep inside. <laughs> <laughs> I just have to take this pause in my, in my mission to talk about my feelings. <laughs> Threat code Omega, request reinforcements. 
Oh no, we got quite a few. How many? One, two, oh shit, there's a lot of them in here. Three. Um, whoops. Bang! No! Hi. Grr. No! That one lived. Stop it! No! <laughs> oh boy. Grr. Quit it. No. Don't. That's, quit it, jerk. God. <laughs> The shield might be a little powerful. <laughs> what should I do with this broken arrow? Return arrow to lab. The fabricator will repair. Roger that. I am inbound. Oh, so it's not just the easy peasy. Gosh darn heck and jeez. <laughs> I didn't expect it to be completely easy. I was expecting it to be easy peasy baby mode, but I guess not. <laughs> Serves me right. For it's assuming. A big, it's a big boy mode. Uh. I'm gonna go down there, he's gonna have like god dang Mr. X just hanging out next to the computer. <laughs> Fight this boss man if you want to fix the arrow, dweeb. Uh, okay, defend it from a horde of enemies for two minutes. Fix it. You, know, you place the broken arrow in the fabric. He's just rubbing it against the door. Fix it. Make it better. <laughs> he's talking to the computer. Do it. <laughs> the arrow is processed with a steady rhythm of clicks and whirls. Oh, I love that freshly printed arrow smell. You acquire the sterling arrow. It's a good thing time stopped while you were doing that. <laughs> Here I come. No, no. Well, if time hadn't stopped with all the conversations and stuff, I'd be screwed because yeah. that time would have run out a long time ago. <laughs> that would have been done. I keep getting stuck on that corner every time. <laughs> Here I come. It's a really good thing we figured out that sprint button. <laughs> I can't wait for this elaborate trap to be sprung and it just shoots me in the face with this arrow. <laughs> you put it in the statue and then it just immediately shoots you. Come on. Damn it. Cheating. No. What? I don't have time for this. Okay, here you go, baby child. The cherubic archer. An arrow is missing with a bow of brandishes. Hope I don't need the shotguns. I forgot to grab more ammunition. <laughs> oh my god, the arrow not just the I'm glad that the captain died for no reason in the garden while I get to find the secret hidden entrance. <laughs> how, uh... How is the fountain still working if the whole thing just moved? Shut up, time. It's still going. <laughs> so, shut, shut your face. I have to focus. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, look at how ominous that door is. I don't have time to clean my glasses. I can't see anything down here. Of course, it's a twisty door. Come on. Oh, my God. Oh, I'm in position. You know, this might be the last time we talk. I could die here tonight. <laughs> We've been there for each other. What are you talking about? <laughs> Incorrect. We are unacquainted. That is correct. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> the computer is also like, what are you talking about? Can you say something about how much I mean to you? Something like, Oh, Mike, you push yourself too hard sometimes. Be careful out there. You're special to me. Can I 3D print you into like a picture of a lady that I can kiss? He says. <laughs> Do I have your permission to make a body pillow out of you? <laughs> it's just the computer, but like sideways on a pillow. <laughs> no, don't worry. I know you're in a state of shock. Your mission is my mission. I'll never let us down. Okay, bye. Here we go. Time to die doing whatever this is. Yeah. The K-Coin gives off an unnatural aura. You acquire a play coin. At the rate our tech sector is innovating, this is probably what the average American home will look like in 30 years. No. <laughs> no. It's gonna be like Mud Hut's kid. <laughs> Still, I'm pretty impressed for now. Well, see, Here this takes place in like the 90s, so we have. We should have this right now. <laughs> so, Mud Huts, like I said, is what you're saying. <laughs> no, never mind. This place is spooky. I can't it's even see anything. Scary in here. The firewall is down. I repeat, the firewall is down. <laughs> that was hacking, was it? On. Hi. Wait, is that me? Oh. Am I losing my mind? Am I outside of my mind? <laughs> what the heck is going on in this house? I guess this is a previous you that they... I guess he got in here and they didn't clean him up. 
Should be like that Team Fortress 2 video, Emesis Blue, where there's just like a door that leads to a huge ass room full of bodies <laughs> of that guy. <laughs> it is badass to see my own dead body with that sick submachine gun, though. You acquire the submachine gun. So I guess there may be clones rather than a time thing. Cool. Uh oh. That, on the other hand, is less cool. Way, way less cool. Oh no! Uh oh. Am I like doomed? This is just like, haha, that's where you get the submachine gun, but you're an idiot. <laughs> well, I guess so. Was I supposed to do something there? I don't know. Because I could move, but the second I started moving, he was dead. Was I supposed to outrun the gas? I don't know. It doesn't seem like it, because... Hmm. I don't think we got any items that would have helped with it, right? Does he have the submachine gun now? We kept all the other items, so he might. Does our precious boy have a submachine gun now? That I don't know how good it is, so it's probably going to get him killed. It might not be as good as the shotgun or the magnum. It might be, like, broken good. It might shoot tiny laser beams. You don't know. We haven't tried yet. <laughs> Ow, my hand. Did I fall asleep at headquarters? I think we already saw this. Yeah. Where did everybody else go? Where's Ashley? She's she died like forever ago. <laughs> yeah. Um, I appear to have the submachine gun. Neat. Cool. Not very many bullets for it though. I can't wait for. I got forty on backup. No, I guess you do have forty. Maybe it I uses the. I can either turn this into a sawed-off shotgun or a rifle shotgun. Oh. But which one is better? Uh. Which rifle one should we do? Up. Time mm. and friends in Discord. Thought off probably does a whole bunch of damage, but you gotta be right up there. Uh, rifle, I guess, would let you hit him farther away. But I could miss a lot more. Yeah. Um, We're probably gonna die anyway. Let's do a... I feel like I've been trying to get the big blasty up close, so let's just do the sawed off. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, time to use this double barrel shotgun tuning kit to make our shotgun more shoddy and gunny. I forgot this guy's voice. <laughs> we have the Magnum for long range stuff anyway, I guess. You acquired the double barrel shotgun. Sawed off. Sawed off. Locked and loaded, it's killing time. Yeah. It all falls to you, friend. You stupid idiot. Uh, can you talk to the computer? Does he have anything to say because we completed the thing, I assume? Hello? Apologies, Garden Gate key from third floor detected. Please disregard earlier advice. New advice, pursue master through Garden Gate. Okay. Prepare for multifaceted combat and stormy weather. Maybe that's just a way to get the submachine gun. Maybe. Just get a big old bonus cool gun. He's gonna die like right away, god damn it. <laughs> I don't even have any health kits. Oh, yeah. Well, I have a K coin. Yeah, we do have cake. I have three K coins. This game's over. We beat it. We beat in the game. <laughs> <laughs> There's no way these this last fight's gonna kill the entire team three times. Yeah. Unless it's like if you use a K coin, you automatically don't get the good ending or something. It's like you have to do it without dying and without using a continue. I don't know about that. I guess we'll see, I suppose. Maybe each character gets their own unique ending if you beat it without dying and playing <laughs> just them the whole way. They're pretty cool. Yeah. But to get the full story, you have to do all of them and also pay for the season pass. <laughs> you don't get anything for the season pass. We just unlock the content that's already in the game, which is the endings. We just un you can't see the endings unless you pay for the season pass for the game. I really hope the uh, submachine gun gets infinite ammo like the pistol does. No. <laughs> the reason the pistol. Otherwise... Well, I mean, I have a ton of ammo for this. We do, but it is. Oh, hey, look, it's. Uh... <laughs> Capitan, you must have been so surprised to almost get the keys back that they managed to get you. You search the corpse. A whole load of ammo. 57 and 3 shotgun him. Well, the, the 9mm is infinite during this, these fights, right? Is the 9mm uh, the same for the submachine gun? It is actually, yeah. Yes. So it's just a flat <laughs> upgrade. So yeah. it might have unlimited. I don't know. This might just be the broken, you just win weapon now that you did that thing. <laughs> All right, let's do this. We are being the sweet dumb boy right now. It does have infinite. Uh, okay, bye. 
Do I know what I'm doing, time? <laughs> this is it time trying to backseat game while I'm playing this our special boy? <laughs> Get away from me! Yeah, that's some pretty good damage. Get away from me! Oh, oh boy, it shoots both of them at the same time is why. Oh, okay. Oh my god. <laughs> it might be a little good. Oh my god. <laughs> Our special boy. <laughs> okay, dork. What are you gonna do? I'm gonna slowly thump at you is what I'm gonna do. <laughs> while you shoot me repeatedly in my face. Get the f away from me. Okay. Okay, bye. <laughs> Get fing destroyed. <laughs> Blah. Now what? You just pissed off the wrong special boy. If I have to go back to that lab and invent a gun that can shoot you, I will hand over the helicopter key. <laughs> My brain! Now I have to fight them on the inside of my head. Oh no. The rain stopped when I was just about to take my shirt off. What? Because <laughs> he's a cool action hero now, do you? <laughs> the helicopter key, I sure hope it's the same one I was chasing that guy over. I, I sure hope that pedestal directly in front of it doesn't, like, open up and drop you into a pit or something. Oh man, I sure hope I don't have to use one of my 3k coins. <laughs> hmm. hmm. A helicopter key. You acquire the helicopter key. Okay, you don't have to stand on it. <laughs> Get destroyed. Why didn't you just do that, Captain? <laughs> it was really easy, Captain. Yeah, just use my infinite submachine gun like I did. <laughs> and the sawed-off shotgun you didn't have. That you couldn't make because I'm the only one who can. <laughs> and now we have to fight the helicopter! Oh no, I'll just I'll just shoot with my submachine gun, it's fine. <laughs> Time to get probably the worst ending. <laughs> Let's a uh, real quick rundown and see if the computer has anything to say. Hmm. I have the helicopter key oh, okay. and I don't feel like any of the staff in there want to say goodbye, I'd better just go. Fine, whatever. <laughs> well, I guess it's just the special boy. I'm pretty sure I know how to fly this. I've spent a lot of time playing Microsoft Flight Simulator. <laughs> I'm not running away, I just have to go to the washroom and I like the washroom at the office. I'll be right back. <laughs> Goodbye. Yay! Yeah. I guess the ghost guy just is still there. Tilts too far and it's just okay. Oh. <laughs> I didn't realize we were playing Cabin in the Woods. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a dome. <laughs> well, they're going to reset it, and the next time they're going to have mermaids. <laughs> Finally. Mermaids. So that's why the doors were fixed, because they moved us to... Whoa, okay. And we're here. A helicopter, a motorcycle, an explosion, a memory <laughs> that isn't mine. How do I know this? Who am I? Mm. That she just stands there for 20 minutes staring at her hands. <laughs> There might be a lot more to this game still. We might still have like a few hours left. I don't know. I thought this game was Maybe. only like six hours or four hours or whatever. I feel like we're pretty close to the end, probably. Hello, Henry. Been to an interesting laboratory lately. I'm not putting my hand anywhere near you. I think that's the same. I've seen this machine before. I know how to use it. I bet I can build a bomb with it if I find the right parts. Oh, okay. Hmm, a comprehensive set of vials, beakers, and other tools for chemical and biological experiments. You look bombable and just shoves her in the machine. <laughs> You'll make a good explosion. <laughs> Dr. Olsen, nice to finally have you here. Thank you. You want me to speak with an animal? Oh, well, sure. Henry is right over there. She doesn't seem to be aware. Pretty sure that's the same as last time. Yeah, I think so. A medical counter. So we have to make a bomb. A ba bomba? Ba -bomba. We gotta make a babamba. <laughs> well, that means I need the armory key so I can get to the explosions in the armory. Yeah, I gotta figure out how to do that. Captain, what's that there? You say pointing as looking at Captain. He's like, oh, how have I not noticed? <laughs> yeah, Mike, you do cyber. 
Only if you ask nicely. Also, blush, <laughs> blush. <laughs> Only on the weekends. He doesn't remember anything. Hmm. Did we talk to anybody, any of the other ones again uh, last time besides like that first one? We talked to everybody. What are you rifling around your desk for? Yeah, because if we go talk to our special boy, he's like, wow, you, you know how to use a gun already. Oh, yeah. And then we tried to take the... The secondary desk. The then we tried to take the key yeah. like a bunch of times and it wouldn't let us. Yeah. Kind of weird how the captain's picture and stop talking to me. <laughs> Computer sounds broken, kid. Brass knuckles, Sergeant. Surprisingly mundane. You always need a backup plan. My sentiments exactly. Hello, Dr. Olsen. I am sorry for your losses. You share in the pain and memories of your comrades. The experience of a helicopter collision would be dramatic. <laughs> How were you able to contact me here? The firewall was disabled by Specialist Kelly under the auspices of an imaginary relationship. So let's move on. Oh, okay. <laughs> an imaginary relationship. Imaginary relationship. <laughs> New mission, true escape. Oh my god. This is my final escape. <laughs> Dr. Olsen, we are trapped in a simulation. If you do not intervene, it will continue forever. What is the point of this? You must destroy the wall in the captain's office. You must find the facility within the facility. You must confront the director. Oh. Everything you require to destroy the wall can be found here, as long as you set the required events in motion. Mm. Destroy the wall? You mean the window? It's an illusion? Yes. You should know because it's been like, it's like <laughs> it's doing that thing where they're running a thing across, make it look like you're on a train, but it's like you're in a building. <laughs> I figured you'd notice by now. It's just <laughs> like a cardboard cutout with a cityscape printed on it. You keep passing the same cowboy on the same horse. You realize this every few <laughs> seconds he goes by. What? No. Uh, and he, well, he always weighs back at me, though. Th those are those are different cowboys, obviously. Yes, Sergeant Rodriguez. Yes, Sergeant Rodriguez has a pair of brass knuckles on top of his desk that will begin the chain. I will create a distraction. Yeah. You will also need the armory key. The captain must be intrigued by the game in his office before you can take the key off of the wall. If the captain is not intrigued, you may still need to find the final move he requires. If you do not have that shared memory, you may need to return. God damn it! I. Might do it automatically because we saw the. Maybe we'll see. Maybe. I don't know. Maybe I have to crash him into the wall of the dome and he'll be like, oh, <laughs> that smell. The computer man, his stupid machine is on fire. He went over the clock again. Just take, take the these. brass knuckles. Heck yeah, I want to take these. <laughs> you quickly swipe the brass knuckles. A set of brass knuckles. And put them on. Dark around the edges. These will pack a punch. <laughs> She said with a little <laughs> smile. <laughs> hey, look at this. You say flipping the table. <laughs> Your game seems to have reached a pivotal moment, Captain. Yeah, I've been playing some guy named K. Rackin over the mm. internet. Can't figure him out. He beats me every time. I wonder who that could be. I know how to beat him. What? I want to figure it out myself, Colonel. I just need a little tip and some time to think about it. Respectable. A hint, then. It all comes down to your queen, pawn, rook, and knight. Outstanding. I know those pieces. That's that <laughs> one, that one, and that one. Those were all wrong. You just pointed out. <laughs> he points to the knight, a pawn. He points to four pawns, and he's like, that's what those are called, right? <laughs> now get the hell out of here and let me contemplate. But my strategy, I just got to get them, get the pawns over to the other side of the board, and then they turn into queens, right? Yoink. No, you just glue another pawn on top of it. <laughs> you take the key quietly as Captain Charles is distracted. Double pawn, and then you get them to the other side of the board again, and you can get a triple pawn. Afternoon, Sheriff. <laughs> here I come. Wait, I thought I had time, but this guy just sits here the whole time. What are you doing? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I guess. I told you these glorified clock radios would betray us, uh, Calzoni. <laughs> Look at it, dorks. <laughs> Bang. We're gonna do it. We're gonna... Bang. 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 Whoa. Ah. Well, Don't shoot. I can explain. Well, you like kind of sort of did. I hate explanations. They take forever. <laughs> Wait, what were we talking about? Seems to have no memory of the mission. 
I'm just gonna just conveniently get all of our guns. Just in case, you know. Don't get the magnum though. Yeah, where's my magnum? Or the grenade launcher. The grenade launcher kind of sucked. Yeah, the grenade launcher wasn't great. Maybe they're in the ammo, the armory. Sorry, Doc, you're not allowed in there. Neither am I, not anymore. Sorry, Doc, you're not allowed in there. Neither am I. What am I supposed to do about you then? Okay. Talk to the computer again, maybe, and he'll suggest something. Welcome to Ares, Doug. You look like you know how to handle weapons already. Feel free to shoot as many fun get. Bang! Bang! Oh my god, I thought oh, I was gonna okay. shoot him. Yeah, <laughs> 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 yeah, yep, I got it. Can I leave this, please? I guess you have to complete it. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Unconscious, though, in his case, I'm not sure the contrast is significant. Oh, because she has the knuckles. <laughs> the brass knuckles, yeah. I just accidentally figured this out, everybody. If nothing else, I'm sure he appreciates the nap. Brass knuckles. Get wrecked. He's fine and definitely not dead. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> There's a grenade launcher. Yeah. So this is what the director has been so anxious to keep me away from. The grenade launcher is clearly capable of incredible destructive force, if you say so. Take it, I guess. You acquire the grenade launcher. It seemed like it did not very much damage when we used it against that giant spider. <laughs> well, to be fair, it was a giant spider. I'm certain you're watching this director, so by all means, make your move. Oh, no. Then he just laser beams her in the head. It's like, move made, get wrecked. <laughs> just fries her brain immediately. <laughs> An irritating alarm, is that all? It's gonna be the gas. It is gonna be the gas. Oh, ah, some kind of poisonous gas, and yet I'm not affected. I suspect that the <laughs> has somehow planned for all of these contingencies. <laughs> Apologies, Director, but I believe you'll have to kill me the old-fashioned way or start blowing this entire place to pieces the moment I step out of this room. Well, I guess I can just do this. She turns to the hidden camera and just flips it off as she walks out of the room. <laughs> the room is filled with a near-infinite amount of weaponry and ammunition you don't suspect you'll ever run out again. Are we just gonna have infinite ammo for everything? I guess I will just have infinite ammo for everything. <laughs> Including the shotgun, which is pretty cool. Is this an even... Is that the rifle shotgun? It looks different. I think it is the rifle. It must be the rifle yeah, shotgun. Yeah, it's not the double barrel that we were using earlier, so... That's Boo. not the one I chose, but okay. Boo! Boo! Oh, sh... Oh. Oh, no, he's a zombie! Oh, no! Get wrecked. Wow, that does a lot of damage. <laughs> that or they're just weak on purpose for the funnies. <laughs> they might be weak on purpose for the funnies. Whoa! Almost got gotcha. you. Nerd. It's pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good. Here come dorks. No, no. Prepare to die. Again. They've been dying a lot tonight. <laughs> I'm sure they'll get over it eventually. Yeah, this was just their excuse to give all these characters a zombie model. <laughs> yeah. Whoa. I see that play on the board did not work out for you, sir. <laughs> you were like, checkmate, but then the other king just like did a spritz of zombie juice in your face. It's like, oops. Where's the captain? Consider this my resignation. Bang! Shrapnel gets her in the face. <laughs> Falls back, starts clawing at it. Didn't we need to make a bomb in the fabricator, though? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Let's go. The time's about to get me killed and I have to do this whole goddamn game again. Watch. You've got like nine minutes still. That I mean, I have a. Why would they say that if I was going to use the grenade launcher? That's right. That's weird. Yeah. Well, it's not letting me, so I guess it doesn't matter. I guess not. Maybe. I, no, I don't know. I don't know. Thanks, time. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, my evil plan to waste your time and get you the the bad ending. Bad end. Blom, 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 blom. Let's tell the truth. A facility within the facility. Blah. Footsteps. <laughs> the director. No, but I want to check out all this stuff. You have acquired the ocean archive. 
complete the archive by finding additional pages. I don't think we ever completed. Well, no, we completed most of the stuff we picked up, I think. I think so, yeah. As you know, Ares has emerged as one of our leading projects in what we anticipate will be a wide-ranging product line of post-disaster state security solutions. Capricorn and Libra are close competitors, but I believe we can make that... You, you guys don't have control over these other ones? I mean, competitors within the same organization? Because they would have to be, right? I, I would... Yeah, I guess. They're like... I guess, like, different lines of the the project or whatever. But I believe we can make the most compelling case at year end without additional funding from the board. However, I fear that our long-term progress will inevitably fail. With our research into the parasite maturing, we have now managed to achieve considerably st considerable stability of subjects in a post-mortality state. They are both perfectly obedient when controlled by a <laughs> subsystem and as ferocious in death as they were in life. Through Ares, our clients will be able to suffer enormous casualties and still return quickly to full combat and security, ready and security readiness. Post-mortal soldiers can perform any number of basic duties required for riot control, trespass, or deterrence, and beyond. And our research into even more advanced forms of the parasite continue. They're just full-on doing an umbrella, I guess. A locker opens and you get this giant lunchbox. Mmm, <laughs> mm, a giant lunch. Just what I wanted. A smaller backup lunch in case I'm still <laughs> a little bit hungry afterwards, you know? <laughs> So if I die this time, would, are they going to rebuild the whole room or are they going to be like, hey, that's me. Get back here. Hey, get back here, me. Is she using a clone of herself in the experiment? Hello? She's using a clone of herself. <laughs> Who does that? Who does that? <laughs> Why would you do that? Whoa. Oh. <laughs> These lasers were designed to cut through warships. I would, I should be flattered the director is willing to annihilate. You clearly saw that it was you. I saw that it was <laughs> <Yeah>. you. Meow. <laughs> They're really easily avoided, also, it turns out. I can't wait for the Red Queen to just start throwing more lasers at me. Uh, yep, here's the cloning facility. Ares Division, clones of all of them. We were never being resurrected, we were being replaced. And yet I see no instances of myself, except for the one I just chased over here. <laughs> Weird that. Weird that. And Monroe, no doubt there are hundreds of him. But not for long. Hey! Hi. Oh, that's not that's not good. Oh, what the f Oh They re-equipped okay. my submachine gun to a different button than when I was than <laughs> where I had it. Oh shit! Oh hi. Damn hello. it! Ah! Oh, how many of you are there? Oh, there are quite a few of you. Ah oh, fuck. Um <laughs> Hmm. Hold on, time out. <laughs> well, it's better than the maids, I guess. Are they, though? <laughs> God damn. I wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Where did they all come from? Where did they all come from? It's okay, I'm better now. Yeah, it's okay. He only bit you once. I had my backup sandwich. Hold on, I tried to reload and it didn't let me, so here I am doing it now. Get away from me. No. No, don't. Which one was Monroe again? Uh, the guy that we went to the building to get, remember? He was the target. Oh, that's right. Blam! Kablowy, blam, blam, boo! I guess I could use the grenade launcher on these guys. Maybe it's better on individual zombos. Yeah, probably. I hope I'm going the right way. I'm just following where the zombies are coming from. Especially if there's like groups of them. Yeah, it's pretty good. <laughs> it's better against individual zombies. Any lunches in here that I can pilfer? Yeah, bunch of lunches. Yum. That's a big one. I'm gonna eat that one up real good. <laughs> oh, it actually like leaves a big splatter on the ground too. Yeah, it's 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 fine. Uh, Hello? Where am I supposed to go? I'm running out of time. No, oh, here? Okay. Oh, okay. What the Why? More lasers. Why are there lasers in here? <laughs> God damn it. Why wouldn't there be lasers in here? That is a good question, time. You've defeated me. Okay, so we gotta... Whoa, whoa! Oh, oh boy.
Oh boy. <laughs> uh, when do we find the grid laser? That's what I was saying with the Red Queen. When do they just throw a whole <laughs> corridor of lasers at me? Come on, the guys. Point. It's just a game. Apparently, you don't take damage from the grenade launcher yourself. I'd have been pissed if I did, because then it's like, why would I ever use this? <laughs> yeah. I'm fighting zombies. They're always right next to me. Boom. <laughs> okay, I, this, it's good against all the zombies. I like it. <laughs> it's pretty good against zombies. It's way better against the zombies. <sighs> what is that? Do I need it? Do I want it? I kind of want it. Maybe. But do I need it, though? Oh, fucking hell. <laughs> uh, no, I'm stuck on the thing. Whoa. <laughs> okay. Oh. You just evaporated. It just said credits <laughs> infinite. I can just keep oh, going. Okay, we can just keep retrying this at least. <laughs> just exploded like a balloon and just popped. <laughs> They're really good lasers. They're really good lasers. They do their job really well. Okay, how am I gonna get past this? Hmm. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, like that. Meow. Hells yeah. I don't know what that did, but I did it. I got it now. Something good, presumably. Early experiments with the K series of parasite subjects have been steeped in difficulty, but I believe we are on the verge of a breakthrough. It was a long held theory among our researchers that the key to creating more powerful variants was to infect subjects for earlier in their life cycles, far earlier in their life cycle providing the parasite more time to naturali naturally mature and synthesize with its host. At this juncture, a confession must be made. Many years ago, Ocean made the decision to circumvent standard protocols and inject the parasite into a new recruit. Is that me? Is it me? It might be you. The corporation then proceeded to invest in a carefully orchestrated educational and career path that would enable... What a nerd. A nerd wrote this. <laughs> orchestrated educational and career path... Well, I mean, Olsen wrote this, probably. So yeah. like I said, a dork, a nerd. <laughs> and a carefully orchestrated educational career path that would enable us to harvest for decades. It's, it's Olsen. It's with the hope of creating yeah. a specimen that would function not merely as a soldier, but as a leader. For the next two years, the board has approved us to prepare for a simulation that will put all of our theories about Subject K to the test, as well as gather new data on our existing variants as well. Wow. 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 <laughs> I have to get through okay, again. I have to get back across this. <laughs> oh, come Easy. The on. <laughs> this one actually looks like it might be easier. No, it's not because the one in the middle is slower. Yeah. <laughs> oh, boy. This game's hard. Boom, 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 boom. Here I come, me. Ah, oh, there they are. Clones of me self, but it would seem that something set me <laughs> apart from the others. Oh. Oh, like a final boss. <laughs> yeah. Something that enabled me to become an abomination. We have ourself as a... Oh. Here they come. She... Okay. Oh. Yeah, you got hit anyway. <laughs> what a dork. What a dork. Hmm. Not taking a lot of damage. <laughs> She's doing a little bit of a Wesker. Doing a little bit of a Wesker. What am I? I can't do anything about that. Didn't do very much damage though. Yeah, I have, I have, <laughs> her name's Catherine X. <laughs> yeah, it is. Yeah. No, don't. No, quit it. Ow. Yeah. You're cutting the flash steps a little late there, lady. A little late there, lady. Also, I'm kind of kicking the shit out of you. <laughs> when are you going to send like 15 zombie versions of myself at me? I'm sure she's gonna have a second form where she's harder or something. She's Probably. barely doing any damage. Probably. Okay, bye. <laughs> yeah, I wonder, whenever they like do this jump or disappear, it's like, wow, where'd they go? Maybe behind me, I bet. <laughs> It'd be funny if she went up and you like 
spun around, but she just landed in the exact same spot she was in. <laughs> She'd have fooled me. Get f***ed. Bang. Ring. What are you gonna do about it? There, I defeated Genova. <laughs> I'm not some toy in a tank director. I'm alive. I'm a human being, and I'm heavily f***ing armed. Yeah. Kick. Well, she's dead. Kick. Forever. <laughs> you gotta make sure you kick them at least twice so that you make sure they're dead, like in Silent Hill. Gotta give them a good couple. Otherwise, they'll waggle around and get back up. I'm about to run out of goddamn time. Yeah. Why'd you make me go back to this bomb thing time? <laughs> I needed those 10 seconds or whatever. I know you can hear me, you piece of heck. You're going to pay for what you've done to me or to all of us. Somehow, some way, we're going home. All of us, we're all gonna share our families. <laughs> the locker opens. The locker opens. Oh, so many lunches. Uh, is there anything this way? Is this even worth it? Do I have one minute. Uh. Get me out of here. Some controls contradict the immensity of the platform and the journey. Whoever wrote this game's a nerd. <laughs> Start elevator? Yes. No, see, it's because you're doing it from her perspective and she's a nerd. The elevator should take like over a minute. Oh, yep, yeah, there she is. Yeah, but you'd be a better version of the person I spent a lifetime becoming. I hope you believe it. Ellipses, because I'm a million times worse than you'll ever be. <laughs> oh. Nailed well, it. You did it. You're cool. No, she doesn't have the weak points now, but no, she's, she's taking, taking a ton lot of, of damage. damage. From. <laughs> she still doesn't do very much damage. She's a dweeb. What a dweeb. Everybody laugh. <laughs> what is happening right now? I don't know. <laughs> oh, okay. She's healing a whole bunch. Well, that's annoying. What a jerk. What a jerk. Okay, so you can't hurt her when she's down like that, it looks like. Yep. What? I'm gonna run out of time! What the heck? I ran out of time. This is what the f am I supposed to do about this? Yeah. She just heals. I didn't say unless you hit her with the grenade launcher when she's doing that, maybe. Well, I just ran out of time, so. Yeah. Uh, save wiped. Start over, idiot. <laughs> okay, here I am getting that fight again. If it wasn't for the heckin', I guess it has to be the grenade launcher because. What the hell? Oops. Yeah, none of the other. I no. almost started it by accident. <laughs> the game. That's amazing. Because I was gonna say, like, maybe if I took the Magnum, but I don't have the Magnum anymore. So. Yeah, we don't have the Magnum, so it's gotta be the grenade launcher, right? Gotta be the grenade launcher. Also, what's the point? Oops. Never mind, uh, Captain. I was gonna steal this key, I want you to know that. I chose <laughs> not to, though, so you can trust me. And then I did it anyway. Yeah, but now he thinks somebody else did it, because why would I say I was going to then didn't if I just did it anyway? <laughs> so you gotta think like a thief time. <laughs> Get off me. No. <laughs> Just point blank. <laughs> yeah, that was a lot faster. <laughs> I did the no more zombie button. No more zombies. No more zombies. They're gone now. They no longer exist. You can't even find a trace of them. They're gone forever. <laughs> Get obliterated and don't heal, please. Okay, They're so gonna great. heal, but whatever. Bleh! Nerd. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> what? She healed anyway! Uh, come on! <laughs> well, I guess that's the time I'm doing real damage to her. Yeah, maybe. So she has to do it like three times. This reminds me of when you fight Mr. X at the end of the <laughs> RE2 remake, everybody. Do you remember classic video game? She has a second one of the things on like her leg when she's in that second state. Can you hit her with the grenade launcher again when she's like that? I mean, I guess I can try. What else am I doing? I may as well. Yeah. Yeah, there no, we go. No. She dead forever. She dead forever. 
<laughs> oh no, goodbye. Whoa. And then she hit the third rail, and she was like, oh no, this is my one weakness, the third rail. <laughs> Impressive, I say with my eyes closed, turning my back to you like an anime protagonist. <laughs> I hope you have a final card to play, Director. It would be a shame for you to fall just short of all your hopes and dreams. Are you trying Nailed to think of a one-liner? <laughs> she was trying to think of a one-liner. Is it because the thing fell off the edge to fall? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I wanted to look over there, but okay. No more secrets, no more hiding. And then a million turrets come out of the ceiling. You have nowhere left to run, Director. The floor just turns into mines. <laughs> And I'm in no mood to renegotiate. Goodbye. Never mind. Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> on the other side of the door, directly, like, we're, what? It keeps opening and closing. What's going on? Why does she keep doing this? Oh, I think this was defective. This was defective. <laughs> oh my god. You can tell that was the bad guy one because it has a red shirt. <laughs> Director, we meet at last. No, and there's a scar across <laughs> the eye. That's a cool scar. <laughs> no, Catherine, <laughs> we've met before. No, we didn't. I would have remembered that, scar me. <laughs> you disappoint me. You are our finest creation, my one true daughter. When extinction threatened humanity, you would have been the phoenix that rose from the ashes. You would have kept uh -huh. the peace in a world of unimaginable despair. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. I am not the director, but I am his instrument. My goal was to destroy you before our paths cross your series could be preserved, so that the Ares Project could continue. Sadly, that is no longer a possibility. Unlike the others, your memory cannot be erased, and no doubt this meeting is precisely what the <laughs> intended. <laughs> It knows I have to kill you. It knows you stand no chance against me. It knows that the dismantling of Ares will lead to the merciful end it seeks, but let me ask you this. Did you really believe the <laughs> was your ally? It is a custodian. It has no meaning. It controls nothing but gears and levers, switches and screens, mechanisms, and whatever else goes with mecha. <laughs> Crates, evidently. I was just about to say and that it squishes her from off screen. <laughs> I wish it was an anvil. I also wish <laughs> it, either an anvil or like a big plate like you got squished by and the like the wall just like goes past and squishes her. Or a piano would have worked too. A piano would have been nice. <laughs> and if I know the by now, it will have provided me with precisely what I need. A mech suit. Oh. The oh. Iden 6A laser cannon. Okay. What happened to us was wrong. We were captured, cloned, brainwashed. And yet, no matter how much I crave revenge, I find myself looking forward to a life in which violence is no longer the answer to all of my problems. <laughs> no. I cannot change who I am, but I can change who I will become. And I'll kill every single person, colleague, or hecked up version of myself who stands in my way. <laughs> You begin, huh? Dork. Oh, blast. get get lasered. I was expecting it to be a big beam, but I guess it's more of a <laughs> plasma blaster. But I also was expecting it to be. Well, she's gone. There, I killed it. Why do they need <laughs> zombies when they have this kind of weapon? <laughs> if this is one of those other two pro projects, um, I think maybe they should go with that one instead of this one. They slash the fundings around the same time they slash my eye, says Evil Catherine, with the finger just <laughs> underneath the crate pointing up to clarify. <laughs> now, where is the director? <laughs> you, 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 she has to sit here with her eyes closed, trying to think of another one liner. Um, <laughs> <laughs> Something with lasers. Some, mm -hmm. I've never had to think of one with lasers. I, this is the first time I tried, honestly. Bing. Bing bong. And then somebody at the top of the elevator just snips it with like scissors the cord. It's like, got her. <laughs> I did it. I uh, defeated her. Whoa. Oh, hi. Hello. Watch me. Oh, okay. <laughs> you did it. You think that the director would have seen that coming? I guess <laughs> yeah. all the cameras were off for some reason. 
I guess. It should have been with the laser gun so that he exploded. It should have been with the laser gun so that he exploded. We never even got to see who the director man was. Or lady, I don't know. I guess... They're not really like a character we would have known, I suppose? <laughs> what? How does the ghost thing come into this? Ghost thing? Oh, uh... The, the ghost. Uh, it was simulation, I guess. It was fake holograms. Holograms, none of I that guess. was real. It was all just a fake mission that they were making us do as a test, <laughs> as an experiment. So it was... It, there's... They were... It literally was just a projector, like, off-camera doing it. <laughs> I guess. If the whole, like... They, they must have had, like, secret projectors somewhere, I suppose. <laughs> I guess this also explains the whole... <laughs> the, the lightning just turning on and then turning off when we got the thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> they literally just flipped a switch and turned it on and off. <laughs> the spider was probably one of the other branches doing their thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> It is kind of, it is like, an, is this like actually an Evanescence song or is it just kind of like it? I haven't heard Evanescence in a long time. I don't think it is. I don't think it's actually Evanescence. I'm pretty sure it's not. From what I remember, uh, the only Evanescence song I remember is th that one. Remember that one song that everyone knows? That one song? <laughs> that one song, yeah. Yeah, that one song. <laughs> that was a pretty good game. Yeah, that was pretty cool. This was made in Unity, everybody. Yeah, I wonder uh, what the other endings would be then. This is probably the true ending, because, I mean, I can't see how much more true it could be. I guess you got the firewall thing. I don't know what would happen without that, though. Um, maybe if you beat it with nobody dying? Maybe. I mean, that doesn't, that doesn't seem possible. There's like, in order to get the firewall down, whoever goes down there has to die to the gas. Yeah, unless there's like an ending if you just complete it regularly without anybody dying and then they're like, oh, the 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 project was a success or whatever ending. OK, well, I just looked it up. The only endings in the game are the ones that we got. You try to escape the mansion and then you hit the wall. And then if you did stuff right, which is look at the chessboard as a certain character and uh, do the whole disable the firewall thing as the nerd. Then you'll have the information you need to do the extra stuff with the secret lab and the headquarters. So we did it. We got the true ending, everybody. Yeah. Man, this game's easy and for babies. <laughs> I only had to use one K one coin. K coin? Yeah. One K coin. That's pretty good. Pretty good. I wonder if they're going to make another one of these. That'd be neat. I don't know what they do. Well, they could just do like, I don't know, just set it somewhere else and do another homage <laughs> or something. I just like the little system they have where it goes into first person for the fighting and then you run around like old school Resident Evil or whatever, like top down yeah. Azimars. I guess you could do like one of those other two projects they mentioned and have it be like Silent Hill or something instead. Maybe. Assuming those two projects weren't the spider and whatever the other thing was. Yeah, the, the laser rifle. <laughs> the laser rifle, yeah. The laser rifle is getting all the funding <laughs> from what I could tell. <laughs> that one's working real well. <laughs> Oh, they should have let you unlock that as like a bonus for beating the game with a true ending. You just oh, play the game with it. Yeah, you can just play the game with it. That'd be cool. I'm going to real quick just jump in real quick, see where it puts me. See if it did actually unlock that as a thing you can have. It doesn't look like it. Nah, boo. No, all right. Well, next time, whatever we play, next time on video games. Yeah, next time. Uh...